Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Hello everyone, hope you're well and having a lovely weekend. I'm here to tell you about my Monday morning's kit hours. At nine o'clock, by popular demand, we've put together some incredible flat kiss cross kits. And I'm going to be demonstrating just how simple and effective this little technique is to produce the most beautiful, beautiful bracelets. And at 12 o'clock, another one of my favorite techniques, the herringbone using many gauges of wire. Some of the gemstones you will not believe that we have in kits, they're just phenomenal. So that's this Monday, the 30th of January. Join myself, L, Dross, and the team from eight o'clock for what I think is gonna be the most incredible way to start your week. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Your mic's alive and you're in vision. And you're in vision. That's us now for five hours. <sighs> I was only saying to one of the team behind the scenes, I was like, oh, this morning I was like, struggled to get out of bed. When oh. I did get out of bed, I was like, you were just gone. You I've been like that slow. through the whole of January, to be fair. Yes. It's just... It must be the months. Yeah. But as soon as we're here and we're sat down and we're in vision, it's all good, That's isn't it? it? Yes, it's the smoke and mirrors. It, yeah, it, yeah, but you disconnect as well, you do, don't completely. you? Completely. Totally disconnect. You have yeah, yeah. five hours of just joy with wonderful Mark. Good morning again. Yes. Amazing. Did you have a good weekend? I had a lovely weekend, a very good. productive weekend. Yeah, we had a very busy weekend. Did you? Which is nice. We do? don't normally do very much. Well, so Friday, I had the dentist in the afternoon, uh -huh. and then we visited Andrew's sister, Helen. Nice. She made us the most amazing curry. Never had a homemade curry before. Have it was you? amazing. I'm not, I'm not a fan of curries. Oh, yeah. I've never been to a curry house for a meal. I know, uh, for an Indian meal. And then Saturday, we did all the chores and shopping, and then in the evening, a work colleague of Andrew's is in a local operatic Amdram. Wow. And we went to watch their production of Evita. Was it good? Which was the most incredible thing we've ever seen. And it warrants any West End stage. It was phenomenal. Oh, where it is this? So in, 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 in Oxford? In Oxford, in the, in the Oxford Playhouse. Oh, so yeah. worth, it was, worth it was just It was just, uh, just a week run, but it was, it was absolutely amazing. And then, and then yesterday we did a 15 mile walk. Which lovely. Was lovely. That just sounds what we very nice. So yeah, perfect. All good. That's all good. I, had, yeah. I, I can't remember. Friday, what did I do Friday? Not a great deal Friday. I think it was very much all children yeah, based. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Saturday I did all the... The housekeeping, the if you stuff, like, yeah, the, yeah, the, the, yeah. The, the, the admin for the house. 
And Sunday I was down at my par my mum's house. Mm. I sorted that out because, uh, um, yeah, lots of things to sort out there. So, But I was up really early down there, 8 o'clock in Amazing. Wales. It's a good hour and a half drive. Yeah. Wow. Got it all done, back home for lunch. Amazing. So, glass of wine? Gla no, I didn't actually. Didn't, no, we didn't have wine yesterday either. Didn't have wine no. all weekend. No. Oh. It's a bit disappointing, isn't that? Actually? No. So it would have been a perfect weekend if we I had, had Christmas wine. dinner pie yesterday for Whoa. supper. Yeah. Um, Lovely. Friends of ours, uh, a friend of ours, she's she makes the most unbelievable curries. And um, a couple of weeks ago, we popped up to see her. We, we normally do it before Christmas, but didn't get the mm. chance. So the girls always call her their their fairy godmother, which oh. um, is very <laughs> sweet. And uh, yeah, she makes the most amazing uh, samosas and the most oh, yeah, unbelievable lamb curry. Beautiful. So when you go, yeah. she's one of those that like here you go. She literally put it in the freezer for when you want it. So we're actually going to have that this week. Oh, good. No, it was, it was absolutely. Curry. Lovely, it was so delicious. and they've been doing dry January, so we had non non alcoholic beers and wines. It made a really nice change, actually. Yes, it's lovely. So you're not really fuzzy nice. headed, no, are no, you? No, then, no. Um, what an amazing Monday morning show! Yeah, well, I did, I, you probably just saw my VT before we went live here. I was gonna say, what an amazing way to start the week! It's and, incredible. And so, this began, didn't it, on show last week? And we, yes. you kind of said, I'm gonna do this. Well, I asked, I cheekily on. asked if I could. Well, it's a team. It was a team effort, wasn't it? it you sort of, you sort of discreetly passed it over, and yeah. I said thanks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this, yes, but if we hadn't have done no, that, no, then exactly. this bracelet yes. wouldn't have come into yes. fruition. No, absolutely. Um, no. Now, no. those of you that were with Mark and I when we launched that zircon yeah, strand stunning, wasn't which it? It was absolutely so flew on the original launch mm. mark you there suggest it there it yeah. is here yeah. it is mark you said i'm going to turn that into this amazing technique um and you've done it yeah. um it couldn't be more beautiful I'm, I'm so pleased with it the way it's turned out now i'm really, uh, really so what, what time are we doing this nine o'clock nine o'clock yes, we yeah. do have the last remaining quantity um now, it was meant to be, let me explain. This was meant to be, the remaining quantity was meant to go towards the birthday. But because uh, that discussion that we had... I think we sold out, didn't we, last week? And lots of people missed out. Well, so, we've so, got, yeah, we've got yeah. quantity that was reserved originally for the birthday. Yeah. Well, we're bringing it, including it in today's show because right. of that conversation. So, Amazing. yeah, truly incredible, this piece of jewellery. Um, so, yes, the list, where, where it crosses, you said... Yes, yeah, so we, we could, so where the you see the zircon on the bracelet here. So the kiss, I've used the um, the zircon, and then for the crosses, we've used the seed beads that you get in the kit as well. So I've incorporated one of the kits in the nine o'clock with the strand of zircon. Amazing. And it's just, so you can see it's it's laden all the way around. Oh, with, with Mark. The, so with the gold, the black, and the zircon, it's just absolutely perfect. Stunning. And you and you've got you've got bicones left over. Masses of CBs and Zircon left over as well. So. Well, these kits are coming up at nine o'clock. Can we have that Zircon if you weren't able to uh, get involved? We've got 250 at the most unbelievable, amazing price point. Also, your deal of the day today is a gemstone we, we rarely ever, ever, ever see. Um, widely regarded as the most feminine gemstone on the planet, and that is, I'm just looking around to find it. Where is it, where is it, where is it? Um, we can show you on, on the TV screens instead. Um, it's Kunzite. Now, I don't get to the chance to talk right. about Kunzite very often. Um, oh my goodness me, these are absolutely incredible. The quality, the cutting, the cutting is just um, amazing. So these are coming up at 10 o'clock today. Um, Kunzite, we've also got some last remaining quantities of some of the lovely jades. Um, we've got white jade in some of the bigger sizes to bring you as well. Um, we've actually got a selection of hematite. Oh, amazing. I love yes. hematite. Yeah, yes. brand new as well. I've, um, um, I've asked for to get a special sort of hematite for a show later on in Have the you? year because I've never seen it on the show and that's red hematite. Ooh. So um well, I've, naturally red. Yeah, I've sent I've sent Wayne on a mission to try and find it for the so show. So that I assume yeah. would be non-polished because mm -hmm. yeah. in its natural form it's never red. seen it on here in its no, natural state true. before. No, that's true. So we're that's gonna try really and find true. that for us. Like amazing. amazing, watch yeah. this space. Wayne is literally in India as we speak. With Georgia. With Georgia. I've given yeah. Georgia a huge shopping list. Have you? Have you? Do you know, yeah. it's funny because just before, when I saw them, what day was it? On Thursday. Um, I was like, oh, yes, 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 you're off to India. Um, I was like, it's not jolly, though, is it? And he's like, not at all. It's really hard work. Yeah, it is. I, it is. I, I hope yeah. Georgia really knows what she's got in store. It is yeah. hard work, yeah. in fairness yeah. to them. 
else is going, I bet it is really hard work. <laughs> no, it is. And also, I know the Gems team, they're, on, uh, they're in Tucson yeah, as they're we all speak. Around, Again, yes, it's, yeah. it's hard work. I mean, you, you know firsthand, yeah. you were there last it's, year. It's exhausting. It's literally exhausting because from the moment that you get up to the moment you go to sleep, it is literally rum, zum, zum. You must have done thousands of steps yes. during that week. Yes. Definitely, but it's all good fun. Mm. Um, and of course, their ambition is to make sure that they get the most unbelievable opportunities and purchases Absolutely. for yeah. you guys at home. Right, shall we get cracking? Shall we get cracking with what will be an absolutely amazing show? A feast of goodies. Do get uh, texting. Come and say hello to Mark and I. We would love to yes. hear from you this morning. Yes. Um, shall we start with, speaking of Zircon, Oh, this is the other Zircon. Yes, it, it was. Yeah, oh, this the is other. amazing. I like it. This is beautiful. That would also look absolutely amazing would, with your nine o'clock kits. Yep. Those bracelets, unbelievable. Abs so this would work with those, wouldn't it? It would. No, absolutely. So, so where you would use an eight o? Oh. You replace it with one of these uh, little two mil faceted. That'd be incredible. Oh my goodness! Even it would. more sparkle. It would. Now, there's only 10 of these. It is very limited, so you do need to be quite quick. Um, Zircon comes in a multitude of beautiful colours. Um, you're looking at an entire wow. strand of parcel, if you will, um, of those beautiful warm yellow stroke reds. You've got red Zircon in here, which is incredibly, incredibly rare. Uh, beautiful faceted two millimetre rounds, of course, full of that fire and scintillation that we discussed only last week, um, as it is obviously a doubly refracted gemstone. Even here, if we were to stop here at 99.99, I think most of us would agree that's an absolutely incredible price point. Remember, this is lounge hour. Oh, yes, well reminded, Ross. You have until the top of the hour to make your confirmations and then they will literally disappear from the website. Um, so if you see something that your heart desires, then make sure you check them out nice and early to avoid disappointment. Um, with that, though, we do bring them to you at the most unbelievable price point. Um, there was only ever 50 of these ever brought to air. We've got the final literally few. There's eight. There's eight within the vault. Um, and if you're lucky enough to actually have this at home already, then <coughs> you'll, uh, you'll agree. It's one of the most beautiful strands you could possibly wish for. Um, let's do it. Richard, straight away, you're in there. Congratulations, darling. Um, how lovely would this be on tassels? And Mark's amazing demonstration that he's going to show you in the nine o'clock uh, nine o'clock hour. I've got five left. That's it. Twenty nine ninety nine for f a full parcel. Wow. Plus, we're sourcing from the best location of source. You know, Cambodian Zircon is widely regarded as the best in the world. It's full of scintillation. Um, we spoke about how how uh, how the, the quality of the faceting is it absolutely imperative. Well done. I'll leave those final few with me uh, with you. Shall we do a beautiful Beautiful. Oh, he's nice. I haven't seen him before. We've never had him. Has he been on with Carol, is it? Look at the start price, though. What? It's sterling silver. <laughs> oh, I look at this as a, as a panther. Oh, he's cute, isn't he? Also, a little bit of, um, I can see the Lion King vibe. He's beautiful, isn't he? And actually, you know, quite a lot of the, so I, I'm no expert on this at all, but if you look at kind of the, the Maasai mm. drawings and the art, um, then it's quite similar, isn't it? They do that dotting, um, uh, dotting quite a lot. Yeah, it's beautiful. All solid sterling silver. We're starting at 7 99 but we're not stopping there. We're going to take it under £5 for you. How many have I got then, Roscoe? 20 of these available. It's a big amount of your sterling silver. 180 of these were initially launched and they absolutely flew. Oh, 4.99. Oh Goodness me. For all that sterling silver, you would, you'd assume at that price point that it would actually be yeah. a base metal, wouldn't you? Um, over two grams of precious metal you're getting here. So again, do make sure you check out those baskets, everybody. Um, beautiful, beautiful quality. I love that oxidized effect. It literally creates a contrast, doesn't it? And again, it's definitely got that kind of, yeah. well, you've got the Maasai vibe, I suppose. It's quite a masculine like look this. as well, isn't it? Yeah. For the gents. I'm thinking back to your lovely macrame bracelets. Mm. We're doing macrame at 12. So if you get oh, hold good. of this yeah. and stay tuned, Mark can show you how to turn this into a lovely piece of jewellery. Good morning, Nikki. Morning. Uh, hi, El Mark and Fab JM team. So excited about burning the flat. Uh, learning, sorry. <laughs> burning. <laughs> but not burning. <laughs> learning the flat kiss cross. You have been excited, Nikki. Mm. I, I understand you had a conversation with yes. Nikki about this yeah, as well, didn't yeah. you? So that's exciting, Nikki. Not too long to wait, yeah. darling. It's happening in the next hour. Hello, Liz saying gorgeous designs, Mark. Very 1920s. I love it. 
Oh, they are beautiful. I can't choose a favorite. That, that, that speaks volumes, actually. When I'm looking across Mark's designs, I actually would struggle to choose a favorite. Mm, they're all beautiful. And they're so, so, so simple as well. Plus, you've got pretty much yeah. everything that you need, haven't everything, you? Everything, including thread. I mean, when was the last time we had thread in a kit? Precisely. And you've got clasps and everything. Yeah. Precisely. And I know some of our uh, viewers have been asking for the thread. Yeah. Um, okay, what, sorry? Cubic scone class. Ooh! Wow. Statement, isn't it? Ooh, that's it's quite a... Alexander McQueen, I thought, when I saw it earlier. Yes! That's immense. <laughs> Gosh, that's beautiful. Look at that. It's only ever been on air once. Oh, high end. Oh. Looks like, a, looks like a question mark, doesn't it? It does. <laughs> really clever as well, because it does lock into place. I don't know if you can see that there. It locks Look into place, so really strong and secure. You almost think it, w it wouldn't be. Yeah, by, I like love this. That. But it is locked into place. Uh, 9.99. Oh, I'm going to be getting some of these if there's any of them available. How oh. amazing is that? So it's a base metal and you're getting this. If this was sterling silver, it'd be more of an investment because it's quite a lot of metal yeah. weight here. The zinc doesn't tarnish. No. So that, that's, that's a good point. That's beautiful. What I would do is I would, I would cut, you see the little cross frame that you attach all your threads or cords to at the top? I would cut them out, that little cross. I'd cut it out yeah. and then I would use it as a kumihimo. Oh, so glue it into place. Cap and glue it into place. That's a yeah. good idea. They're actually multi-use, aren't they? Mm. As if there is a clock ticking away. How many have we got then, Roscoe? 40 oh. available, and it is parve set literally in its entirety. It is, so you've yeah. got it all the way around, full of sparkle. I mean, how lovely would this be? Speaking 1920s, Liz, on a long line necklace. Shall we see who's watching, Mark? Mm. Shall we? Shall we do a nice little early bird deal? 12 seconds, it's going even lower than an already amazing price point, I think. I'm all That's over amazing. this. It's my kind of style. And the fact that you can literally create multi layers. Absolutely. Yeah. I'd get two of these and use the top section as um, tassel toppers. Nice. That look really cool. Yeah, that would be lovely. Yeah. They don't have to be. This is the joy of being a jewellery maker and an amazing designer that you are, Mark, is that you look out, you think outside the box, four ninety nine. dollars So you'd get two, wouldn't you? Yeah. Without a doubt. Definitely. So I love that question mark. I think that's so clever. It's going to be, I'm going to say it's probably one of my favourite clasps. Mm. I'd like to see this in your silver and also in your in in maybe gold. How lovely would oh, this yeah. be in gold too? It wouldn't be five pounds though. Four ninety nine only. These will be a sellout. Tracy, Susan, well done to you. Nancy, Helen, well done to you. Uh, South Yorkshire, West Midlands, Yvette, Mary, Kathy, Beryl, hello to you. New customers getting involved. Lots of multi buyers. So that forty is not hanging around at all. Remember, you only have until nine o'clock to make your confirmations. Um, if you're wondering how you can shop ahead, because you can, if you go all the at jewelrymaker.com, uh, uh, click watch live, um, and you'll see all the deals literally loaded. But some of them will be going lower, as you can see, some of them are already selling out. Um, if you want to, uh, Mark and I to bring something to air, then do drop us a message into the studio. We can do that for you. Gosh, those Burmese rubies, uh, they're not 99 pounds. They go to an unbelievable price point. So make sure you do check them out. So many multi-buyers getting involved. Got the butterfly um, bicone storage, snaffle that for nine o'clock. The, the, the one thing I wanted to see, which I can see it sparkling away, is sold out. Which one's that? Those rondelles. Oh, I know, yeah, they are beautiful, aren't they? Yeah, really lovely. What are you doing, Ross? Uh, 30 <laughs> seconds, we're going again. I mean, uh, surely they've almost sold out anyway. Can I have a look at those? Of course you can. Very Ross, yes. They've can't sold they? out. They have oh sold out. God, look at them. Um, well over half the stock has gone, says Ross in my ear. Four pounds and ninety-nine pence, but we'll go even lower. Kathy says I'll have four, thank you very much. Nancy says I'll have three, so does Beryl. Uh, Mary's just got three, well done. Shouldn't really do this, but mm, yeah, they're away, aren't they? <laughs> Wait, Wayne's away, he's on holiday. And also, Ross says, if I can give you a bit of a saving, I always will. 3 99 <laughs> 3 pounds and 99 pence. That's an absolute steal, isn't it? I mean, imagine multi-layers of, say, pearls mm, and yeah, maybe absolutely. some black jadeite or with your, uh, the techniques. You don't have to. No. Um, you don't have to incorporate a weave. You could literally have maybe your kits literally multi-stranded. Yeah, absolutely. Would it work with your bracelets in the nine o'clock hour? Um, it would if we did the tubular kiss cross. Uh-huh. That would look amazing with that finishing off with that. 
That'd look incredible, oh, wouldn't it? Kiss cross necklace with yeah. that in the centre. How beautiful would that be? And there are a ton of you there. Good mm. morning, everybody. I hope you're all well. Really excited about this morning's show. Um, amazing. I'll leave that with you because it is flying out the door. Um, let's now do the what? Herkimer. This has got to be the biggest Herkimer corpse. Look at, that. look at the size on those. <laughs> I think you need a big size, don't you, to see all of the inclusions in this? I, like, I, I love the fact that it's doubly terminated, so you actually Come see out. that there's also almost prism points, don't you, at either end. Fascinating gemstone, often referred to as Herkimer Diamond, um, because of its distinct similarities. I've got 30 available opportunities. Whenever we bring this to air, it sells out very, very fast. Uh, Herkimer diamonds, as you will probably find elsewhere, it referred to as, are not actually diamonds at all. They're a form of double terminated quartz crystal uh, that began forming 500 million years ago in a dolomite outcrop throughout Herkimer County, New York, uh, and the Mohawk River Valley. These crystals were discovered in the 18th century and given the diamond nickname because of their their exceptional clarity and natural faceting. You get these really beautiful sort of monochrome visions inside this gemstone. Again, Mark, I'm thinking with mm. your nine o'clock kits. Amazing, wasn't it? Beautiful. Amazing. So these, are, this is double termination. You can see the facets are on are on either end. Um, they can have the most pristine eye clean clarity in these little flecks of carbon. What's carbon? Or Diamond, gemstone diamonds, yeah, there you yeah. go. Um, so you're getting these wonderful little carbon flecks within the gemstone itself. Big carat weight from the original location of discovery from USA, literally in uh, um, New York City. How low can we go, Ross? Oh, that's low. That's a big carrot weight for them as well. We're under 20 pounds. Um, I always say it every time that I get the chance, the opportunity to talk about Herkimer, um, is that it reminds me of the New York skyline. It does. No, you're right, actually. You've I'm just fascinated by the fact that that's all done naturally. Naturally. I think that's incredible. Do you reckon that something like this was, was what gave the people inspiration to start faceting gems? Maybe. To see Maybe. How, it, how it looks naturally in the wild. Yeah. Because if you look at quartz normally, mm. it's got that kind of prismatic appearance, yeah. but yeah. Herkimer quartz has got it at either end. It's just, it, it, it's absolutely beautiful. Very striking. The clock is ticking, suggesting that we're going even lower. How many have we got then? Remember that you have just until nine o'clock to make your confirmations. Um, or until stocks last, probably being the reality. I get it really simple. You could take these and put them in amongst maybe some pearls. They'd be lovely oh, in amongst some black colors. gemstones. Yeah, incredible. Even at the mine, yes, mm. they call it the Herkimer Diamond Mine. That's literally one of the mines where you source this amazing gemstone. Look at the photograph you can see on that billboard. Um, yeah, it's, it's fascinating, absolutely fascinating. Yeah, you can see some of those carbon um, inclusions within. Nobody is paying under £20. In fact, yeah, Adele wearing her yeah. diamonds. <laughs> there she is, looking fabulous. Twelve ninety nine. Oh, is that the interview with Oprah? Yeah. Yes, I thought so. Yeah. I thought so. Twelve ninety nine only to get hold of this beautiful gemstone. Um, it is amazing. It's fascinating. You can get some lovely jewellery, um, but it's expensive. It is expensive. There oh. it is. You can actually see um, Adele wearing some very sizable Herkimer, um, Herkimer diamonds. You could make something very similar, couldn't you? Take inspiration from her uh, lovely pieces of jewellery. Always, always very, very popular. Um, and I can tell you the call screens reflect that as well. Valentina, Mary, Yvette, hello to you, West Midland, Susan and Brian, Leslie, Tyne and Ware, Molly, hello to you, Hansa, Lisa, Helen, hello to you, West Midlands, Christine, nice to see you as well. £12.99 pence only for one of the biggest carrot weights that we've ever, surely ever done for, with her. I think so. Because Definitely normally it's much smaller, isn't it? Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I think they'd be, uh, cool. they'd be called tumbles, wouldn't they, if they were smooth? But yeah. I don't think you can call a faceted stone a tumble, can you really? I don't think so, yeah. no. Because a tumbles kind of suggests alluvial, doesn't it? Yes. Where it's kind of been... That's a good word. Alluvial. Alluvial. Where it's kind yeah. of been ever so yeah. gently sort of... Mm. Uh, Facet or smoothed smooth, out by yeah. the by, by tumbling yeah. water. Right, um, but look, this is like dynamic, isn't it? It's it's angular. <laughs> That's alluvial mining, yes. Where you can panning, yeah, is is a type of alluvial mining, yeah. It's I mean, yeah. You you can actually mine this gemstone, by the way. You can go and pay for um, to mine the gemstone itself, but it's not as simple as just turning up. 
<laughs> Not quite that simple. Um, yeah, look, you can actually see here they've got sort of health and safety on the billboard itself. Be safe, look around, select porous rocks. The mine closes at five o'clock, so everybody out. You can see them all there, can't yeah, you? Literally yeah. um, mining for this gemstone there. £12.99 only. You'd be there quite a long time, I think, to get a strand like this, especially Absolutely, of this yeah. size. The final few, well done. Tessa, Una, Lorna. I'll leave the final couple there. Well done. Okay, let's do the last oh. of stock. I was hoping you were going to say, oh. There can't be very many left. No, no. <gasps> do you remember? Now, remember oh, the photographs yeah. were the wrong way around on the website. So ignore those. If you, if you dial in now or you use this code, so EWXC29, it's this one here that I actually have in my hand. Oh, yeah, no, not that one. The photographs are uh, 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 the other way. Um, so, yeah, EWXC79 is this bundle, um, which makes sense, rainbow-tastic, oh, doesn't okay. it? Look at those beautiful colours. Yet, yeah, Mark, we don't have many left. It's just as dragonflies to me and mermaids. Oh, and just, just beautiful. I love this Plus, so you much. get the different sizes. Yeah, you get six and eights in the same bundle for the first time, which is, well, I don't think we've ever done that before. It's I don't think so. It's been one solitary size. There are only a single figure oh, quantity, this. though. Right. Mark, you launched this, didn't you, not that long ago? Last week with you, I think it was. Yes. Where does time go, honestly? Yeah. On 17. the 17th. Oh, gosh. There no. you go. 17th, so not that long ago at all. We have literally single figure quantities remaining, so again, it's do make beautiful. sure you check oh. out. Um, it is beautiful. I mean, our gate is beautiful already, but then with that lovely, yeah. mystical, magical coating. You've got all that banding inside that, that, that just comes to life. And then you've got the faceting and then the coating as well. I don't think there's anything else that they can actually do with them. No, <laughs> no, exactly. They're no. perfection, aren't they? No. Um, it's on the verge of selling out. Well done. Yeah, gosh. I'll leave that with you. Let's do you the other. Uh, do, do you the other? Do the other. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, sorry. I thought, oh, this is pretty. I have to say, yeah, I'm a, I'm a big fan of this bundle. I like this it's one. It's just so lot. unusual, isn't it? It's just a spring to me, this it's one. It's pretty. It's yeah. so pretty. Pastels. Yeah. We, don't, we don't do pastels very often. Pretty, pretty. And, and our gates aren't yeah. often in pastels, no. are they? No. Look at the sparkle on that. It's stunning. <laughs> I think it's almost bridal. Mm. No, you're right. With pearls and... Oh, uh, beautiful. So beautiful. Yeah, imagine this just literally re-stranded. It has got a little, uh, I don't know, a vibe of maybe like your blue lace, mm. I think, your blue lace agate. Um, for those of you that maybe um, are a little bit nervous of you know, intense, vibrant colours, then this is a fantastic alternative. Um, yeah, let's go straight down to it. 49.99. you're getting the selection of the sizes as well in this one, aren't we? Yes, that's right. So you is, get that, is that, that is a strand in there that has that sort of mint green undertone that you and I like, didn't we? Was it this one? Yes. It's some, so pretty. Some lights, you get a really beautiful mint green. Very, a soft spearmint, isn't mm. it? It's absolutely stunning. How many do we have then, Ross? Ten okay. left, and straight away we've got people with it in their baskets. It absolutely flew on launch. Uh, £49.99 pence only to get hold of this entire bundle. If you press your option one key on the phone lines, you'll, uh, we can guarantee you at least one anyway. Um, how many strands do we actually get in this eight. bundle? Eight. Eight, yeah. eight strands for £49.99. Mm. Yeah. Um, you've got literally until the top of the hour, until nine o'clock, or in more, uh, more realistic terms, um, until it while stocks last. The other colourway is sold out, so this is the yeah. only one that is actually available right. now. Um, I have to say, it's my favourite. Yeah, you know, I've... Um, Go on. <laughs> when Wayne is in India this week, he's going to try and source, the, again, coated agates, but listen to this, gold, silver, <gasps> bronze, Ooh, copper, nice. hematite, gun metal. Nice. Which we've never done before. That sounds amazing. Oh, this one. Sorry, Ross, I couldn't hear you. That's um, a long strand. That sounds exciting. Mm, mm. That is a long strand. Yeah. I would literally just restrand that. That's amazing. Look at that. There are literally three available. Even the, the barrels have got rings around them. Oh, yeah, they're, they're master carved, aren't they? Oh, yeah, amazing. very unique in their shape. Plus, you get those lovely little four millimetre yeah. uh, rounds in between. I mean, I know they're not, but they almost have that 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 on this recording right now. It's almost uh, got that uh, on neck blue yeah, yeah. Um, colour to it. I know they're not they're not Guatemalan, but you can see that definite bluish undertone. Um, yeah, an element of lavender. Yeah, that's probably what it is. There are only three of these available. It's a full fifty centimetre strand. Once these are gone, they're gone. 
Personally, Mark, I would just wish on that. Absolutely. We were talking about gunmetal earlier. Just pop a little gunmetal 11 0 nice. in between each. Oh, yeah. You, just could do, like, you could do Morse code jewelry with this as well. Oh, Memory yes. wire, that would be really nice as well. Should we do it in one price crash? There are three available. You'll have to be super fast to secure yours. I love this. I can't, we can't obviously guarantee that we'll get this again. We, I think we've, all, we've been completely upfront and said about the current status of jadeite in the world. Gosh. 99 pounds only. You know, and they're not just rounds, are they? You know, you've got that right. wonderful, wonderful detail. Um, whenever you're sort of looking at effectively carved beads, you can expect to pay um, a significantly higher price tag than what's on your screens right now. There are three left in the world. It's not even a 38 centimeter strand. It's a full 50 That's centimeter amazing. strand. So you have got um, a big investment here. Um, straight down to the final two. Well done to those of you that have secured yours. And again, it would go perfectly alongside um, <laughs> alongside many of Mark's kits, actually. So I'm thinking about the Star mm. Garnet, I think I look yeah, lovely with. Gorgeous. I've got yeah. one of those yeah. left, so well done. Okay, let's do another last of stock opportunity on Burmese Ruby. I can't believe we've got any of these left. Do you know what? Since we've started, uh, uh, we started broadcasting back in two, 12 years ago, let's just say that. <laughs> <laughs> was it? Yeah, 2010. Yeah. Um, I don't think we've ever done a, 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 an offer as good as this. Burmese Ruby, widely appreciated and known as one of the most expensive gemstones in the world, the supreme location of source of Ruby, um, plus pretty much mined out. Look at the quality of these. Look at that quality. I'm just going to turn this round so you can actually see. There we are. Put that white background behind. I can guarantee you the best deal I think you've possibly ever seen on Ruby. And, and it is that premium location of source. Why? Because it has the pigeon blood color. It has an amazing uh, sort of secondary bluish light color, uh, an undertone to it. Um, we, I launched these with a great pleasure. They absolutely flew out the door. We've only got the final remaining. How many, do you, what do you say, 70 carats? On launch, we had 327 and we're down to the final <laughs> 17. Honestly, I think in 12 years, this is probably one of the best deals you'll ever see. Yeah. After day, you're not gonna see them again. There's only a final few. Um, well, that price is ridiculous. It is ridiculous. It? Yes. You shouldn't be able to source Burmese Ruby even, even in melee sizes for what we're about to do. And I, and I, I, very, oh, I, sh I shared with you, look, I treated myself, it's not Burmese, I treated myself to a Ruby ring after Willow was born because it's her birthstone. Um, and I love the ring and I knew I could, I didn't get it from our sister channel, I just fell in love with it as a second hand piece of jewellery and I paid £800 for it. The rubies I bought are significantly smaller than what's in this really? parcel, right? Yeah, significantly and not as good a quality. I don't mind saying that to you and it's, it's in 14 karat gold, but I love the design of it and that's why I bought it. Um, honestly, I don't think you're going to get a better deal than what you're about to see right now. If you haven't seen this before, I'm going to show you where it's not closing, and Ross is going to go again. Not where it's closing. I know, I know, I know, I know. This is engagement ring worthy. This is legacy jewellery worthy. You find Burmese ruby of this caliber surrounded in the finest quality diamonds in 18 karat gold. You do. That's the reality. I can't quite believe this parcel is even in existence, to be honest. You buy rubies in individually. You don't, get, you don't get whole parcels like this. I'm putting the white paper behind it so you can really see the, the quality of that color. Um, well done, Richard. Like you, I have bought multiples of these as well. I, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Do you know what? I'll probably sit on them for a while. Literally just get, keep them within. Um, not literally, by the way, but just <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll just keep hold of them for when the girls are a bit older. Hello, Alison. Elle bought two of these, and I'm so pleased uh, to have matched oh. pairs of the larger, amazing wow. colour cut and price. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Alison, because it's all very well and good me getting all excited yeah. about it. But when it comes from a viewer who's watching right now, now I can't believe this genuinely can't believe this oh my word do you know Wayne's there right now I, I doubt he's going to get three carrots of ruby for 12.99 <laughs>
<laughs> he won't. He won't. Yeah, he won't. He won't get uh, Monte Perez. He won't get Indian Ruby, Fisher filled Ruby. Highly, highly unlike. And this isn't Fisher filled. It's just a little bit of heat treatment. So that's pretty much as natural as it comes. In well, it's had millions world. of years of heat treatment. To be fair. Yes. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Twelve ninety nine. Look at the quality mm. of the colour. It's unbelievable. Um, I don't blame you for multi buying. I would too. Absolutely amazing. Jan, Alice, Richard, Susan, Ella, Dawn, Claire, Carmel, Lorna, new customer, Hansa, you're there as well. Um, shall we do some South Sea? I've got 15 available opportunities. You can tell immediately that these are South Sea because of the luster. Um, so these come from the coast of Australia. I guess we're, we're I personally Very wouldn't want that job, knowing no. what, what's in the waters are just no. off Australia. <laughs> um, <laughs> Um, but yeah, their efforts, I tell you what, they absolutely pay off because South Sea Pearls have got the, the, the finest, some of the finest lustre that you can possibly imagine. Can you see those They're there? Is amazing. it a bit too bright? Um, perfect. But notice how sort of mirror-like um, that lustre is. That's incredible. It is incredible. It looks so good against white, actually. Well, you don't I've, see it learned, very often I've learned I've learned this off Charlie. Mm. Charlie mm. says you should check a, you should assess a pearl on a on a right, white background. Right. Use a piece of paper because that's when you see its lovely luster. I love that gold one in the centre. Yeah. I think that's so beautiful. Amazing, okay. amazing. Well, you've actually got your silvers, your golds, and also your pure ivory whites. Now we have closed this amazing parcel of South Seas. Let me just double check: are these half drilled or are they through drilled? Let me see. Uh, through drilled. So you could literally team it alongside maybe some of Mark's kits. I think that would be quite lovely. Uh, maybe with that beautiful Burmese jadeite strand that we had a few moments ago. Now, we have brought these to air at 69.99. It's South Sea Pearls. South Sea Pearls are astonishingly expensive. They're the divas of the pearl world. <laughs> and then we close them at 49.99 in in a close out deal but we're going to push that close out deal even further today because we have final 15 that's not a viable quantity for us to have within the vault they have they've been on air and sold very successfully at 69.99 for the final what is it 24 minutes in this hour we're going to surpass the previous close out deal and go significantly lower uh, you again you don't <laughs> you don't get south sea pearls for 29.99 no. and i'm fairly sure we've shown you a single south sea pearl pendant for triple figures for most jewelry establishments um uh, one nice. at one at 29.99 is amazing ross but you're actually getting 12 of them today um we've surpassed the previous closeout deal just purely because we've only got a couple of them available within the vault that's working out at two pound 40 per sorry uh, yeah that's right isn't it per south sea pearl uh, it, it just ridiculous absolutely ridiculous you know i, I would mold Sorry, £2.50. Yeah. If you multi-bought, you could literally make a South Sea Pearl knotted necklace. Easily, easily. You've got 12 pendants there. Yep. You know, we have some amazing chain deals recently, haven't we? Just, we have. Just one on a chain. Well, we were watching one, we were weren't watching. we? Yeah, absolutely. Watching one the other day, yeah. um, sorry, prior to the yeah. show, actually. One of these on a pendant, absolutely beautiful. There are five left. That's it. Once they're gone, they're gone. And you have got the mixtures of the colours. You've got, it's all down to personal preference, which one. Um, uh, what I mean is, like, the golds aren't necessarily more valuable than the bluish colours or the ivory colours. It's all in the eye of the beholder. South Sea Pearls, mm. though, you can see why they are so celebrated the world over. Um, South Sea, Akoya and Tahitian, they are the three big powerhouse locations really when it comes to pearls and it's easy to understand why. Hello Janine saying, hi Elle, Mark and Fab team. Uh, this is my third purchase of oh. these beautiful pearls. I'm slowly growing my collection for the necklace. Oh my goodness That's me. That's a brilliant way of buying them actually. That's really Are you going to knock them all together, Jan? That sounds... Yes. Oh, South Sea Pearl, full necklace. Can you imagine? Which would be thousands in mm, most places yeah. that's the that, it, it, i'm not exaggerating there you know they would literally be th that would be thousands mm, yeah, of pounds yeah. that piece of jewelry so well done jan very savvy shopping um amazing now the other day we did some closeout deals on jadeite yes and wayne yeah. said get him gone i can hear him <laughs> saying that he does say that get him gone get him gone <laughs> of what We've got 15 left, so we didn't get them gone. <laughs> okay. 
Oh, okay, oh, okay. these weren't there, but... And he's not here, he's not even in the country. No. He's not even in the continent. No, I had to phone him yeah. last minute um, yesterday. Mm. Uh, I was like, Wayne. And then, do you know, it dawns me, I was like, are you in India? <laughs> 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 no, 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 you're phoning me from the lounge, it's all good. So he oh. was waiting to board the, oh, okay. board the right. plane. Oh, that's all right, phew. Just didn't want the phone bill no, at all. No, 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 exactly. <laughs> Um, are you in India yet? No, you're all right. Phone me in Heathrow. Um, yeah, he literally said, get them gone. Get them gone. Did he say that about this strand, though? Oh, this was one of those strands. OK, oh. amazing. Four mils, Mark. Is it just me that's thinking this would be ideal for your next hour? It would be good. It would, actually. Mm. Yeah. Any, any, any four mil. Yeah, because the, the, the kits are, are bicones, but you can use four mil rounds as well. Have with that a, circle a, as well. Let's see if I've got a four mil round. Oh, in 42 minutes, we're going to take four millimetre rounds and 40 carats under 20 pounds. Can you imagine Mark's amazing flat kiss cross bracelet with that zircon using Mark's technique? I think they're, they look like garnets, but they're four mil rounds. So this is what it would... Oh, yeah. Mark, it's so beautiful. Can you imagine... Ah. Uh, That'd be the type mm. of jewellery that you put on for very, very, very special occasions. <laughs> Especially with the Zircon as well that we've got coming up. Um, yeah, yeah, stay tuned. Mark's going to be demonstrating that in the next hour. In four seconds, we are taking 40 carats of four millimetre Burmese jadeite, completely natural, under 20 pounds. Get them gone, says Wayne. Well, this is, that's, this is how you do it. 19 pounds and 99 oh, pence. Word. I love four mil rounds in all gemstones. I just think they're so, uh, if anything, that's the size I buy the most of. Mm. I think they're so elegant. Yeah, yeah, no. And we did, we did the whole kiss cross, didn't we, last yes. week with, with, uh, with lots of four mils. And, and things. you've got a micro kiss cross show coming up, haven't you? Um, did you say? I'm yes, sure. next Friday. Yes. No, Wednesday. Wednesday. Week, week Wednesday, the yeah, 12th. Yeah, not Friday. I was like, am I going right. to miss it? The 8th, the 8th. Not Friday Wednesday coming, the 8th. Yeah. The 8th. So yeah. if you want to do micro kiss cross, get your strand. Yeah. You'll actually have it home then in time, mm. wouldn't you? Yes, and, you the and the Zircon. And So you can you be can making it along with yes. Mark as yes. well. Nineteen ninety nine. There are tons of you there. Well done. I love four mils. I just think they're really elegant. They'd be really nice alongside the South Sea pearls that Adam's just whipped away from us. I like the mix of colours in this strand as well. No, I, really, I said that on purpose. <laughs> you could really ombre this strand. <laughs> yes. It would be lovely. That would be pretty. With the zircon, Mark? Oh, yeah. That zircon is, is so beautiful. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Heaven. Literally mm. heaven right there. Not too long to wait on this beautiful strand. Those of you that might already have it at home, then I do, uh, again, do message into the studio. Share the love of this strand. It's absolutely beautiful. Only a couple of those left. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Well done. Uh, I don't see it. I don't see it. So that's coming up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, beautiful pearls coming up. Type A jade opportunities coming up. Amazing. Shall we do... Um, <laughs> some beautiful Lavakite oh. cabochons. Oh, amazing. Lavakite. I've not seen them in cabochons before. Is that these? Yeah. Yes. Look at those. Ooh. I've never seen Lavakite in cabs before. I don't think I have either. Ooh, look at that one. I love oh, Lavakite. Nice. I, I, well. I You know, yeah. you always feel sorry for your, um, for gemstones like Onyx. Mm. Um, I feel sorry for Lavakite because I always feel like it's overlooked and Labradorite is always Absolutely. the favourite. Yeah, yeah. But I love it. You get oh, very no. similar, uh, very similar uh, qualities to it. Yeah, wonderful phenomena effect. It's just cool. It. Yeah. It's really, really cool. Look at that one there. Can you see I that? I love this as a worktop in oh, the yeah. kitchen. Yeah, you've made it if you've got yeah. a gemstone workshop, haven't you? <laughs> and then and then if it was in our house, you'd have Tom literally slicing bread directly oh, on it. Oh, what no. are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Not on the gemstones. Sorry. Um, there's 60 available opportunities. Um, you don't just get the two that I'm holding. As you can see, you get a mixed, uh, um, a parcel of mixed shapes as well and sizes, 140 carats in total. Mm. Lovely selection of, uh, of cuts. 
We're going to half that price no, point. Really? I don't think I've seen lava no, kite I've in never. cabochons. I like the flatness of them as well. Yeah, they're quite shallow. Does yeah, that help you as a jewellery maker? I, I just love the shape. If, if you're wire wrapping and wire weaving and all that sort of thing around cabochons, the, the, uh, the, the, the flatter they are, the easier they are to to contain to within grip. the grip, absolutely. Yeah. Perfect. No, oh, goodness me. That's not half price, oh, no. Ross. <laughs> I'm, use, I'm, use, I'm useless at maths, but that's not <laughs> half price, is it? Oh, have you got sausage fingers again? <laughs> he says, I missed the one. <laughs> I'll tell you what, let's do 60 seconds then. 60 <laughs> seconds, he says. Available at 9.92. Good it's a good job we're in the early bird then, isn't it? So they're only on our screens literally until 9 o'clock. 15 minutes. Right. Um, we're going to remove the graphics though in 50 seconds. Make the most of this opportunity. They were meant to be 19.99. Both sausage fingers in there. <laughs> so, <laughs> so Tom always says that. Tom uses that term, he's like, oh, I've got sausage fingers. So like if he's typing, he does a typo oh, yeah. or something like sausage fingers. <laughs> oh, dear me. They, well, you have clearly, haven't you? Because it's meant to be 19.99. Mr. Digit, Mr. Digit. <laughs> Yeah. Well done, everyone. 14, uh, 19 dollars for 140 carats. It, it, it has worked out in everybody's favour, massively so. Aren't they beautiful? You could use these with your bezel strips, with your gallery wire, with Everything. your CV bezeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'd be amazing. Beautiful. Absolutely yeah. beautiful. Well done. I'll leave those with you. Sausage fingers. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Let's do what under What's 10? Blue. Blue tigers like mixed shapes. These? Oh, yes. Oh, look at this. <gasps> oh, I've they are lush. We normally have them in strands, don't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll never see them in cabric. Oh, look at these. Oh, how quickly do you think these are going to sell out, Mark? They're extraordinary. Oh, they're beautiful. We're going to match the price point now. Oh, look at this. Oh, wow. Saucy, says Dan. Yeah, I agree. Oh, they're beautiful, aren't they? I didn't think I could love uh, Tiger's Eye um, anymore, no. but I really do. Look at that. Gosh, they're magical, aren't they? Should they be under £10? Mm, probably not. Probably not. Hey-ho, make the most of it. How many do we have then, Roscoe? Wow. We had 40 available opportunities. Love it. Absolutely love it. And I'll be honest, when I first heard about sort of dyed tiger's eye, I was a little bit hesitant, thinking, well, what, surely you're not going to be able to see the, um, the chatoyancy. Quite the opposite. It actually highlights the chatoyancy. Yeah, it does, yeah. especially in natural light. Clara Vett, well done to West Midlands. Jacqueline, Sarah, hello to you, Pauline. Another Sarah, Suzanne, Lynn, West Midlands, hello to you. Uh, Yorkshire, Maker, Carolyn, Cornwall, Elizabeth, Midlothian. Good morning, everyone. I hope you're all well. Aren't these beautiful? For all you wire workers out there, um, or CB bezelers, or those of you that uh, work with your things like gallery wire, um, or you just want to look at pretty things. <laughs> ah, look who it is. Right, just got a quick gift for Mark. Thank Little you. gift for Mark. It's Mr. Cameron. <laughs> okay. How you doing? <laughs> I'm all right. I was okay. <laughs> <laughs> Until you got a camera shoved in your face. How are you doing? I'm good. You guys are all right? Yeah, we're all really good. good. We're all good. good. Look at you heading off? We're heading off in the morning. 4 oh, a.m. Right. in the morning. Check right. those out. Keep an eye out for something like that when you're over in Tucson. Yeah. Toby's off to Tucson. Is it tomorrow, did you say? Tomorrow 4 a.m. Yeah. we're off. How cool are they? Beautiful. That chatoyancy is stunning, isn't it? Yes. I was just saying I was a little bit reluctant at first about hearing about dyed tiger's eye. But doesn't it work? No, nah, it works really well. Yeah. yeah. And the cool thing about it is, like you said, you can get it in these beautiful, like in these tones, all the way through to your, like, your blues and your yeah. purples as well. Lush. It doesn't matter. Like when you're adding, when you're adding or since, like just changing the elements of these, it really doesn't matter. It's just personal preference. Yeah, love it. You know, with a gemstone, this isn't anything like a diamond or anything like that. When, yeah. Because this comes out of the ground, it doesn't come out in tiny little deposits because we've got a bit of bit of material to use. Yeah. Let's experiment with it, you know? Yeah, it's cool. It's isn't really it? cool. Really cool. Well, where, after you, where, did you, where did you see that, right? Well, yeah, exactly. You go, and look, uh, durable. Hopefully you have a, um, a better journey than we did last year. Well, so you, mean, you mean from me sitting next to you with COVID on the way home last year? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> I can't, we can't be last year, can we? You're not going to be there. I know. I'm going to be lost. Don't be too sad. You'll have fun. 
Uh, to, uh, make lots of Skypes, please. Yes. Uh, I, I, yes. Well, I've got, I've got some treats coming in. For oh. You yes. Me. Yeah, we can't wait for that. <laughs> you like it or not. <laughs> uh, Bye. See you, lovely. Oh, we love Toby, don't we? Snaffle this. Snaffle, snaffle. Yeah. What do we need to snaffle these yeah. for? For next week. Well, for the 8th. For the 8th. Put yeah. it in your diary. Yeah. Kiss cross. How beautiful would it be to have neon yeah. appetite in a kiss cross? It'd be incredible. You because could do, you you could, could do you a full 360 with oh, this length. Oh, that would yeah. be a, it is a metre long strand. Mm. And because neon appetite is, as it's described, neon in its colour, you're, you're going to be able to notice yeah. it even with the surrounding of other yeah. gemstones. How beautiful. Now, the average carrot... Oh, and it's natural, by the way. Totally oh. natural neon appetite. The average carrot weight of neon appetite is... 0.15. 0. 0.15. 0. Well done. 0.15. <laughs> so we are talking about granular sizes here. Um, you've got 230 carrots on this strand. At 59.99, Snaffle It, Mark says, for the 8th of February. Mm. We have a lovely show with Mark coming up. Kiss Cross, Tubular Kiss Cross. Um, and enough to make a full Massive. surround, a full necklace. They're incredible. And it's Jasper Mania Day as well. So How busy is that going to be? We've got some amazing it? Jaspers coming up. Yeah. <sighs> Oh my goodness me. What's he going to do with this? The value of appetite depends primarily on colour saturation. So specimens with a high colour intensity command the best price. Size does matter when it comes to appetite since finding large stones weighing over one carat is extremely rare. You've got 230 carats here. If you do the maths, um, no. what are they working out average carat weight each? Uh, so if, so you divide, if you divide a thousand by five, a thousand. that's two hundred, and then and then two hundred and thirty divided by two hundred. They're over a yeah, carat each. Each, yeah. Each. It's, it's literally just that's yeah. the jewelry editor. It's not my words. <laughs> that's the jewelry editor says. One carat. Is extremely rare. Extremely yeah. rare. Yeah. They're all over a carat on average, and you've got two hundred of them for nineteen pounds and ninety nine pence. Again, if you sell your jewellery, make your make sure your yeah. price reflects the rarity of the gemstone. Um, nineteen pounds and ninety nine pence. How many do we have of these then, Roscoe? Because they would be absolutely perfect, wouldn't they, alongside um, uh, Mark's oh, show on the eighth? Nothing as well. Again, <laughs> with Shanghai it. red, that would be Beautiful. amazing pop of colour, wouldn't it? I love appetite. It's got to be up there with one of my favourite. What colour metal would you use with it? Gold. Yeah, I'd go gold as well. I just look. Yeah. Just oof. It'd be yummy, wouldn't it? Yeah. Be really rich and beautiful and decadent and delicious. Look at how many of you there. We only had 20 opportunities. And remember, you've got nine minutes on this hour. Um, we're going to give you a little kind of showcase, if you like, of your six millimetres. Order them today, and then you've got them in time for Mark's show on the 8th as well. Yeah. So you can be literally kiss-crossing um, along with us. How amazing is that? We've got Mookite coming up next again. Looks absolutely beautiful. Um, just, alongside. That, what's the one on the end? Uh, that looks like um, picture Jasper. Picture Jasper, is it? Picture Beautiful. Jasper, yeah. yeah. Um, which would be nice with the kits as well coming up. Let's do the Mookite. <laughs> love it. Love it, love it, love it. Just two mining licenses of this gemstone remain. Look at this. Who knows? May well sell out before you know, other one locational gemstones, maybe like your Tanzanite, for example. I say that every time because I kind of think it's, it, it's a possibility. Tanzanite's widely documented as being one of those gemstones that will probably uh, um, uh, cease mining in the foreseeable. Totally natural from the western, uh, um, western coast of Australia. Along the Mooka Creek is Mukai, a variety of jasper which brings you the most beautiful colours. Twelve ninety nine only. I love it. You've got your crimsons, ridiculous. you've got your ochre yellows. That's ridiculous. Price, it is ridiculous. It? Is it just me? I can remember Mukai being quite a uh, considered mm. strand. Considering it's come from the other side of the world. Precisely. Just the, the, the whole geography of it makes sense, doesn't it? Just I've done Can't that journey on a plane. It. It's a yes, long way. Have, yeah. It's a long, long way. Twelve ninety nine mm. though to get hold of this. Well done. How many did we have then, Roscoe? Ah, just twenty of them, and there's people multi buying. Well done, Tracy, Lincolnshire, wow. Una, Kim, Richard, Caroline, Anne, Lorraine, Paula. Hello to you, Lisa, Morgan. I can't keep up with you now. Uh, Helen in Dumbartonshire. Well done to you. I'm down to single figures. Anita and Catherine. Good luck. Make sure you check out. Should we do that picture, Jasper? Yes. And then we're going to dive straight into into what? Sorry. 
the bracelet, and then we've got that zircon wow. strand as well. So amazing. Um, just the other side of nine. Um, picture wow, Jasper. Wow. I can't remember the last time I saw Picture Jasper. It always reminds me of the film The mm. English Patient. Yes, yeah. It's a nice, well, it's not a nice film. It's quite sad. It's actually. Andrew's favourite film ever. Is it? It's the only film he's been to the cinema more than once to see. It, it, he it's loved it. Uh, the yeah. English Patient. Yeah. It, I wouldn't I would describe it as a nice film. It's a very sad film. Mm. Mm. But it's it's all about love, isn't it? Yeah. Um, you should watch it. It's really good. It's really, really good. But it reminds me of that yeah. because, of course, it's very much in the desert. In the desert, yeah. Totally and utterly natural. I genuinely I can't remember this. the last time I saw Picture Jasper. Yeah. For male marlers, it'd be perfect. Yeah, beautiful. I'm sure I've seen David Beckham wearing this in a marla necklace recently. He would, he would rock it, mm. totally. I, I, I think that's a great, uh, that's a great point, actually. A, a very uni, uh, unisex gemstone. Um, nine pounds oh. ninety nine again for a full meter. It's really distinctive picture, Jasper. You get these almost like Saharan desert like vibes. Lovely color palettes, beautiful yeah. textures. If you visualize the sand dunes, etc. Two hundred and eighty carats you're getting. Have we got many of these then, Roscoe? Um, oh, 30 available. I love it. I absolutely love it. That's and I think, I think Tom wears picture Jasper, my Tom. I think I've made him a stretchy yes. bracelet in this Beautiful. as well. Very wearable, isn't it? Yeah. Um, it's just or three coils on memory wire. Nice. Yeah, lovely. Let's just keep it really simple. We don't need to do much with it, do you, with this, this particular gemstone? Absolutely. You know, it says it all on the tin. It does. Tin. Would it's this lovely. work with your demonstration in the next hour? I know they're a bit bigger. Would you can work? do big versions of it. There you go. Yeah, you can. There you go. Why not? Yeah. Nine ninety nine. We've got thirty available, and there are a lot of you there. Good morning, lovely jewelry makers. I hope you're well this Monday morning. We. I can't believe it's Monday already. This weekend has literally flown by. I can't wait for tomorrow. What's happening tomorrow? Payday. Payday. Yes. <laughs> We're on like day what nineteen? Because we, we were talking, January. we were talking about it yesterday. Because Andrew got paid, because he always gets paid on the last day of the month, even January. Yeah. But um, bless them here at Jewelry Maker, they pay us a week before Christmas. So we've had a long wait. We've had nearly seven weeks since our last paycheck. So we're all a bit. Yeah, I think my yes. kids will be very yes. pleased that they're not going to have beans <laughs> on toast again. <laughs> I love beans on toast. Although, although yeah, I do as well. Yeah. I do. T Tiggy's mm. loving life because her favourite food is a sandwich. A sandwich? Yeah, she brilliant. loves a sandwich. Like a sandwich. Two-year-old, yeah. a sandwich, mummy, a sandwich. <laughs> so she's loving it because oh, uh, there's a lot of sandwiches in her house at the moment. Uh, <laughs> a good sandwich. Um, sorry, Mickey Flanagan's in my mind. She makes a lovely sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> if ever I opened up a sandwich shop, which... You'd call it Tiggy's. I would call it... She makes a lovely sandwich. She makes a lovely sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd have, I'd have Mickey Flanagan in the background. Um, now, I don't actually have this in the studio. Oh. Oh. There it is. Oh, yes, I do. Yeah. yeah, I got it here. Here it is. Here it is. Beautiful blue John fluorite. It's too special not to include um, in, in the show if we've got the access to it. Um, really beautiful. So blue John uh, fluorite rather is uh, literally mined on our home turf, just up in Derbyshire, so not too far away from our studios. Um, yeah, really beautiful quality. You get these wonderful intensities of purple. Um, actually, if you look at Blue John Flora, it can be astonishingly expensive in finished pieces of jewellery, so you've got a great deal there. Well done, make sure you wow. check out. Okay, shall we do some stretchies? Now, I know you can make these. I know you can. I'm going to tell you, we've got 66 of each, each one of these, but we're going to bring you one of the best possible deals. If you want to deconstruct it, then obviously you can. If not, job done. It's all done for you. Should, if I had to choose one, I think it would be the hematite at the end. Yeah, I'm I love that. that. Too. Yeah, I love that. I do, oh, I do like the, the green. green. Yeah. I do like the clear quartz. We're going to start with the clear That's quartz. That's incredible clear quartz. It's pristine, isn't it? There's not an inclusion. No. In Look at this. Yeah. They're like little bubbles. Yeah, beautiful. Literally pristine clarity. At £24.99, pence. you've got 80 carats. Of literally flawless, would we all agree? I can't find any imperfections, and, we're, and technically no, speaking, we're no. under magnification. So, if there were any flaws, any blemishes, any hazing, or any kind of uh, discoloration within the gemstones, it would be it would be obvious. Nine ninety nine. I'm going to say this out loud. This entire little tea bar of beautiful stretchy bracelets, they're all going to be under ten pounds for you today, and not all of them are going to be nine ninety nine either. <laughs> 
In fact, neither this one. Ah. Uh -huh. Look at that. You can't go wrong. Can't yeah. go wrong with a stretchy bracelet. I know you can make them, but I think you'd actually struggle to make them at seven ninety nine. You would, wouldn't you? you by the time you buy the strand, the strand and the and the elastic and, and the time. They're not <laughs> even going to be seven ninety nine today, says Ross. Oh. So save yourself the hassle. Let's give you. You could you could embellish them then hereafter, couldn't you? Absolutely. Yeah, you can yeah. put things like your charms on there if you wanted to. Nice idea. Deconstruct it if mm. you wish. There is a clock ticking. Ross, does this go for all the strands? All of them oh. are going lower than seven ninety nine, so you can actually shop ahead. But do check out. Remember, you are on a curfew for this hour. I love the green onyx. I think I'd be yeah, getting yeah. hold of the green onyx. Hematite. They're big hematites too, They're aren't lovely. they? They're really good quality. Do you know what? Every single bracelet is <laughs> under five pounds today, including this pristine Very eye clean. clean. It's incredible quality. Oh, isn't it? It, it really is. It really is. Because yeah. we expect with quartz it to have a, a certain level of mm. characteristics, shall we say, internally. Yeah. Not the case here. I know you can make stretchy bracelets, but you quite possibly can't financially at the price that you're about to see right now. So save yourself the uh, save yourself the time. Four ninety nine plus. When do we see clear courts? Not in this. Rarely course, ever. Yeah, yeah exa exactly. I mean, a gent would wear all of those. Totally. Totally. So if you're looking for something for the gent for Valentine's Day, Valentine's get, get, a, get a couple Day. of these. That'd be lovely. Yeah. Look at that. Look how beautiful they are. I love I love a stretchy bracelet. They're so wearable. You know, think of all our all our designers, you all wear stretchy bracelets. The majority of your office team will actually wear stretchy bracelets. I'm gonna do black onyx next. I'm just literally mm. grabbing them as one. But look how lovely they are. You can literally mix and match them. Um, they yeah. made so well. I mean you can see, literally, just roll off. We're gonna be black black obsidian next, did you say? Onyx, I beg your pardon. Love Onyx. Absolutely love it. Perfect for your monochromes. Um, oh, all in your eight millimeter rounds. Again, looks so beautiful alongside your clear quartz. Look at that. Can't go wrong, can you? No, gorgeous. Gonna go straight down to it. How many have you got then, Roscoe? 66 oh. of each one. Okay. Is the elastic doubled, double layer as well? Or am I? Oh, it, it looks like it is on the recording. It's definitely quite a thick elastic. Hang on. I think it's too, is it? Sure, it looks double layered. Oh, so that's mm. lovely and strong. Yeah, yeah. Can you yeah. see that there? I think it's double layered, isn't it? Or is yeah. it? Or, yeah. Yes. It's too, yes, too it double is. Layered. You can see oh, it brilliant. there, can't you? Yeah. So it's extra strong. Four yeah. pounds and ninety-nine pence. So less likely to stretch. Absolutely. Less likely to break. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, you've got that insurance there. Um, again, beautiful quality. Mm -hmm. Shop ahead on all the other stretchy bracelets. Do you know what? Even if you got hold of these. <coughs> um, and sold them, I don't know, £10? Mm. I think that's a great price. I, I really struggle checked. making stretchy bracelets because I either don't pull the knot tight enough or I pull the knot too tight yeah. and it snaps. And, and, and then also, you give up. And they distort as well, don't yeah. they, if you do it too tight, yeah. I find. So, um, so mm. these are beautiful quality, don't none they? Of, yeah. None of mine ever end up the same size. <laughs> none of them. Which were now the green onyx. Oh, this is my favourite. Three together, I think, those three Those together. three? Yeah. They're lovely, aren't they? Yeah. I like that. Look at that. Yeah, it has got a, yeah. That's a lovely tone of green. It, I love green onyx. Yeah. And we used to have it all the time and we don't see it anymore. We rarely ever see it. Um, yes, it's treated. I'm not bothered about that because look at the beauty of the mm. gemstone. Yeah. You get this lovely glow. It's a real bottle green, isn't it's it? It's stunning. Lovely. I absolutely love it. Four pounds and ninety-nine pence. Clearly, you do as well, because yeah, loads yeah. of you, loads of you, are getting involved. What do you mean you're not stopping it? Oh, I want to get some of these. They're lovely, really nice. Why is he going again? I don't know. I'm going to say it, Mark. I'm just thinking about. Get them gone, apparently. Get these. I put these away for Christmas. Yeah. Put a little charm on there. Job done. Or not. <gasps> Three pounds and forty-nine pence. <laughs> I wanted this one, Ross. I'm not going to get it, am I? It's going to be a sellout, isn't it? It's lovely. I like those three together, you're right. There's no gapping at all, so it's no. perfect size for you. Oh, I love that hematite one. They're all so beautiful. So I would wear the hematite, the yeah. clear, yeah. the black onyx, yeah. and 
I think there's an obsidian near you, isn't there? I think that is a golden yeah. obsidian, yeah. yeah. When do we see obsidian? Oh, my goodness, not very often. I tell you what, we'll do the obsidian next, Mark. Mm. Um, these are literally flying out the door. Again, I get it, you can make stretchy bracelets, you can, but I don't know it's even worth your while um, when we wow. bring them to you at £3.49 or £4.99 even. Right, let's do that obsidian, shall we? Hang on. I've asked, um, I can't tell you what it is. Because Wayne has told me not to in case he can't get it. But Wayne, I've asked Wayne, and I've given him samples from my stash, of a type of gemstone, a gemstone cut that we've not had on the show for 11 and a half years. <laughs> oh, no, now, now my brain's ticking. I'll tell you in the break. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so he's going to try You might it. remember it. I'm but I've given her pieces of jewellery that I used to sell on my craft store using this particular shape of gemstone. Okay. And he's going to try and get it for us. Can't can, wait. You not, can you not say? No. Oh. Is Wayne watching right now? Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. They do have us on the office yeah. in, in, oh, do they? in Jaipur, yeah. Right. Hello to our Hello. India team, by the way. Yeah, they do have us on. Three ninety nine for silver obsidian, plus all of you silver Game of, obsidian. Yeah, for all of you Game of Thrones fans out there. Oh, yes. Cool. In fact, you know what? Were you with me the other day when I was in the studio and one of the lovely hobby maker? Uh, um, guests actually said oh have you got any obsidian she goes i don't really understand gemstones and the metaphysical side of things but i really want some obsidian because i understand it's quite protective and i said it believes to be yes so yeah, i can get you some obsidian no problem this would be perfect it would, wouldn't it yes. 3.99 yeah. only how wow. cool and again it's totally and utterly natural I love it's a type of volcanic glass so ancient yeah. volcanic glass um that yeah brings you a really lovely uh sort of silver like sheen across the surface well done um lots of multi buyers getting involved on that one well done which one should we do next let's do the carnelian, carnelian. see now the carnelian i would wear with the green yeah like this getting the summertime vibe on oh yeah it, it, it is here yeah, like the irish flag yes Look how beautiful. I love it. I love carnelian. It's got these really beautiful, intense, warm colours. If you want to get hold of these two, I think they might be available. They might well have sold out. But you are literally, oh, you've only got a couple of minutes on each of That's these opportunities. Beautiful. Three, nine, uh, sorry, 3.49, I beg your pardon. The zircon is coming up, remember? Look at that warm, beautiful colours. Oh, it's like a holiday destination. It's gorgeous. It is so lovely. The first gemstone I bought myself when I was a, a, a viewer uh, watching what was the Coloured Rocks oh my word. Uh, channel was actually Carnelian. Oh. Um, let's do the golden obsidian now, shall we? Mm. You'd have to wear them together, wouldn't you? Yeah. Should I put them together? Hang all on, make sure. Black. Yeah. That one. Oh, would you put all the blacks I think together? So. I think it'd be amazing. Yeah, that would be very cool. So with the onyx as mm. well? Yeah. You might not notice the difference in the studio, but when you get it out into natural light, you definitely yeah, will. Yeah. That's beautiful. I love it. So we're on this one now. Do you remember we used to do rainbow obsidian? Yeah. Do you remember? Yeah. And it's, that's down to how quickly it cools. So oh, gold... Is that right? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, if it cools, I don't know whether, whether fast or, or mm. slower, but yeah, it equates to what colours you actually see. The golden oh, right. sheen is actually usually the most expensive. Mm. <laughs> and yet we're here we are at three pounds and 49 pence in the That's studio matter. it's not that obvious is it but when you actually get natural light in front of golden obsidian you can really see it two more auctions and we're going to be bringing you that beautiful zircon strand we're super excited about it um we've got two more of the stretchy bracelets to bring you in the meantime this is an agate, this is an agate indian agate seen. i thought it was jasper it does look, has got a Jasper vibe about it. We were watching lovely oh. Lindsay next door, weren't we, yes. when we were getting oh, ready yeah. for the show, and she had stretchy she bracelets did. on there, yeah. Agate stretchy bracelets. I can tell you oh, this for certain, they weren't £3.49. They were a great price, of course. I and this is, I'm right in saying this is natural, right? That's amazing. Yeah, natural. Knowing How often do you see natural agates? They are normally That's, dyed. They normally are, yeah. That's incredible. It's cool, isn't it? So this is green agate. This isn't moss agate. No. Nope. No, I've never seen green agate before then. Natural green agate. Why aren't we doing a showcase and getting strands of different sizes of this? So, you know where Wayne is? 
Shall we give him a message a bit later on? Yeah, I think we should. Natural Indian green agate. Love it. Absolutely love it. It's, it's fascinating, isn't it? Yeah. It's got a little a, a lever of aqu aqu mm. aquapraise to yeah, it as well, yeah. I think. No, it's gorgeous. Three pounds and forty-nine pence only. Oh. We only have sixty-six <laughs> of these available again, completely and utterly natural. Green onyx is sold out. The onyx is sold out. Yeah. I would have got hold of that as well. Um, shall we do? Shall we do the hematite? Your zircon is literally coming up next. Lots of people wear zirc. Uh, sorry, hematite rather for for different reasons as well, don't they? For blood pressure. Blood and all pressure. Sorts of things, it's meant to aid yes. uh, yeah. blood disorders as well. So oxygen. But and obviously this isn't medically proven, but it's believed to help mm. with yeah the oxygen levels in one's blood circulation. What? How are we at two pounds ninety nine? Ah. That's ridiculous. You know you wanted this one, Mark. You're mm. probably not going to get it now, are you? Two ninety nine. Uh, again, I wow. know that you can make stretchy bracelets, but is it even worthwhile? No. Absolutely is it not. even worthwhile when we're bringing you uh, prices like this? The phone lines have gone <laughs> completely bonkers. Well done, everybody. Amazing, That's amazing, crazy. amazing. Again, get those, put them away, literally for Christmas or birthdays or celebrations, yeah. whatever. Maybe Just get a present drawer. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. You do need to check out now because wow. before we enter into the the sting for your early bird we are about to close this hour once this early bird sting finishes and we bring back the zircon all of these items are going to disappear so if you've got it in your baskets you have 20 don't worry if you've got a phone in your hand and you've pressed your option <laughs> one you're all good if you've got it in your basket and you haven't yet checked out, you are about to miss out on this opportunity. So I'm trying to give you as much head, uh, sort of warning as possible. Are you ready? Now is the time. You literally have until the end of this VT. This strand was meant to be part of the birthday celebrations in May, but this quantity we said on the back of the launch last mm. week, um, and Mark was suggesting that it goes alongside his amazing techniques in this next hour. We had to bring it forward. If you've never seen Zircon before, well, believe me, we're about to treat you with some of the best, most exemplary Zircon you could possibly wish for. It's coming up after this. <music> Could this be any ball perfect? <laughs> I don't think it could. I love what Anne and Sue have done with them, with them as well. Yeah. Oh, so, I thought you made this. No, no, no. This is this is Anne and Sue. It's so elegant. It, it really Remember is. We're talking about just putting ten maybe yeah. on a on a head pin on a featherweight head pin. Yeah. Just perfect. And this is a beautiful little slider bracelet. Look. Stunning, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, this is aspirational jewellery. Oh. I look at both of these and think, you know. And we, we're almost programmed to say diamonds, aren't we? But mm. like a diamond tennis bracelet or a diamond pair of earrings, that's the kind of thing that we aspire to. But never mind diamonds. And uh, um, let's talk about a gemstone which is significantly rarer. Now, I know those of you that got involved last week, um, we weren't meant to be bringing this opportunity again this week, but we are because of the popularity and also because we suggested this would be the most unbelievable strand with Mark's mm. kits. But what is zircon? Not to be confused, please don't confuse zircon with cubic zirconia. They are worlds apart. So let's talk about this amazing gemstone. Well, colourless zircon is well known for its brilliance and flashes of multicoloured light called fire. These two zircon properties are close enough to the properties of a diamond to account for centuries of confusion between the two gemstones. You know, long before gemology was, existed, you know, when we now we have these advanced machines that can actually help us read refraction indexes and things like that, but we didn't back, uh, years ago. We thought zircons were diamonds. Um, but actually, and probably we thought those zircons were the best quality diamonds. But actually, it's a totally different gemstone. Zircon occurs in an array of colours. Its, uh, um, its wide and varied palette of yellow, green, red, reddish brown and blue hues make it a favourite among collectors as well as informed consumers. And you can see at the, uh, the top there some of those lovely uh, photographs. Um, this is the GIA website. 
Um, and they say why we love this gemstone. They actually, that, that's how they title. They love it because of the geological clock. With radioactive trace elements that tick off time, zircon is a geological clock that tells us about early Earth. Number two, brilliance and fire. Zir zircon has a very high luster, refractive indexes and dispersion, giving it lots of brilliance and rainbow flashes of fire. Double, double, and what that's referring to is zircon's pronounced double refraction means you can see twice as many facets and twice as much fire. So if I was to put um, an equivalent size um, of zircon next to, say, my engagement ring, you would see significantly more mm. fire, significantly mm. more brilliance in the zircon than you would the diamond. And that is because when light enters into a zircon, if you can imagine it, if you can visualize this, white light enters into a gemstone and it will kind of bounce around those facets. That's down to the amazing craftsmanship of of the lapidaris. So you can see that white light entering into, in this case, a round brilliant cut stone. Um, straight away, immediately, it splits into the spectrum. That's what we call fire in the gemstone. And literally then should hopefully, if it's been cut well, should then uh, um, bounce back out, if you like, through the table facets. But now imagine that twice over. So basically, imagine that white light entering in and immediately the spectrum of light splitting, so you see that rainbow twice, that is what you get, one of the qualities that you get within zircon. And if you're thinking I can't quite visualize that, take a look at this recording, um, particularly at the back of the screen, you can see those spectrums of colors. That's what zircon is all about. The IGS, that's the International Gem Society, and I'm only reading this paragraph really for the final sentence because I actually don't like how they've worded it. I, I don't, I'm being honest. As a species, zircon has many interesting characteristics, some such as its high refraction index and dispersion. Uh, seem to have made it the natural choice for a diamond simulant. Ugh, don't call it a simulant, please. This is not a faux gemstone or a laboratory created gemstone. It's the oldest gemstone in existence. So when cut properly, colorless zircon can make very convincing diamond imitations. Again, no. please, no. <laughs> it's not an imitation stone. This is far rarer than any diamonds, but I will read on. I'm going to just skip and jump to the final yeah. sentence. Zircon is rarer than diamonds. And we discussed it, Mark. So why use them as diamond substitutes? It just doesn't make sense, does it? It really doesn't. The only reason that w Zircon's mm. not as well known as diamonds is because De, De Beers run that highly yep. successful yeah. marketing campaign yeah. saying diamonds are uh, forever. Um, but also... They, why did they choose diamonds? That's the re, that's the, val, mm. you know, the valid question. Why did they choose diamonds over zircons when actually zircons ca, are, can and usually are more beautiful? Well, it's because of the availability. Diamonds are not that rare in the gemstone world, mm. um, not in comparison to zircon. And you had a conversation with Steve, didn't with you? With Steve Bennett, and he basically said if, if De Beers had got behind zircon instead of diamond, there would be no zircon left. No. It would have been depleted years ago. In a year. Yeah. It would have been mined out yeah. in a year. Yeah, yeah. Um, I can't bring you here at Jewelry Maker an hour no. of zircon. When we launched it, we had this strand and we had the canary that you had in the previous hour. Um, that's it. That is how rare this is. Plus, you are sourcing from the premium location of source. Um, and the price of Zircon at the moment, uh, Wayne stepped into the gallery, didn't he, when yes, we were bringing yes, this to yeah. air, and he actually said, look, I can't get any Zircon at the moment. This is literally the last round. It was meant to be reserved for our birthday celebrations. Um, but I tell you what, we'll bring it to air um, because we discussed it with your kids. Mm. And yeah, we were going to say, oh, maybe bring it, maybe bring it sort of in April to, uh, to promote the birthday. Because last birthday, this was the biggest seller we did. That's right. The biggest it's seller. That strand. That strand, absolutely. Mm. Colourless zircon is known for its brilliance and its flashes of multicoloured light. These zircon properties are close enough to the properties of a diamond to account for centuries of confusion between the two gemstones. That I get, and I don't object to, because we didn't have gemology then. 
Zircon occurs in an array of colours. Its varied palette of yellow, green, red, reddish brown and blue hues make it a favourite amongst collectors as well as well-informed well consumers. Reading on. Sorry, the pictures. Beg your pardon. There, there. Now, if you can visualise pieces like this mm. and i was looking for zircon jewelry don't actually you can't find that much no you can't um and i saw this i was like oh wow that's amazing you've got some beautiful pearls you've got a lovely ruby there it's not zircon it's actually imitation zircon um yeah so it's not diamonds it's not cubic zirconia it's imitation zircon do you see see at the top it says jewelry type they don't say imitation diamonds they say imitation zircon, zircon. Yeah. um so yeah that is what we're looking at right now it, they are imitating that double refraction and it's absolutely beautiful i mean something like this again wow. it's beautiful it's absolutely gorgeous it's costume jewelry it's not zircon, even though they say it is. It's imitation, yeah. imitation yeah. zircon. Um, now we are going to bring this to you in 60 seconds time. The 250 that we were originally going to, I don't know, lock away for the birthday celebrations or at least the pre-birthday celebrations this year, we've decided to bring forward because it would be the most amazing choice mm. with your technique that you're demonstrating this hour mark. We've got the full 250 wow. quantity today. If you are looking for fire, dispersion, scintillation, magic, and, and again, you think it looks amazing now, wait until you get it home. Wait, uh, that's one of the most beautiful strands I think we've ever it brought is. to wear. No, it's absolutely beautiful. Everyone fell in love with it. I think yeah. everyone in the team fell in love with it, didn't we, totally. when we brought it to wear. Because it's, you just, can... it's just got this, this I don't know, just affects you doesn't it as well yeah on. totally it really does and, and and cutting is so crucial with this gem because it is double refraction you can almost confuse it mm. so if you actually have too many facets it can blur out the fire right. um so to be able to, to to cut it to this degree and that grade is remarkable truly remarkable think tassels think mm. beautiful linear uh, so zircon that. bracelets like this thinking in amongst your your amazing uh, kiss cross that mark's going to be teaching you literally this hour but also on the 8th as well in your tubular. Mm. Um, the auction is open. We have literally 250 that were meant to be as part of the birthday available for you today. And we've shown you countless different designs, like, I don't know what it's called, the ladder weave, is it? Mm -hmm. Ladder yeah, weave. Yeah. Yep. Um, we, saw, we had it in a rose quartz bracelet. Imagine doing that with Zircon. I can no, promise no. you one of the best prices that you can possibly, possibly imagine on one of the world's rarest from the premium location of source cambodia is what um uh, mogok is to ruby cambodia is what columbia is to emerald um or maybe your south sea or a koya is to your pearls it's the best in the world in the world and you're getting 10 carats off today here we go oh, prime example yeah. You'd probably need, I don't know, what do you reckon, Mark? Three or four strands? Three or four, um, probably four. You don't have to have that bracelet as thick as that. You could have it as half the thickness if you want to. Imagine that, imagine that class yeah. that we had earlier on. That class that we had in the first hour yeah. would be yeah. so beautiful on that, yeah, wouldn't yeah. it? Just to finish it off, full of sparkle. That's red carpet worthy. Immediately, the first collector got full. Well done. I can't, please, if you're working with this, then send your photographs into the Wall of Fame because it is truly, truly beautiful. Um, hello to Michelle. I bought this strand and it is stunning. Haven't made anything <laughs> yet as I just keep looking at it. That's the thing. It's one of those, isn't it? That you could literally just, it's, it, it's beautiful. It's going to bring you enjoyment even without um, actually turning it into a finished piece of jewellery. Thank you so much for messaging in as well and sharing your findings. That's, that's that, you know, it's all very well, Mark and I, literally talking about this auction and saying how, how exciting the quality is, but when it comes literally live from our viewers at home, that speaks volumes. Now, this is no way near your closing price. No way near. We've got a 250 amazing. quantity. Let's just put it this way. The collectors that have already multi-bought will not regret those multi-purchase, no, uh, multiple no, no, purchases. Um, 
I, I, you know, if you don't not very well use this as an alternative. If you love your tassels, um, use this. If you want to, if you've been desperately waiting, eagerly, like Nikki, um, to learn how to do the fat, uh, the fa not fat, the flat kiss cross. <laughs> um, Mark's going to be showing you that in a few moments' time. And any questions are, of course, welcome. Text into the studio. This is not your price point. No, uh, the no. first three people have multi-bought, four, two, three. Pauline, Richard Molly, Norman, Ayrshire, London, Elaine Lorna, new customer, Pauline, Jan, Jenny, D, Caroline. Take a little look at this. Tennis bracelet, wow. sparkly, elegant, silver, zircon bracelet. Is it actually zircon though? Let's hope so. Uh, set, but even, well, even more so, I guess, if it's imitation. £75, that's just what, an inch, two inches that's maybe? That's what you've got here, isn't it, pretty much? Yeah. 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 It's almost exactly what Alan yeah. Sue have created, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You could easily make that how many times over, do you think? I reckon you could do that five times at least. Yeah. Easily. I think so. Yeah, five, five or six. So that's not bad profit, no, is it? No. And that's literally on Etsy, on a slider bracelet. Amazing, amazing. And a beautiful piece of jewellery it yeah, is too. Yeah. £75. Is that hard to make? No. No, it's not. It's not <laughs> a couple at all. of wrap loops. A couple of wrap loops, that's yeah. it. It is Zircon. That net, that one on Etsy is Zircon and it's got great reviews as well. Seventy-five pounds. You can make that multiple times over. I tell you what, let's bring uh, let's beat that seventy-five pound price tag on the whole strand. On the whole strand. I wouldn't be surprised, Mark, if there are people that got the Zircon the first time round and they're coming back again. Mm, no, absolutely. Absolutely. If you are one of those people, then please do drop us a message. Everybody is multi-bought so far. Hello, Alison and Kent saying morning. L, Mark and crew. I got this strand last week along with the pure white oh. jade. I, I'm going to make a kiss cross. Oh, my goodness me. How amazing would that be? Incredible. I can't wait to see that, Alison. Uh, hello, Vera saying morning, of L and Mark. Yeah. Morning, darling. I'm a December birth, uh, a December baby. It's a birthstone. Um, and it was used to redate the earth. Absolutely. Mm. So scientifically, right. thing is, we know, we know, it was, it was actually Australian zircon. We know that the Earth, because originally we said less than this, didn't we? That's right. It's actually 4.4 billion years old because of Australian yeah. zircon. Yeah. It's just cool. <laughs> so cool. You think, you think zircon has seen absolutely everything. We consider amber as old, don't we? But again, we're kind of programmed to. This has seen as old, it all. Everything. everything. Right from the beginning, it's been here. Early man, everything. Yeah. Look yeah. these people. Should we half that price, Mark? <laughs> I know. I think so. And if you're, if you're selling your seed bee pieces, just from add, because I've always wanted to, and we don't get the opportunity very much, is to add gemstones with seed beads. So just from adding that zircon, you've probably gone from 50 quid to 125, 130. Definitely. And like how that. many of the zircon have you included? I, I, I had about 40 left on the strand. Wow. So I've used a lot. See, each of those little sections have, have got two. So there's quite a lot of sections in there, but... Um, but you could be more frivolous, couldn't you? Oh, you could maybe do like a absolutely. section at the front yeah, or absolutely. only go through the center if you wanted to. Yeah. yeah. I love Are you ready? That. I love this so We've much. We've got 250 yeah. available for you today. And if you want that demonstration, it's coming well, up. Imagine that with the, the bicones of oh. the jadeite, the black jadeite that we had on the show with, with, yeah, the, with perfect, Dave. Yeah, which I forgot to give you. I'm yeah. so sorry. No, I totally forgot to give you. £24.99 only. Wow. Um, it is pristine. It gets no better than the quality than what's on your screens right now. Look at how... Firstly, all your 4C is absolutely applied to Zircon. So you think about your carrot weight. You've got 10 carrots here. It's enormous. You talk about the quality of the cut. That's even more important more crucial than that of a diamond because um, you can confuse the fire if you like so it looks almost quite matte um, you've got that uh, to, 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 to a supreme degree you've got the most beautiful uh, beautiful clarity and you've got that crisp white color plus from that premium location of source this is literally mined we've spoken about this already today um, zircon is mined literally by hand it's not vast open oh, yeah. pit mining like that of diamonds it's literally mined by hand up a dirt track um, amazing. Hello, Ruth saying, I bought multiples of the Zircon strand and I'm using them with my Oh, new... lovely. 
to make a wow. bracelet. It's looking beautiful. Uh, might get some more. Ruth, it's amazing on the please loom. Please make me a promise. Yeah. yeah. I want to see that on Wall of Fame. I can't wait to see that piece of jewelry. Incredible. Can you imagine? I love looming. Oh, please. So many of you have checked out, but that's still not your price. I'd love to know how many people are going to rebuy more today on the back of receiving their, their strands at home. Yeah. And if you want to shop ahead on Mark's kits, they are available on pre-order. They would go perfectly, even down to the, uh, yeah. the wildfire. Absolutely. And the sterling silver clasps. They will go perfectly yeah. with this strand and you can shop ahead. They're not going to be 90 pounds. I can't believe we did this, <laughs> but we took this amazing strand Ticking every single box that there possibly could be, we took it under 20. What did he just say? Mm. Can you repeat that, Ross? <sighs> I just can't remember what we did last week. I've been racking my brains, I can't remember. I think I know, but I'm not going to say no, it out loud in case I'm wrong. No. <sighs> under 20 pounds. Do you know what, Ruth? I can't wait to see that bracelet. No, I bet it it's going to be absolutely it? beautiful. I mean, that's legacy jewellery, isn't it? Mm. You will need to multi-buy if you want to create that big cuff bracelet, but how beautiful would that be? £19.99. There are a ton of multi-buyers, and when we said under £20, we're not talking about a little cheeky penny. We're talking about significantly more. There was 250 opportunities. There is a reason why so many of you purchased this during the original launch, and there's a reason why so many people have actually are rebuying. We heard it just there from Ruth on the message, right? I might have to get some more. Um, we've pulled this forward from the birthday celebration because it's the perfect addition to Mark's Hour. Absolutely perfect. And, none of, and to be honest, we're like, we're, we're like, uh, it's like children at Christmas. You can't quite wait. We can't wait to bring this to air. How many are in baskets? 148 <laughs> of you have this in your baskets. And bear in mind, we only brought this strand literally last week. It's got to be special if already... Uh, you know, barely a week on, we're about to sell the equivalent qual uh, quantity. On a Monday morning, not on a Saturday. We launched it on oh, a that's Sunday. Right. Yes, that's right. Sixteen pounds and ninety-nine pence only. It gets no better than what's on your screens. I can see so many of you saying, oh, "I'll tell you what, I'll have some more then." <laughs> Thank you very much, Marion. I can see you with three. Nancy's got four. Jackie's got three. Davinia's got four. Devon's got four. Rupal's got two. Molly's got two. Isabel's got two. Sorel, you've got two. Uh, Jackie, you've got two. West Midlands. I can't keep up with you all. Um, I would recommend multi buying because I do believe it's one of those strands that you'll get home and you'll regret not. Getting getting more yeah. of yeah. Um, there are 44 of you with it in your uh, uh, with a phone in your hand press your option one to guarantee I can guarantee you at least one then if you want multiples then um, yeah make sure you do press your option one ASAP to speak to our call center <laughs> if you've got it in your basket check out because the best thing about 16 pounds and 99 pence is it's still not the closing price I think I know what we did. Did we? Did we? Did we? <laughs> then Fuchsia's just got six. Robert's got two. 200 of you have it in your basket, and that, that's not including those of you on the phone no. lines. Oh, my goodness me, it's going to be another sellout. It gets, I think this is one of the most beautiful strands we've ever done. Amazing. If you use a size 12 needle, you can actually peyote with this as oh. well. Because the drill holes are a really good size. How beautiful would yeah. that be? Yeah. Hello, Julie, saying, yeah. hi, I also bought multiple strands on the last airing and they're stunning. Is there any chance you could get, uh, oh, what's that? Three millimeter size. Oh, do you know what, Julie, yeah. we had them. Um, I know we've had a four mil, haven't we? I, yeah. think, the, I think that strand was the four mil, wasn't yes, it, I think. I think they yeah. sold out. Yeah. Um, we have already asked mm. Wayne, and he's over in mm. Jaipur as we speak. He, I'll be honest, he is really struggling to get hold of Zircon at the moment, especially at these kind of prices. But I know it's on his radar, Julie, so thank you for mm. asking thank the question. That uh, would look... Be, uh, would look would look amazing scattered throughout yes. a bridal veil or headdress. Oh my goodness, <laughs> make oh my goodness yeah. me, how amazing Incredible. is that? Nobody's paying sixteen ninety nine. This is an absolute joy to see. Isn't it? Isn't it? 
And do you know what? So, I love the fact that in just a few days, they're going to see yeah. it in person. Yeah. And it's so much more beautiful. First, as soon as you get it, go out into the garden in the yes. sunshine. It, it is dazzling. It's so beautiful. Today, <laughs> matching last week's amazing auction. Oh, yeah. oh, we did. We took it under £15. <laughs> £14.99. Pence. It gets no better. Think the four C's. You've got the carrot weight. Um, we've got the beautiful clarity. You've got impeccable cutting. Otherwise, you wouldn't see that fire, that dance of fire and brilliance. You've got absolutely pristine clarity. Um, it's literally perfection. I, you know, if you were to ask me, Elle, could I make this strand any better? The answer would be quite oh, simply no. Yeah. No, no, no. Um, there are so many of you multi-buying. And again, I, I know for sure you're not going to regret that decision when you get it home because it's one of those opportunities. Mark, you only took one strand, but I bet you would have liked more. Oh, amazing, <laughs> and that was a little... Um, yeah. Sneaky. Yeah, yeah. Mark, take this one. I think the reason that I find it so useful in this design is it, it's, it's, I've got, I mean, a, a fraction. It's probably a tenth of a millimetre smaller than an 110 seed bead. And that's what I'm saying. All of your techniques that you use in 1104, use it for your, with your zircon. Beautiful. So and that's why I'm able to use it. Drill holes so yeah, absolutely. You can. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. If you wanted the three millimetres, was it Ruth who asked earlier on? I think it was Ruth. As for the three mil size, we are trying, we will try, of course, mm. but there is a little three mil section coming up a little bit later on. Not with Zircon, though, unfortunately. I've got Tanzanite, Tourmaline, Spinels, <sighs> Onyx, Iolite. Oh, um, yeah, the, you could do, uh, again, you could use Absolutely. this, yeah, in yeah, this, exactly. this amazing yeah, technique. Yeah. Make sure you check out, though, because there's so many more. Look at the core screens. Literally, look at the core screens. They're literally jam-packed. I've got four full rows. This is how many out of the 250 that we launched this morning we have left. 39. That's it. That's <laughs> it. Once they're gone, they're gone. Um, and I'm seeing names literally jump back up on the uh, 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 on our list because you've chosen to get more. I don't blame you. Nuno, you've just got four. Mary's got four. Davinia, I can see you as well. You've got four. Sorel's got four. Cornwall's multi bought. Eleanor's multi bought. Julie, I can see you there multi buying. Virginia, you've got two. Carol, wow. we've got a minute to close this auction. We've, we've probably seen tens of thousands of screens like this. Yeah. It's not very often we have so many multi no. purchases of, no. of single strands. I think that's incredible. And you know, this is what we use yeah. as a gauge, mm. uh, as in the powers that be. Yeah. This is the most accurate knowledge of, uh, of what our customers mm. want, is the call mm. screens, mm. quite literally. Yeah. Um, you absolutely love, you absolutely love this one so clearly. Uh, and it, the fact it goes across so many different mediums Almost. and techniques Every, doesn't it, as well. Absolutely everything. Look at you all there. Yeah. Literally, the, the screen you disappear off the bottom of the screen. Um, amazing. Well done. Well done. Well done. We've got the final 10. Oh, my goodness. From 250, <laughs> we're straight down to single-figure quantities. So for those of you that have still got it in your baskets, you are going to miss out. That's it. Once they're gone, we're going to... Dive into a quick break. We've got kits on the other side that you can shop ahead and pre-order. And of course, if we run over, we run over. We've got an amazing, amazing demonstration. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. We're not really paying attention to the clock right now. Um, yeah, because we all want to know how to make this amazing piece of jewellery. Um, incredible. Kits are available on pre-order. Do not go anywhere. Mark and I are back after this. It's time for those New Year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery maker, sewing street and hobby maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? 
Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Oh, that's, a, that's a cracking cup of tea. It is I a good cup say. of tea. Yeah. You know when it literally touches yeah. your soul? Yeah, I think it makes a difference having it in a proper mug. Probably. As well, doesn't it? Yeah. Can we have, can we have mugs? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were told we were allowed mugs. It's like it's like I don't let I don't let my two year old have a mug. Have you seen? Do you watch the repair shop? Do you ever watch the repair no. shop? Repair shop's really anyway. There's about ten of them in this barn. I, I won't go through the premise. Lots of people watch it, but they've all got individual mugs. We just oh, their initial. Yeah, we just their initial on in big black letters. Oh yeah. So we'd have an E and an M and an R. And we an need a. to do that. Yeah, I think we just. Yeah, I think we should. If I get yeah. us, if I get us mugs, can we have mugs? I'm, hobby maker allowed yeah. mugs. Why can yeah. we not be trusted? <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, yeah. It reminds me of my children. No, you're not having a mug because you spill it. Yeah. You spill it. <laughs> right. Oh, seriously now. Oh my goodness me, Mark. It's not bad, is it? Oh, what do you mean not bad? It's <laughs> absolutely beautiful. As a, oh my goodness me. Where do we even start with these pieces of jewellery? Um, Every single one. It's so hard to choose a favourite, in all honesty, because they're, oh my goodness, Mark. That one reminds me of a deck of playing cards. I don't know what it is. I think it's the hearts and spades and clubs and, and diamonds. It just makes you think it's, it's, it's just quite... gorgeous. Yeah. So let me just show you. You've got it on a magnetic yes. clasp. Yeah. It's so comfortable as it well. It really, it really adheres itself to the wrist, doesn't it? It sort of moulds itself, this type of bracelet. Look how beautiful that is. I don't know, I can see a, mm. a bit of Moulin Rouge as well. So what I've done with the kits today, I've made one from each kit, and then with the bicones from each kit, I put them all together to make this piece of jewellery just so, because we've got red, clear and black bicones, oh. and I've just mixed them, the remnants off. So you've got enough to make at least one big bracelet out of each kit and you have leftovers or two smaller or one and some earrings or all sorts of oh, I love that one. Let's show the other ones as well because so this, these are... So these I've made previously on other shows, the ones on the tea bars up here, just to give you again a bit of inspiration. So these I've already made along here. Okay, so they, those have, have been on Amazing. previous shows and DVDs and things like that. But if I pass the ones across to you yes. that are made from the kits today. Oh, my goodness. There we go. I love this one. I love them. Bronze and clear. I love that combination. It's very me on trend too. at the moment as well. Really, really. Oh, my goodness me, Mark. These yeah. are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now, do I need to be 
the most talented seed beater to make these. Uh, completely beginner can make these. It's so easy. Really? That's the, that's the thing with this type of netting design, and Kiss Cross is the same. Um, it's so easy. You do, you do a couple of moves and you just repeat and you repeat and you repeat. So put some music on in the background, put something on the TV. Oh, nice. You know, it, you don't have to concentrate at all. Oh, just bliss. So it's, they, they're an absolute joy. Look at the jewellery that they produce. Exactly. Could this be, yeah. um, I, I don't know, you could maybe do sort of sections, I guess, in a necklace. I Absolutely. Suppose. Yeah, yeah. You can, a, you a can, choker. Yeah, you can make little um, mala sections if you wanted to with a nice. flat. Nice. Now, all you need to add with Mark's kits, and by the way, they are already going on pre-order, mm. is your needles. That's it. That's all you need. Beaded yeah, because needles. you've got thread in these kits, which we haven't, oh. well, we don't do very often, do we? And I'm fairly <laughs> sure some of our viewers are actually asking for wildfire recently, yes, weren't that's they? Right. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So if you are one of those that has been needing to stock up your stashes on your wildfire, um, well, you're going to get the wildfire plus amazing beautiful beautiful components coming up as well there are only three kits you can get them already on the website i'm going to start with the black and gold it's gorgeous oh my goodness me this is so, so beautiful nice. so this is the one that you included the zircon isn't it yes yeah so if you can you open and can you undo it actually sure and show the back i think yeah. it's, it's a toggle isn't it yeah so if you look at the back so i've used black 11 o's mm -hmm. and gold 8 o's so on your, if you're using the zircon, okay, I wouldn't put the zircon on the back because you're not going to see it. It'll no. be a complete waste. So if you flip it over, and either side of the bicone, I've put a zircon where you wow. would have put the gold from the from the reverse side. So all I've done is I've I've not put in the gold. I've popped in the zircon instead. How amazing is that? I mean, such a classy oh. piece of jewellery, mm. Mark. <laughs> um, and I've got enough within the kit to make this bracelet easily. Absolutely. Oh, yep. Wow. Absolutely. Wow, wow, wow. Well, any questions that you have for Mark, do message in. I know there's a lot of people who've been very much eagerly anticipating um, this amazing demonstration. So, okay, let's let's do the kits. We're going to start, oops, we're going to start with the black, um, which I think is going to be, yes, I'll pass it to you. Yeah, I don't yeah. want to pull it. Um, is going to be the most popular. So let me just tip them out. There's all those lovely bicon, about bicons, bicones. Yeah, so you get a hundred. A hundred of those. Yeah. Uh, so if, you were, if you were making the bracelet that you're wearing, yeah. you would use 90 of the bicones. Okay. If you were doing one half the size of that, you would use 40, between 45 and 50, depending on the size. So okay. you could make two thinner bracelets, or like the red one on the other side of you there. Yeah. Or if you wanted to do a, a double row, which is the one you're wearing, obviously you'd use twice as many. So you can make two smaller, one large, but you still have a few left over as well. Still got some left over, maybe yeah. for a pair of earrings. Yeah. Plus then you've got two different sizes of your uh, of your Mayuki. Um, can you see that there? If I put that 15 there. 15-0s in so, the kit. Oh, yeah. beautiful yeah. gold 15 O's. Plus then your 8 O's, which are like gold dust those are, aren't yeah, yeah. they? Yep. And I know black eleven. Black eleven O's. <laughs> it's a perfect three. kit, isn't it? If it I, really is. I didn't put these together. Lovely Alice upstairs put them together. But if I put a kit together, this would be what I would choose. And Just you're amazing. getting your wildfire, yeah. which, by the way, is fifty yards yeah. so, of the black. Yeah, yeah in exactly. the black. Yeah. Is black one of the most popular? It is. Yeah, it still is. Let's see why? It's perfect with this kit. You know, the black with the black. It goes with all of the kits, actually. Look at that. So you're getting three tubes of your Mayuki, two of your gold-plated 925 sterling silver toggles, okay. plus 500 of your bicones, plus the wildfire, which if I cast my mind back to um, some months ago, wasn't, uh, I'm sure some of our viewers were actually saying that these, sp these reels of, of wildfire were like £17 on that river website. That's right. Well, when, when, through lockdown, when we, we, when we couldn't get hold of any, I was buying it for £15 a reel. I know. <laughs> that is a lot. Yeah. And it lasts. It does last. It goes on forever. It does last. And it is one of the best. You probably materials. use about 12 feet to make that big bracelet you're oh, wearing. So, so, okay. Yeah. So you're going to have definite yeah. leftovers. Yeah. The only thing that you will need to add to this kit is maybe your beading needles, which we're going to assume that um, a lot of our audience will already have. If you haven't, then don't worry. Have a look on our website. You should be able to get them there. Yeah. Um, even here, Mark, 59 .99. Not one of these bracelets looks like it no, should be a no. 59.99 price tag you know it looks considerably considerably more <laughs> 39.99 yeah. they are sterling silver components let's break it down mark 
Sterling silver times two. So let's say, I don't know. Three. You get three. three yeah. Oh, yes, there's three. <laughs> yeah. I only saw two. Yes, you do get three. Yeah. So don't I'd we sell those at like seven pounds each? Something like that. Yeah. Yeah. So £6.99, £7.41, £21 pounds just on the, on the clasps. Yeah, it's £8 pounds for the fire line. And which is crazy, so that price pounds. point. There's £30 pounds just on those two components. Yep. Three tubes of my, my UK. That's £21. Pounds. Well, there's, there's the, yeah, they're the same price. You'd probably pay more for the, probably, sorry, less for the black because it's a half tube. So yep. you're still looking at probably £18 pounds for the seed beads. For the seed beads. So we're yep. totting this up. And then a fiver for your bicones. A fiver? <laughs> it shouldn't be more than that, surely. Yeah. So that's a great saving then. Yeah, you crazy. get a hundred of those amazing bicones. Yeah. Uh, Thirty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. How many do we have of this kit then, Roscoe? Sixty. A third of the stock has already gone. Um, oh, apparently we're not even stopping there. That's we we always say, Mark, don't we? Your kits, if there's components that you particularly want and you see them in your kits, chances are not. You know, chances are you're usually better off getting them in the kit because oh, you get no. such a massive saving. And we've put them together especially. I mean, there's a big team that behind the scenes mm -hmm. who are putting these together and putting colours together and sizes. Yeah. So there's a lot of work that goes on before we even bring a kit to air. How about? We put the price of the wildfire in the sterling silver and then everything else for free. Really? That amazing team behind the scenes have literally done their thing today, haven't they? Half the stock has gone, yeah. You're going to pay for your wildfire and your sterling silver and everything else is for free. How amazing. Wait, wait, so if you add your white zircon, you're still only paying just, what, £45? £45 only. Um, if you get hold, uh, if you get hold of that strand as well, we have got those beautiful three mills coming up as well. A little showcase, um, basically, I, and we've just said it, haven't we? If you, I, I don't know, I haven't looked recently, but wildfire can be, you know, quite expensive, especially if you do buy it from elsewhere. Not the case today. Susan and Brian, Joy, Cello to you, Mary, Marge, Mary, Mary, Jackie, Shirley, London, Ella, Sharon, Devon. Uh, West Midlands, well done. We are busy, busy, busy today. Olivia, Catherine, Sarah, Pauline, well done. Yvonne, I can see you there as well. Uh, Kay, Sussex, County Wicklow. Hello, Anne. Hello to you. Karen, Marjorie, London, Elaine, Catherine, Sarah, you're there as well. We've only got three kits to bring you, but you can shop ahead on the other two. Um, all the three millimetre strands that we are going to, would be the most perfect addition, I think, alongside Mark's demonstration. They're all available on pre order and they are not stopping at this price so um yeah they are good i mean some of them already are an amazing price point i've got to say what's that green appetite at what's that all about hang on red dragon peridot at 17 pounds what's going on shop ahead they are coming up as well and any questions that you have for mark do drop us a, um, a message into the studio um as and when you cue me i'll bring the other kids Marvelous. these are flying out the door okay, so, so there, are, there are two parts that i'm going to show you so I'll, I'll show you the beginning and then i'll show you how we then embellish to do your actual design section. Okay. I love this. This is so lovely. Oh, and again, it's so one of the it's beautiful. one of these one of these techniques that's just so simple and because you're repeating simple moves, it's yeah. really therapeutic. So the yeah. bracelet that you just took off, that yeah. was one of the larger bracelets, and that probably took me about three hours start to finish. It's the curve as well yeah. that you get with it. It's so no, it's, pretty. It's, it's just lovely. So what I'd recommend is doing the base, do the netting first, which you can see on the back. Mm -hmm. Even on the back, it looks stunning. <laughs> it does, yeah. Yeah, so do the netting first, then go away and get a cup of tea, and then come back and do your embellish bit. So the embellishing takes slightly longer because you're doing lots of backwards and forwards. And uh, But no, it's, it's Amazing. Lovely. It's lovely. Absolutely beautiful. Take it away, Mark. There's lots of people really eagerly okay. anticipating this demo. Okay, so I'm going to be using three sizes of seed bead. Okay, so I've mixed, I've mixed and matched from the kits. So I've got an 8 -o, a 15 -0 and an 11 -0. So the, this, this colour is coming up in, in a kit shortly. And then these are the bicones that I had left from all three kits. So I'm just going to use a mixture of those. So you'll need about 12 feet of thread altogether. So what I've done is, I've, I've, is I started with a fingertip to fingertip, which is about six foot length. And then I add as I'm going on. So what, what's a good idea is if you do your netting with one length of thread, tie it off and then yeah. introduce a new piece of, of thread to do your embellishing okay. on the top. You won't, get, you won't get an MS having to add then either. Okay. okay. So I'm using a size 10 needle because we're only going to go through the 15 once. So we haven't got to worry about multiple passes. 
And all you do is, is at the end, just pop on 11 out as a stopper bead and leave enough tail to pop your clasp on, which is about eight inches. Okay. Okay, that's all, so we'll, we'll do that at the end. So that's pretty important, that so that's, bit. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we need to make, if I'm bringing one of my, if I bring this one across, can you see? So we're gonna make the netting, okay? So can you see, we've got these little diamond shapes consisting of four white eight O's. And then each side, we've got three of these little 11 O's. Now on the single row, which this one is here, because we've got one row of your bicones going down the center, we have a diamond at the top and half a diamond at the bottom. Okay, so you're always gonna have half a diamond and a full diamond. If you do a double row, you're going to have two full diamonds and you're still gonna have half a row. So you're still gonna have two and a half, one and a half, three and a half, depending on how many size of netting that okay. you want, okay? So this is, this is probably the one that I would recommend if you're new to the technique, because this is, this is just a single row. So what we're going to do is we're gonna make the netting first of all, and I've worked out all the numbers for you again. So what you need to pop on your needle is the following combination. If you're doing a single row, you need to do five lots of the combination. If you're doing seven, your, if you want, sorry, if you want two rows, it's seven, three rows, it's nine, four rows, et cetera, et cetera. So you're just gonna add three every time. Okay. Okay, so we're going to pick up five times, one eight, three elevens, one eight, three elevens. So as I said, if you're gonna be using the zircon, don't use it in the netting section because it'll be a waste because you won't see it. Unless you just wanted a netted bracelet rather than adding the embellishments and then you can use the zircon because it'll be double-sided then anyway. So one, two, three, and then one, two, three. Okay, so just check my numbers. So we should have five eight O's. So one, two, three, four, five, and then five groups of your 11 O, which we've got there. So we know that we've got enough to start. We're gonna slide those down. Okay, and then we're going to start doing our netting section. Could we go in just a tad, if that's all right? Sorry, I, I, I don't like asking. Enhance, that's a good word, perfect. Okay, so we can start doing our netting. So we're gonna do this move when we get to the top of the bracelet every time, and when we get to the base of the bracelet, we're going to do a, a separate move, but exactly the same. So what we're going to do is we're going to make our first half diamond. So we're gonna take our needle and we're going to come back. We're gonna miss the first, eight o. We're going to miss the second and we're going to sew through the third. So the 8 o that's in the middle, we're going to sew through. And we're going to pull nice and tight. And now you can now see, if I bring this one across, we've got our half diamond at the top. Okay. Now we're going to do the full diamond. So what we're going to do is now we're going to pick up our seed beads. So we're going to pick up three 11s, one 8 and three 11s, one, two, three. And we're going to jump the next 11 into the first. So then when we pull, we get the start of our netting, okay? So we've got half diamond at the top, and then we've got the full diamond at the bottom. So we're going to do what we did at the top in reverse now, okay? So we're going to pick up one, two, three 11s, one, eight, three, elevens. And we're going to go into the first and pull nice and tight. So now we have the half diamond at the bottom. So we're always gonna do the half diamond first and then we're going to do the full diamond. So one, two, three, elevens. One, eight, and three, elevens. We're going to jump the gap into the top. So then that now gives us our full diamond. Pull again, nice and tight. So if I lay that down, you can now see we've got half diamond, full diamond, half diamond, full diamond. Okay, so it's an alternating. I find it easier to flip my work over and do the same action, but if you're happy with sewing backwards, but I find it easier just to flip it over and do the same. So again, we're doing our half diamond first. So it's one, two, three elevens, one eight, oops, and three elevens. And we're going to sew into the first eight o. This will give us our half diamond. 
And then we're going to do the first complete diamond. So one, two, three. So it's always one, two, three, elevens. One, eight, one, two, three, elevens. And then we're going to jump the gap into the top. And we're going to pull that. Can you already see now the netting starting to form? Yeah. So now we've got, can you see now the full diamonds are looking like a zigzag pattern? So you're going to continue this until you've got the length of your bracelet, okay? So if you want to show the next kit, I'll get the next stage ready sure. how to do the embellishments. Um, I've literally yeah. laid it all out for you. So we, if ah. you love this bracelet that Mark has created, if I actually just take it off there, you can see up close, it's so pretty. Um, this has got the clear uh, bicones. It's gorgeous. Yeah, it's, it's so like, lovely. It's it, it is stunning. I love it. Yeah. I love the color choices, the color combinations. Um, and again, if I just undo this, you can see the technique that Mark is literally demonstrating as we speak. Sorry, Mark. One second. Can I just pick it up a second? There we are. There we are. Um, okay. There we are. So that's what Mark is literally demonstrating as oh, there we, we go. speak. There we go. Yeah, Beautiful. The and so, then... if, so if you didn't want to do if, if you didn't want to do that embellishing along the top there. If you used your zircon where the gold beads are, and you'd, it would be reversible oh. then, you see. So all you're doing is a netted bracelet. Amazing, absolutely gorgeous. So within this kit, you are getting, if I just lay that down for a second, um, you're getting a hundred of those really beautiful clear bicones that you can just see it, uh, in front of this but lovely bracelet. Um, you're getting one 925 sterling silver toggle clasp. You're getting the three tubes of beautiful Mayuki in the three different sizes there. So you've got metallic purple, gold iris 8-0s, violet gold luster 11-0s, um, and also your galvanized gold 15-0s. Plus, you're getting your uh, wildfire as well. So 50, uh, 50 yards of your wildfire. If you want to make this particular colorway, absolutely beautiful. The other kit is very limited now. We are um, right. in, we've got literally the teens in terms of quantity remaining of the other kit. Um, I know that each and every single one of these kits are pretty limited altogether, mm. actually. Mm -hmm. Get involved as soon as you possibly can. We'll do it in one price crash because, it, yeah, it's busy today. Very, very, very busy. And then we can dive straight back into Mark's amazing demo if, he's, if, you, if you're mm. good. Yes, yeah. $24.99. So you've got <laughs> sterling silver components within um, within this kit. Plus you've got the wildfire, plus 100 bicones and three tubes of my mm. new key. We always talk about how great the savings are with our kits. Not only do you get the savings, you get the amazing inspiration as well. But that's got to be one of the biggest savings. I think so. Without because doubt. these tubes yeah. of seed beads are best part of £7, aren't they? Yeah, straight away. So it's £21 with the seed beads. And the, and the wire, that's not including your bicones and your and your toggle. That's amazing. I love that toggle as well. I've never seen it before. It's lovely, isn't it's really it? really delicate. It, yeah, it's quite nautical, yeah. I think. Can no, you see lovely. that if I hold it up? It's Actually, it's twist, very, it's very, it. it's very Gucci, and you know, mm. like the bamboo design. Oh, yes. Yes, actually. It, yes. it is a little bit. That, that's what it is, actually. It's like a bamboo, isn't it? Yes. No, Look at I how pretty. Beautiful. Never seen it before. No, lovely. Again, I would expect to pay best part of ten pounds yeah. for the sterling silver toggle yeah, no, on its cool. own. Um, how many do we have of this kit then? There are oh, oh no. there's only forty, so this might well sell out. Just shy of twenty have gone already. So do check out your basket. If there is a little bit of a queue on the phone lines, um, do be with our call centre. They'll be with you as soon as they can. If you've got it in your basket on the web, then make sure you check out. 40 and if, if funds allow, I definitely recommend getting all three and, and having a play around with different oh. colours, and because you come up with so many different combinations. It's got, uh, it, 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 it's stunning jewellery, mm. Mark. Bless you, thank you. Stun I noticed it, what, last week? I was like, yeah. <gasps> oh my goodness. Um, one more kit as and when Mark okay. gives me the, the shout So I'm going, to, I'm going to show you, what I'll do then, if I show you how to do the, the, the loop to pop your toggle on, yeah. then the next kit and then yeah. I'll show you how to embellish. Is that, is that all right, Ross? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I've done a section here. This is purely just of the netting that we mentioned earlier. So when you get to the length of your bracelet, bear in mind that you'll need an inch for your clasp. So we're going to be doing a loop either end, plus our toggle clasp or our, whatever clasp we decide to use. So just bear that in mind. So if you want seven inch bracelet, do six inches of your netting, et cetera, et cetera. And if you can, try to end with your starting thread in your bottom left corner and your finishing thread in the top right hand corner. And then you're guaranteed that your beads are in the same place one end to the other when you go across the middle, okay? Mm -hmm. So bottom left, top right when you finish. So I've just finished off my last 
little diamond section. And I'm coming out of the 80 at the top. Now I want to come back because I want to, I want to get halfway here to pop on my seed bead loop. So what I'm going to do is, if I just open this out ever so slightly, there's a little piece of thread from this 80 up to this 11 along the top row. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull nice and tight. I'm going to take my needle behind into that little half diamond and I'm going to pull it back up and catch it on top of that 80. So in effect, I've gone round, I've pulled nice and tight, so now that thread has caught nice and tight. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to sew back through the first group and the second group and I'm going to come out of the last 11 -0. I'm trying to do it all in one go, I won't do that. You see now that thread is caught and I'm going to go through the next three 11 O's. Because I found if you do it at 8 to 8 it's a bit off kilter, it's a bit lopsided. So I'm just going to go through the three 11s, if I can get the needle in. There we go, so through the three 11s, and that's where I'm going to X. I'm only going to be using those three 11 O's. I'm going to pull through, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick up eight of my 11s. You can use 15s as well if you want to, if you wanted a smaller, more delicate loop. But I'm going to pick up eight of my 11 O's. Okay, and I'm exiting, I'm exiting this. I'm going to go back round through, through the three 11s. I'm going to pull it nice and tight. So you can now see we've got a really nice, neat seed bead loop at the end there. So what you would do, you could either sew that directly onto your toggle clasp if you wanted to, or you can then pop in a jump ring and your clasp of choice. And then I'm going to take my needle and I'm going to sew through the next 8 like so. And then I'm going to sew through the three 11s. I'm going to go through the eight at the bottom. So I'm basically going through and I'm exiting the 8 here, okay? So that's how you, so what you would do is when you get to the other end and finish, you'd use your tail that you've got here to do exactly what I've just done here. So you, you take off your slide, your um, stopper bead, mm. pop on a needle and then do what I've just done to finish your loop on the other side, okay? So if you bring the third kit and then I will Perfect. Well, yeah. uh, actually, yep. um, purely by chance, when I'm wearing this, um, holding this beautiful bracelet, wow. how unbelievable is this? If you're a fan of the red bicones, this is the kit for you. This is the one, yeah. And this will make the middle bracelet. Zena actually made a really good point this morning. Mm. She was like, oh, how perfect is this for Valentine's Day? Yes, yes. How amazing. Yeah. So within this kit, you're actually getting, again, the wildfire. So you're getting your wildfire 50 yards off. You've got, again, a sterling silver um, toggle, but this time it's with a heart. Can you see that? It's I... lovely, isn't it? It's it is. really pretty. Let me hold it up. Oh, oh, oh dear. Um, we'll have to see it on the photograph. <laughs> um, yeah, and then you've got this really lovely um, heart toggle class. We can show you that in just a second. You're getting 100 of those uh, vibrant, bright cyan red bicones, which are like yeah. gold dust, aren't they? they are Anything, red. Anything red. Yeah. And the colorway of these Mayukis are really pretty. You've got almost like a terracotta. Well, I'll use their description. So you've got galvanized gold atos. There it is. You can see the sterling silver toggle. Sorry, I just dropped it. Um, then you're getting your matte metallic dark bronze, um, 11 O's. And, oh, it doesn't say on my specifications. What's this one described as? Let's have a little look. Transparent dark topaz. So you're getting the three tubes plus your wildfire and that beautiful red. These kits have absolutely flown out. Twenty-four ninety-nine and the toggle. Don't forget and that sterling well. silver toggle class, which yeah. is that really yeah. beautiful heart shape as well. Um, stunning, absolutely stunning. The red is one of those that you will notice from distances oh, completely. away. Isn't it? No, absolutely. No, it's, it's, it's absolutely beautiful. And I, as I said, I had to mix it with the clear and the black that I had oh. left over to make that that triple. I think I just think they're lovely. So wait, this was like leftovers. They were leftovers. <laughs> yeah. As if. So I made the three bracelets using the, the 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 clear, the red, and the black. Yeah. And I still had fifty of each left. So wow. I, I had more than enough to do the triple. How amazing. Plus, plus the bits I've got left that I'm demoing but with. So they go a long, long way. They so really you're gonna make do. at least two 
of the single row bracelets easily. Goodness me, for twenty four ninety nine, yeah, how amazing, amazing. is that? Yeah. Um, again, any questions? Do message us. We're live. We have got a limited quantity on each and every single one of these kits. Um, <laughs> sorry, lovely. Sorry, it's here somewhere. It is here. I just literally dropped the class. Um, back to you, Mark. If you're all good. Yeah, yeah. I'll find it. Okay, so we've we've done our netting. We've done our loop. And now I'm going to show you how we do the the embellishments. Okay, this is this is the this is the number. It's all nice bits actually, because as as I said, it's it's repetitive. It's it's quite mindful. It's, it's no, I just love it all together. Yeah. So what we're going to do now is TV we're going to do. Music on. Yeah. No, it's lovely. Is we're going to do our embellishing. So, as I mentioned earlier, on each row you have half a diamond, which we don't do anything with. We leave that empty, and then you have a full diamond, and the full diamond is what we're going to embellish. Mm. So what we need to do is we need to take our needle and we do a, they call it a thread journey. I hate that, take, I hate that expression. A thread journey. We're going to do a thread journey. So we're basically, we're, we're exiting this 8 at the bottom. We need to go left through the outside edge of three, up through the eight, and then up through the diagonal of the three into this 8 -o. So we're in the right direction with our needle to fill the gap. Can we see? So we're, we're basically, we're doing a circle with our needle, which is good because it also strengthens the outside edges yeah. of your bracelet as well. And then we're going to fill the diamond with our embellishments, okay? okay. So I'm exiting this 8-0. I'm going to take my needle through the three 11s on the outside, which strengthens, which is good. Okay, and then we're gonna take our needle through the eight, through the three 11s and through the eight. So we basically, we've done a thread um, loop through that little section on that corner. Yeah. Pull our needle through, and now we're in the right place to, to fill in that little main diamond with our embellishments. So the embellishments that I that um, I've all on here is I tr if you have 15s in the kits, which we have, so that's all sorted. So I'm going to go for a 15-0, then I'm going to go for an 11-0, and this is where you would use the zircon. Okay, so in place of the 11-0 CBs, you'd use your zircon, then a bicone. So let's go for the black. And then you then repeat that in reverse order. Okay, so it was 15, 11, bicone, 11, 15, 0. And all we're going to do is we're going to jump the gap into the 8, 0 that's at the top of the diamond. So we're just going to go up. Can I just thank Ross for giving me a few more minutes on this demo? Because I, th I really think it needed it. And um, As long as you yeah, need, thank says you. Ross. Okay, so when you pull, that completely fills if I turn it sideways, can you see now we've got that embellishment section and it fits perfectly. So now we need to fill in this diamond. So I turn my work 90 degrees, take my needle through the outside 311, pull that nice and tight. Again, you're always, you're t if you keep turning, you'll find it so much easier, so much easier to, um, to do. So we're going to go up to this diamond point. So I'm going to go through this 80 here up through the 311s into the eight. Pull nice and tight. And then we're going to fill in that diamond for the embellishment. So 115, 111, let's go for a red this time. One bicone, 111 and 115. Jump the gap, the whole diamond into the 80 that's standing proud. Pull through and there we go, that finishes that embellishment. Then we take our needle, and also because we're filling in these 11-0 down the side, we, it straightens it as well. Okay, so we're going to pull nice and tight. We're going to go diagonally across through the 8, through the 11s, through the 8. And then we're in the right position then to fill in the diamond for the embellishment. And that's because the some of the diamonds are quite flat at the moment, but as soon as you fill them with your seed beads, mm. it separates. And this is what gives you is the that, curve. I was going to say, is that yep, what, I, that's that's what, what gives, gives you, you that curve? curve. Yeah. So 15, 11, let's go for a clear bicone. Then an 11 and a 15. Jump the gap up to the top and then pull. And that's it. That's all you do. You just keep going. So you, you go on the, down the side, diagonally up to you're in the position of the diamond, fill in the diamond with your embellishments. And so you're basically doing a figure of eight, if yeah. you like, all the way, all the way down. So if I can have the, if I can have this bracelet here, because sure. I, op I can open that out. So this one here, okay, this is slightly wider, as you can see. 
So at the beginning, um, if you go back onto YouTube after the show, instead of doing five sections of three elevens and an eight, I did I did seven. Okay. It's exactly you the same technique. Hard numbers? You, you will, otherwise you won't get a diamond. You won't right. get a single diamond. Oh yes, at all. of course that yeah. makes sense. But the, but if you can see the back look, see, there's exactly the same netting. So you, you could, as I said, you could use your zircon instead of that gold eleven there. But this time, what you'd have is you'd have half a diamond, which you'd ignore, and then you'd have two diamonds, and then you'd do exactly the same as I've done. But you're filling in the gap. You can go three if you wanted to, or yeah. or five, however many you wanted to. But um, that'd be pretty. Actually, I hope that's I hope that's understood. If can I ask a massive favour? And I've never done this on the show ever before in all these years. If Nikki, lovely Nikki Mellish, is watching, could she message in? to say if that, if that was well enough um, demonstrated. Because Nick has been wanting to learn this, and I know a lot of the viewers have as well. I just want to hope that it's come across well enough over on screen. Your demonstration I think it has. I think, amazing, I think it has. Yes, OK. But if she, if she wouldn't mind, that would be just, just a thumbs message. up, just a thumbs up or something like that. That'd be amazing. There you go. Uh, well, uh, and also, um, Hoping that we'll see lots of these beautiful bracelets on the wall of fame. Oh, they're amazing! They're so so beautiful. pretty. They're, they're absolutely lovely. So so beautiful. So, as I said, the, the 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 single will take you about two hours. It's the netting that takes the time. Once yeah. you do the embellishing, that's quite easy. Um, but um, yeah, and the triple took me about three hours. Well, you've got a message from Mandy oh. saying, "Good oh. morning, all." Mark, would the bicones from the rainbow and butterfly bicone boxes work in these yes. gorgeous bracelet, please? Absolutely. Absolutely. I did see it in the, in the, nine, in the eight o'clock yes. hour, but I think it might have sold out. But yes, absolutely perfect. Because um, the bicones in here are four millimetre and I think the butterflies were four mil as well. But any, any, what, what I'll do is do your netting section first and then just have a play around with the combination for embellishments. I mean, I've used a 15, 11, a bicone. Mm -hmm. but there's nothing stopping using three 15s, a bicone, or take out the bicone and pop in a four mil jadeite that we had earlier. But I'm seeing these strands of bees to your right, Ooh, which have just yes. appeared. Let's, 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 They'd be let's, um, absolutely let's amazing. So you could, if you wanted to, if you wanted to go down the gemstone route, is replace the bicones with any of these strands. Oh, wow, that would be that incredible. Here up. we go, here's lovely Nikki oh. saying, uh, and she has just said, that was brilliant, Mark. I can't wait to make Wonderful. this. Thank you ever so much, Nick. As I've never done that before, I hope it didn't come across rude. Not but at all. Bless you. Thank you. Not Thank at you all. so much. Uh, Emin, sorry, saying uh, good morning, ah. Mark. Your demo was so clear. I will have a go and try Ooh. and make a choke out. Ooh, very nice. Very nice, very doesn't nice. it? Bless you. Thank you. Thank you, Bless everyone. You. Another message. Another message. That's is nice, isn't it? June in West Midlands. As always, great demonstration, good. Mark. We always get worried as designers whether we come across clear enough. Because a lot of people put a lot of time and effort into their designs and, and at home. And, uh, Made sense to me, job. Mark. Can't wait to try it, says Brilliant. Barry. In Thank Essex. you, Barry. Bless you. There Thank you go. There you go. There you go. Well, there we go. Proof, job done. proof is the actual <laughs> messaging in. Thank you. Thumbs Thank up you. from Lisa in County Durham saying, I have some four millimetre Kunzai I'm going to make this Ooh. bracelet with. <gasps> well, funny you should say Kunzai. Funny you should mention Kunzai. <laughs> because, yes, your deal of the day is Kunzai. Mm. Um, not in strand. You've actually got it in your facet stones it is beautiful the quality of your deal of the day today honestly should be in wow. gold quite literally amazing. um now we have had an amazing selection of three mils oh. on pre-order what's that one at the end oh that's the appetite that's ridiculously priced no. yeah <gasps> this one is red dragon peridot iolite oh my black God. onyx tourmaline spinel Sapphire? Wow. That's natural spinel, by the way. Pink tourmaline and, of course, tanzanite. Now, these have been available on pre-order. Mark, why have we put together this showcase oh, on the back word. of your hour? So they would work absolutely beautifully with the bracelet. So you can, you can use these on your netting side if you didn't want to do your embellishments or swap any of these for the bicones Oh, on my the goodness front. me. Can you imagine? A tanzanite. We must oh. find a name for this because we've got the Kiss Cross, but we can't call it Flat Kiss Cross. That just sounds naff, doesn't it? We'll have to come up with a name. Send in, send in any ideas you have for this bracelet. Give it a name and we can coin it for future shows. Um, yeah. What about Tanzanite Veil? Ooh. Yeah, I don't know. It's just, just like, <laughs> I, I don't know. It's stunning. I don't know. I'm just looking at yes. this bracelet next to Oh, that would go beautifully <gasps> with that, wouldn't it? With the brown. Oh. Mm. Gorgeous. So instead of using the bicones, yeah. if you want to include some beautiful quality gemstones, then here's your opportunity. These have flown, though, says Ross in my ear. 
um, on pre-order. Wow. Tans night, ultimately, you're looking for that color. It's vanadium that's responsible for uh, transforming this beautiful gemstone into that wonderful, very distinctive, celebrated blue. Um, the more vanadium, the, the, the better the quality, basically. So how often do we see faceted rounds? It, precisely. Precisely. Hardly you know how ever. deep they're mining I mean. this gemstone now? Isn't it taller than that tall building in Saudi Arabia? I can never say it. Burj Khalifa, yeah. yeah. Can you imagine yeah. going down a vertical shaft that, that, no. No, no thank you. No, no, thank you. As tall as the Burj Khalifa. Tanzanite, a one locational gemstone, a million to one the likelihood of finding this gemstone anywhere else in the world. Um, wow. and, and Mark's so right, you know, yeah. we don't see it in faceted. So for, the, um, for this bracelet you're looking at here, the brown, well, in, any of them, the, so that's a, that's a seven inch bracelet and I've used yep. 50 stones, so 50 bicones. There's more than, you've probably got about 75 on there. So you oh. can make matching earrings or Oh, that would be unbelievable. Well. Yeah. I didn't think you could make these bracelets any more beautiful. Imagine Tanzanite though. Yeah, amazing. And I would use this with that zircon strand as well. I'd mix the two together. Zircon instead of your 11. No, and then the Tanzanite instead of your bike. <gasps> if you've got the budget, please make that combination because that sounds absolutely beautiful, doesn't it? Yeah. Cambodian Zircon with Tanzanite. Sorry, Ross, what was that? All incredibly priced, but we are going to start with the most incredible deal. How many have I got, firstly? 50. Oh. And it's Tanzanite. This should be one of the most expensive. This should be one of the most expensive. Tanzanite once upon a time had multiple blocks, didn't it? It was still a very yes, small mining right, area. Yes. They don't have those block locations anymore. Um, there it is. You can actually see it. That's where we are mining. We used to primarily source from D block uh, back oh. in the day. We don't anymore. It's only C block that's uh, that's uh, that, that's unearthing at Tanzanite now. But the depths are absolutely phenomenal, and the deeper that each mining shaft uh, actually goes, wow. obviously the the the, the more uh, um, the more dangerous it is um, and you should expect to pay a higher premium look look at the equivalent depths that tanzanite mines actually are right now and it's not becoming more and more plentiful the deeper you go well wow. we are going to set a precedent if you like with tanzanite this one locational gemstone to launch this little selection of three millimetres on the back of Mark's demonstrations and that zircon strand, oh. I'm going to say. Twenty carats of tanzanite with that level of quality of colour. At forty nine ninety nine, but we are no way near yeah. done. Oh and this would be goodness. this would be perfect for your um, tubular kiss cross as well. Three mils, it's beautiful. Oh. Three mils. Mark, just take a little look at this picture. Oh, no, thanks. I couldn't... Uh, I went potholing once in sixth form and I hated every minute of it. I couldn't do... No, I couldn't do that. <laughs> that's vertical. I mean, that's... Yeah, it's literally oh, vertical. Even, you know, Steve, Steve Bennett, obviously not when it was at the depth that it is now, went down the Tanzanite mineshaft and he said how oh. strenuous it literally was. They go down all day. Obviously, the only one will make that journey so once. Yeah, boiling, thing. boiling hot. Yeah. Um, you think you're that alone, just the whole mining operation, that alone, I think warrants no. $49.99. This uh, gemological phenomena formed at the same time that the Mount Kilimanjaro, 585 million years ago. We are not stopping at $49.99. In fact, we're not stopping anywhere near $49.99. We had 50, though. I don't think... I know these are going to be an on-screen sellout, Mark, because I... And I oh, hope that way. we start seeing Tanzanite and Zircon versions mm. of this bracelet. I mean, how beautiful would that be? That would be fantastic. Wouldn't it? As I said, I can't remember the last time I saw faceted rounds of any shape no. or size. I well, think we had a strand of smooth rounds a couple of weeks ago, but I can't remember when we've had faceted rounds. Rounds in themselves are rare when it comes to tanzanite because its, it's crystal structure is all thrombic, so yes, it normally yes. has a longer axis, one longer side, if you like, to this gemstone. But faceted round, rounds, Mark's so right in pointing mm. out that that is a real rarity. At 29.99, I had 50 available opportunities. 
I've got um, I've got this bracelet, which is bicones, but oh. it's, it's not far off, is it? So instead of actually using the bicones, you can actually use the tanzanite. Yeah. You could replicate that with with spinel. We've got spinel coming up as well, haven't we? Oh. <laughs> can you imagine? There's not ne no. Wait, 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 wait. Ross has literally just shown me the call screens. Not nearly enough people on the phone lines. I'm going to drop it below. No, we need to sell out of that fifty quantity then. Oh, you know, no. because how about if I said to source your tanzanite and the zircon that you had earlier on today? Well, we already, it, I, yeah, it's already going to be under fifty mm. pounds. But how about if I said? You can get them both for under thirty-five pounds. You shouldn't get Tanzanite <laughs> at a triple, a double-figure price point, no. even triple figure. To be truthful, we are going lower. There are only fifty available opportunities. Mark, that's an, an amazing idea. So literally, you would just swap them out, yeah, would you? Absolutely. Yeah, it's not far off, is it? Yeah. So this is just eleven. This is all fifteen O's with elevens. So all the silver of fifteen. So this is sort of micro flat crisscross, <gasps> if you like. Can you imagine? Yeah. yeah. Not far off that colour, is it? It's really not. And, yeah, <laughs> and, and this is a glass. You glass know, you're looking glass. at a genuine gem here with Tanzanite yeah. and a worldwide, most sought after variety. 19.99, 20 carats. That's a pound a carat, for goodness sake. You've got beautiful vanadium rich colour. Shirley, Devon, you're on it. Well done. Marion, Pat, Gabrielle, Caroline, well done to you as well. Imagine this alongside things like your white onyx. Um, how beautiful. Beautiful. It would not on uh, well, yeah, onyx, but mm. also your white jade. Yeah. Um, how amazing it will be, obviously, in Mark's beautiful bracelets. Definitely should be teamed up, I think, alongside the zircon, though. That's incredible. Unbelievable. How and you've got enough that? in this strand to make, you know, versions of this uh, beautiful yeah, yeah. bracelet. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I don't know how we've done that. I'm right. not entirely sure, but you can still get hold of it. Amazing. Let's dive into the tourmaline. Wow. What about the tubular kiss cross? Can yeah, I use these perfect. in the tubular? Absolutely. All you need to do, instead of using 11 O's and 8 O's, you do use 11 O's and 15's. Okay. So you just drop down two sizes. Okay. Which, which I think we talked about when we did the demo a couple of weeks ago about size difference. And if you want to um, tune in for um, a, a kiss cross demonstration, you're doing that on Wednesday, aren't mm. you? Um, the 8th. 8th. Wednesday yeah. the 8th. Yeah. yeah. Okay, not this coming Wednesday. Yeah. Right, let's open this auction. Beautiful tourmaline, tourmaline with all of its complexities. Let's open it at under £20. Oh, yeah, Mark, yeah. Oh, my goodness, it's, it's look the closest, at that. <gasps> this is the last thing I made before Swarovski decided to stop their elements. That's all Swarovski. You don't. You don't need Swarovski, Mark. No. Because I think no. beautiful gemstones. Yeah. Ah, oh, my word, that's amazing. I've got 40 available. We're not stopping at £19.99, oh. but again, perfect to go alongside the demonstration that you've just had. Not stopping here. Straight away, we've got collectors getting involved up and down the UK. Amazing. You can shop ahead on the spinel, the yellow tourmaline, the beautiful onyx, the um, iolite, the red dragon peridot, and your, your uh, appetite. What? Yes, exactly. <laughs> Exactly, twelve ninety nine. I mean, and we know three millimeter rounds um, are incredibly popular. They're always one of mm. our um, one of those auctions that's on and gone. You know, because even if you even if you don't incorporate it into the kiss cross, you can create really lovely kind of like bubble styles mm, with these. Absolutely, They're great as yeah. an alternative to a knot. Like rosary link looks stunning as well. It does. Really fine, delicate. Well, we bring rosary link chain, don't we? We do. Small gemstones. Yeah, they're not twelve ninety nine though. Um, okay. How, I, I was going to say, oh, how quickly look. do you think this is going to be a sellout? Now, just before mm -hmm. we open this auction, I'm just going to say it out loud, Mark. Because this is one of the most ridiculous deals. Spinel forms alongside sapphires and ruby. Um, it's actually got one of the purest of colours of gemstones. Red, uh, red spinel, sorry, is one of the most valuable. And you know, that's not my words, that's a GIA. This is beautiful. Have a look at this strand. You have literally got pillar box red in this strand. And you've uh, got the cobalt blues. 
and you've got the greens and you've got the golden colors. It's all natural. I'm going to say it out loud because we're going to do it in one price crash. Oh, look at that. Mark, this is going under £10. What? Mm. No. You'd pay you'd really? pay more than that for just one of these red spinels. Oh. Jedi red? You've heard that yeah, terminology yeah. before. Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's one of the most sought after colours. Under ten pounds. There are forty available opportunities. It is completely and utterly natural. This I, I don't know how. I generally you know sometimes we try our hardest to try and justify some of the prices that we do. I can't. I literally no. can't on this opportunity. I'd, I'd multiply on this all day. at five and six I'd get of these. That's beautiful. At nine ninety nine, it will be an on screen <laughs> sellout because we've got collectors and connoisseurs <sighs> who recognise how awesome that is. You know, this is this, this is a gemstone that literally forms alongside that of your rubies, but it's got a purer colour, a much, much purer look at that red in the middle yeah, now. Yeah, Goodness yeah, yeah. me. That that ruby we had earlier. It is. It is, but no yeah, treatment. I think no I, like, I like the orange, the orangey browns, the rust colour. I love that. What an amazing strand. I know. I, I, <laughs> are you sure at 9.99, Ross? I mean, you, you can't change it now, but... Oh, dog. It's done now, he says. <laughs> What's done is done. It's very close to well selling done. out. Unbelievable. Next up, we're going to go back to your wonderful tourmalines. Um, should we just say it out loud? <laughs> Under ten pounds, let's do it. I mean, if you are looking for, it is a day to stock yeah. up your stashes. Absolutely, if you're looking for that perfect golden yellow, but it's more of a, it's more, it's a warmer yellowy oh, no, colour. So um, then this is the gemstone, you know, because if you compare it to that of your canary diamonds or even your sapphire, they won't have this warmth. Um, far too low. It is like a sunset. Oh yeah, like oh like. Like what, sorry? A long summer's day. It's like a strand of single malt. Oh, I was going to say melted butter. Oh. <laughs> All of the above. Sounds Sugar good. on the turn before it turns into caramel. Oh, that sort of thing. yeah, when it yeah. starts bubbling. Yeah. <laughs> yes, 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 like a creme brulee. A bit of honey. Oh, yeah. beautiful. Do, does anybody ever sort of grill? Uh, um, a little bit of sugar on a banana. No. It's really tasty. It? It's really, really oh. tasty. Yeah, just so it caramelizes like that. Oh. It's like that, but it's a rare gemstone. My goodness me, 9 99 mm. Dan chuckled at that. Why did you laugh at that, Dan? Wow. It's very what? Mm. Oh, is it? Sorry. It's just really... <laughs> It's just, just very nice. It's tasty. It's very wow. tasty. How about, not really, banana. Just banana with sugar on the top, I would say. Um, oh. Look at that. Oh. So you could do that bracelet with the, with the zircon and take out the black. You've got, yeah, so those two would make that bracelet. These two? Yeah. So let me just take that, yeah. that one out. Oh yeah. my goodness, yeah. Mark. Uh, uh, uh. These are going to fly out because they're yeah. so perfect with the zircon, aren't they? So perfect. Yeah. If these don't sell out, then I'll probably buy them because I love on it. It's in the price. Uh, Sorry. It is wrong, I agree. Totally yeah. wrong. So wrong, Ross. It's so, so wrong. Wait a minute. You can get both of the strands that I have on the back of my hand right now for just over £20. Cambodian zircon and God. black onyx. It's beautiful. So you can make this that, amazing bracelet. So all you need is a tube of 11 0 gold. And instead and of it being the bike owners, you're using you onyx. Onyx. Oh my goodness <laughs> me. How many yeah. have we got? Oh. 60 available. Huh? There might be a couple of these. We're a bit slow on the uptake with yeah. this one. I'm surprised. <laughs> I love onyx. Yeah. Absolutely love it because it's that, it's that, it, mm. I don't know, quite liquid like black. I think it gives you a different um, appearance. There's still a couple of those available. I'm surprised by that one. Keep on dialing yeah. through. This one will go I in a nanosecond. Yeah. I could count on one hand the amount of times that I see this gemstone probably in the last six months. We rarely ever see it. It's very distinctive. It's not, when we say blue, it's like an indigo blue. Um, totally natural, highly pleochroic. So, oh my good, oh my goodness, look at that. That's so beautiful. 
Look how Just lovely that is. Lovely, isn't it? One for the gents, I always think, are oh, light as well. It's like a purple, purple. It's like yeah. a purpley blue, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's so yeah, it's pretty. Yeah. 6 six ninety nine, Ross. I went all shouty then, sorry. <laughs> 6 99 You're not shouty, you're being passionate. <laughs> That's what it is. Very enthusiastic, yes. yes. <laughs> six ninety nine for Iolite, 60 available. Yeah, the, this, the joy of this gemstone, which we really ever see, and that speaks volumes, doesn't it, if jewellery mm, maker yeah, rarely ever absolutely. see it. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh, well, to be honest, Gemporia, we rarely ever see it. Um, but here you see this beautiful, very distinctive blue. And then under different angles, you'll see flashes of pink. You'll see flashes of burgundy because it's highly pleochroic. Um, yeah, history. This was this was a gemstone that used to aid sailors to navigate across the seas. How amazing is that? But it's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful and shouldn't be six ninety nine. No. We had sixty. Lots of multi buyers. Don't forget, we want to see these in that beautiful uh, demonstration that Mark showed you this morning. Amazing. Shall we now do some red dragon peridot? Mm. I've not. I've not. I've just had this idea in my head. Ooh. So um, if I see if, if I say it now, we're going to have to go ahead with it, aren't we? It um on the twelfth of February. Um, it's my birthday show, which, <gasps> it, which is a Sunday. And what we did last year for my birthday was we had a Mark Smith inspired wall of fame and it was nice. an extra prizes and, and credits. Nice. So I might do that along the line of this sort of nice bracelets. Well, thing. get people so, to make these bracelets or any, for your any, birthday. any Mark inspired things that I've made on, on the screen. Nice the idea. Year, something like that. I might put that to Wayne, but he's not here. He'll be back, to, he'll soon, be back soon, won't he? We've got, we've got, we've got, is it a week? Have we got a week of peace? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Wayne. I don't know what time it is in India right now. I love this strand. We have, haven't we? Haven't we? Ross and I were talking yeah, about this this yeah. morning. We've got a week of peace and quiet. <laughs> um, oh, I love Red is. Dragon Peridot as it's well. amazing, isn't it? Um, beautiful, beautiful colour. Oh, it's totally and utterly natural. Can you imagine this in Mark's demonstration? Look so at that. instead of the instead of the uh, uh, Mark, the bicones, yeah. include your gemstones. Same technique, six ninety nine. Now I have got one more amazing three millimeter strand, oh, and then we're going to dive into um, your deal of the day. Now, as it's the last one, we're going to do it in one price crash. Uh, this shouldn't happen. I think it was wrong wow. when we first loaded them to the website. Green appetite. I mean, it's rare. Beautiful. It's so so rare. Rarely ever see it in jewellery, do you? Don't no. see it really on the oh, high no. street. It's a delicious colour. Yeah. It's, again, very distinctive, isn't it's it? It's in between zavorite and prehnite, isn't it? Perfect. It's that sort of in between. It colour. is. Mm. Yeah. It's like a silvery, grassy gorgeous, green. Yeah. Now we've got a hundred of these under five pounds for you all today for appetite. But more importantly, actually, one of the rarer colours of your appetite. Um, yeah, I can't remember the last time I actually saw it. You don't see it very often, do you? No, no, no. I've never seen it on a, I've only seen chips, and I think. I mm. can't remember seeing it in rounds. Definitely not faceted. It looks like Alexandrite, doesn't it? Oh, it does, It's got it? that look of it. Yeah, yeah, it does. That's a great, yeah. that's a great suggestion. Yeah. Look at how many of you there. Um, again, yeah. there's a hundred of those, so you have got quantity, but yeah, no, the call screens are already super duper duper busy. Amazing. We've still got loads to bring you as well, lovely jewelry makers. Wow. You have got your Minas Geris Brazilian Kunzite coming up as your deal of the day. And oh my goodness me. When I launched or was, was one of the first people that launched Minas Geris Kunzai on, I was on the USA channel at the time. It was all in gold. You wouldn't have seen it in oh, silver. Wow. It was Minas Geris Kunzai, well, one of a kind pieces, um, or Thomas Ray pieces, so they're all in your high-end gold. This is of that ilk. The quality of this Kunzai is impeccable wow. um and yeah i know where it's going to and believe me it's it it, it it it's incredible there's never been a better opportunity for you to buy Kunz, uh, kunzite than today widely regarded as one of the most feminine of gemstones that's coming up as your deal of the day in a few moments time make sure you check out your basket thank wow. you mark that pleasure was a lovely I demonstration enjoyed it. Great, really enjoyed you. that uh, we'll be back after this
It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery maker, sewing street and hobby maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Oh my goodness me, I literally cannot believe these Kunzites. It is actually the first time I've seen them today. It is, they've just arrived. Oh my goodness me, I've saw them on the recording, I've seen them obviously in black and white on our computer screens, but you know, you're like, oh, they're so much better than I, listen, I'll be honest, that I was expecting, and I know that we were always going to bring you great quality, but I looked at the price point and made an assumption, and how wrong was my assumption? Honestly, just check, just check this out. This one. This is just one. The one that we're going to start with. So when I said earlier on, back in 2014, I believe it was, um, maybe a little bit before. Anyway, Gems, our sister channel, launched Minas Jaris Kunzite. Now, and I know that, that, do you remember that launch? Gosh. Do you remember? It's only recent as that. Yeah, it was about... Because wow. we bought the entire parcel. Right. It was discovered probably about 2012, and by the Gosh. time we brought it to air, etc., it was maybe around 2013, 2014. Anyway, um, and Steve saw it, the parcel, heard the opportunity, and immediately said, I'll have it all, and literally bought it all. Wow. Why? 
because quite literally, Kunzai is a member of the spodumene, fam spodumene family that ordinarily has to be heat treated to encourage the pink colours. This parcel needed none. And oh, you'll see, wow. not enhanced, not enhanced, not enhanced, not enhanced, not enhanced. None of it. The quality was that good. So he bought the entire parcel. So when we were launching them, um, I didn't launch them on Gems. Um, I didn't launch them on the USA channel, but I did bring them. Um, Minas Jeris Kunzite was only ever in gold. We'd never, it wasn't until much later on that we decided to put some pieces in silver. But initially, it was only ever in gold. And there was a lot of one-of-the-kind pieces. They were all in the reeks or something like that. Um, astonishingly expensive. But let's talk about Kunzite because it's a gemstone that we rarely ever see here at Jewelry Maker. And I know there will be people watching that don't know what Kunzite is. Firstly, the examples that you were looking at on your screens, they're not the best quality, I'll be honest. That, that yeah, they're beads. They're not the best quality. But this article, which aren't, isn't my words, does talk about the gemstone very well. So, pretty in pink, Kunzite. And this was written in 2021. Kunzite, a variety of spodumene, is a relatively lesser known gem in the world of jewellery. Yet, as beautiful as pink to violet colouring, owed by the presence of manganese, continue, continues sorry, to attract a growing number of admirers, admirers and collectors. Although other varieties of spodumene have been known since the 1800s, kunzite was first discovered just over a century ago, making it a relative new addition to the world of gemstones. It received its name in honour of Tiffany's & Co, then head gemologist George Frederick Kunz. I mean, that in itself, yeah. the status alone. <laughs> Um, then, uh, mostly occurring in a variety of shades of pale pink, kunzite may also be, also be violet to vivid purple in colour. A standout feature of this gemstone is its uh, trichroque nature. When different colours may be seen from different uh, crystal, crystallographical graphical, sorry, uh, directions. This is of particular importance in the cutting process because the most intense color is seen in the direction of the C axis, the length of the crystal. The stone should be cut with its uh, table facet perpendicular to the C axis to achieve the best color. So I, might, I don't want to confuse anybody, but basically, and they, they do similar with your tanzanite as well. Um, the direction of the crystal growth and how you orient, uh, orient uh, and take your gemstone rather makes a big difference when it comes to uh, your kunzite. Oh, it can that. intensify the right. pinks quite significantly. I'll read on. Um, this is off our own website as well. This is off the Gemporia Learning Library. Its colour of lilac and delicate pink hues is unique in the gem world. And it is thought of as one of the most romantic and feminine of gems. When you look at a kunzai, it can appear pink, violet, violet and sometimes colourless from different angles. This optical effect is known as pleochrosum. It is a member of the spodumene family, as we've already covered. And when found in yellow or greenish blue colour is known as hiddenite. While kunzite is rare, hiddenite is so scarce it is virtually unobtainable. One of the most beautiful aspects of kunzite is its ability to retain light. Yes, this gemstone literally has a, um, a superpower. The effect is known as phosphorescence, which gives the gem the ab ability to glow in the dark. This luminous appearance is due to the fact that kunzite is able to absorb energy and slowly release it uh, in the form of light. The effect is similar to luminous hands on a watch, which help you tell the time. Wow. How amazing is that? <laughs> Literally a gemstone, as it sat here in the studio, is absorbing light and holding on to it. So that when you wear this gem, say, I don't know, on a night out, if you're going out for a nice romantic dinner, you will literally see your kunzite glow. And that's not an exaggeration. Reading on. Although there are no legends relating to this gemstone, there, um, and that's purely because of the age, yes, basically, yeah. it's very young. 
Uh, there is one true story which begins in 1963 when JFK bought his wife, Jacqueline Kennedy uh, Ohanasis, uh, a Kunzite ring, um, Onassis, sorry, uh, to celebrate the 10th Christmas together. Regrettably, he was assassinated before he had a chance to give it to her. And for a very long period after his death, it was almost impossible to separate Jackie, Jackie Kennedy from her Kunzite. I mean, if you, do you know what? If you think about her... Mm. Um, Jackie Onassis, it comes like it's the perfect stone, isn't it? It is, her? actually. Because yeah, yeah. she was so beautifully yes. feminine. Um, big statement pieces, you know, the likes of Tiffany's and Co. And they are celebrating milestones and anniversaries. They chose this gem. They chose Kunzite. The Tiffany anniversary pendant, Kunzite pendant, it's oval, look at the size, seven, uh, 175 carats, set with diamonds and platinum on a diamond and platinum chain. But, yeah, you know, Tiffany's will have multiple gemstones at their disposal, but they chose Kunzite. Yeah. It is breathtakingly beautiful. Here's another piece from the jewellery editor. This enchanting new necklace from Shoppard's red carpet collection, flaunts, oh, great word, flaunts 87 carats of pear-shaped kunzite surrounded by green beryls, tanzanite, and brilliant That's cut diamonds. That's incredible. It's like it, a peacock, isn't it? It is. Yeah. It is. I love the photograph of that yeah. as well. Um, many people believe that kunzite gems is strongly connected to the heart, so many people will lean towards it for that reason as well. There's definitely the romantic vibe about it. Um, it's thought that the stone has the ability to shine a light on all matters that have to do with the heart and in turn circulation. As a healer of the body, this crystal helps us to bear, uh, helps the bearer, sorry, keep their uh, breath flowing in a way that helps to regulate the circulatory systems and keep the heart's, heart's muscles strong. So oh. if you believe in the metaphysical side of things, fabulous, you probably already know that. Um, but for me, I look at these and I, all I re I'm reminded of is that, hang on, these should be in gold. These are one-of-a-kind pieces. The quality of this kunzite is what I remember us launching all those years ago, almost 10 years ago. Um, and I know what they're going to in terms of a price point. Believe me, this is incredible. If you remember that launch on our sister channel, and occasionally you see Minas Jerris pieces sort of popping up, don't you, um, uh, on our sister channel. I know Toby launched an amazing collection of kunzite uh, more recently, but they were all literally one of a kind. Trust me, these would not look out of place. Are we ready for this opportunity? Are you ready to start this incredible deal of the day? I'm, I'm shopping with you. I hope you don't mind. I'm going to start with a beautiful cushion, certified completely natural. Most kunzite, I'm not saying all, most kunzite is treated, most of it. But what was so exciting about the Minas Gerais parcel from Brazil is that it needed literally zero enhancement. Look at how beautiful that delicacy of pink is. I love the cushion cut. This is in great engagement ring worthy. Would we all Absolutely. agree? Yeah. Would we all agree? I mean, you could literally surround this in a halo of diamonds. Maybe like Jackie Kennedy's uh, piece. Oh, we can show you a photograph. There it is. Surround it in a halo of diamonds. Imagine it's set into gold or platinum, whatever you wish. And that would be a four-figured price tag piece of jewellery, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh! The first price point, though, is £74.99. First. first. Do you know where these are no going, No idea. I thought Honestly. That, I thought that, I'm more than happy with that. <laughs> what? There's never been a better p p opportunity for you to buy a, a Kunzite than today. Because this is oh. going under £50. <laughs> My friend's got a cushion-cut engagement ring. And I could, it's not, it's not Kunzite, but I can tell you it was four figures. I thought you said £50. Uh, I did. That's what Ross told me. That's under 40 though, Ross. Look at the quality of this stone. If you don't get him, I, I'm going to be getting some of these. Do you know what? I, at this, these kind of prices, you can make matching earrings. Absolutely, it's not the yes. issue. It, it's not challenging to get the mounts. It's not challenging to, um, you know, to get the piece of jewellery made. You know, we can we can direct you. Imagine this sending this to the guys over in Cast or something like <laughs> yeah. that. Oh yeah. How beautiful that piece of jewellery would be. 
The issue is actually sourcing Minas Gerais Kunzite of this quality for under £40. But it's not even your price point. Oh, this is ridiculous. Certified 1.4 carats. Do you own a Larique? No. No. I wish. No. We used to, no. we used to get the opportunity to wear a Larique ring on the balls. Oh, okay. But I had to give it back. Right. You know, the Chris and the Gems balls, yeah. That but I always so had to give beautiful. it back. I did wear a, a Minas Gerais Gunsight pendant <laughs> once wow. upon a time. Oh, you're joking. Where is Minas Gerais? Brazil. Oh, Brazil, right, okay. In Brazil. Best place for gems, isn't it? It clearly is. Yeah. Can you believe this is happening right now? 29.99. Every, every bone in my body is telling me that these should be at least three figures, at the very, very, very least. I've never seen a parcel quite like this before. I've never seen a price tag quite like this before. Again, you've got that perfect, delicate pink. It's not, it, 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 you're not looking for, by the way, candy floss pink. You are actually looking for something that is much more delicate and feminine, as those articles suggested. There will be retailers getting involved. In fact, I know wow. there are retailers getting involved who'll probably get this home. They'll probably design the piece of jewelry around it. Um, and then who knows what price top point they're gonna command. It can, it it should be significantly more than what's on your screen. Um, let's do what, sorry. Oh. oh, my goodness. Pear. I got it. Oh. I love Gunzai. It's been such a long time, though. For a long period, Kunzai was my number one favourite gemstone. But then when you don't see it, you kind of... Yes, yes. I don't want to say forget, because you couldn't forget about this. Look how beautiful that is, Mark. Absolutely exquisite, isn't it? It's deep as well, isn't it? Yeah. So this Gosh. is a big stone. Yeah. It's two carats. Oh my goodness me. It is busy. Straight away, I've got lots of you there. We guarantee two carats, but look at the graphics right now. 2.38. <laughs> you are probably going to get significantly more. Look at that perfect colour. Do you know, if you're watching right now and you're thinking of, I don't know, anniversary presents you're thinking about special milestone gifts if you're thinking about engagement rings or i don't know then then look no further because this is i am just mad please know that 29.99 is no reflection of the true value or worth um adam you remember minas jerris being launched don't you do you remember the prices that it was hundreds if not thousands of pounds it was never 29.99 was it especially of this grade these are going to sell out we've got all around the world getting involved the quality of them are absolutely beautiful and, and i'll be completely honest if there's any of them left then i will definitely buy them you know because buy them and sell them on even without making them into yeah, a piece of jewelry if need be let's do what another cushion <gasps> is it the is it the nine by seven cushion Oh, I, um, I gravitated towards this one. I think this is good. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Even upside down. Yeah, yeah. Look Amazing. at that pavilion. Let me just get rid of that bit of fluff there. Look at that for a pavilion. It's That's a huge gorgeous. stone. Flip it over. Come on. Over your pop. Look at the quality oh, of that look stone. At that. <laughs> It's stunning, isn't it? Yeah, I gravitated towards this one because of its size, I would be honest. Um, but I wouldn't want it to be big if it didn't have the quality of clarity, it didn't have the quality of colour. Look at how beautiful. Comes completely certified, free of charge. This one's a giant. We are starting at 49.99 and we are going even lower. The biggest carrot weight that we have brought you thus far. And we are still going to match the under £30 uh, price tag. Look at that. Does that look like a double-figure price tag? No, not in a million years. It, it, it doesn't, does it? Definitely, definitely not. 
and it's certified completely natural. These are flying out the door. We've got retailers getting involved, haven't got a problem with that at all. Why wouldn't they? Because this is beyond wholesale. £30 for natural. Minas Geris Kunzite, that parcel that really um, was, it was a, definitely, I think, a defining moment in the, in the Kunzite uh, uh, sort of journey. You know, it was only discovered in the early 1900s. The fact that this was literally named after George Frederick Kunz himself um, speaks volumes. But yeah, 2000, I think it was around about 2011. Don't quote me on that. But that discovery um, within Brazil, that location, they were originally mining for ore and they came across this beautiful pink gemstone. Oh, it's an accident. It was accident. a complete flute, oh, complete wow. flute. Um, under £30, amazing. Let's bring you the last pair. Oh, it's, it's a big one. This is a big one. 10 by 8 millimetres. Now, does anyone mind if I get my phone out when I'm... Because I'm, I'm drawn to this one. It's beautiful. Come on. Do you know what? I don't want a pink diamond. I prefer Kunzite. Mm. No, I think you're right. Controversial? No. no I, no, I think no, you no. get more from a pink, from a Kunzite than you do a pink diamond. <laughs> the wow. biggest carrot weight thus far. Look at this. Oh, hang on. Come on, behave. Oh Look at that. Oh, I, I've got to dial through for this one. 2.65 carats to be anywhere near a double figure. Look at the quality of that faceting. 10 by 8 millimetres. You could so easily get yourself a mount for this. And if you don't, if we don't have that size, source it elsewhere. There you go. I've said it. Find it elsewhere. It's all about sourcing the. You've got a great deal on your Kunzite here. I can't believe you're doing this, Ross. <laughs> but it's a massive carat weight. It's it, the biggest, isn't it? And yeah. we're doing it at the same price. Yeah. Oh, how ridiculous. If you saw this on my hand with maybe a couple of diamonds either side, would you think it was going to be like, I don't know? I think you're really flash. Yeah, you'd think I had quite yeah, a, you know, quite, quite a good Very budget. generous husband. A very generous <laughs> husband, absolutely. <laughs> £30. Thirty pounds. You can get hold of wow. two point six five carats. How amazing is! I, if, I, again, I will wait to the break, but I'm all over this as well. Hello, Sarah. Hi, all. I oh. have several Larique pieces. They're stunning. These kunzites would look amazing alongside them. Well, oh, I mean, lucky you, because I know how beautiful the, uh, the Larique pieces actually are. Um, and they do. They wouldn't look out of place, would they? Lovely. They wouldn't look out wow. of place at all alongside the Larique pieces. You know, we always. I always used to you know, drool over the Larique pieces. Yeah. Jewelry, oh, one day. And do gems still do them? No, no, not I'm not sure. I'm not entirely sure. Because I know Steve used to buy the stones, um, and then the piece would be designed around oh, the stone really? itself. Right. Yeah, it used to be right. in that order, and obviously only ever one. So mm. uh, they were more Steve's baby, if right. you like. So yeah. well done, you, Sarah, if you've got hold of some of those. Well yeah. done, well done, well done. There are a ton of you with them in your baskets. I've got literally, is it two? Yes, two. I've got two more. I was about to say, oh, do I have this one or do I have that one? But they're 30 quid. Oh, they're beautiful. I think this is my favourite. Now, over two carats. Oh, look at this. It's the depth of them. I think that's amazing. Look at that. This is my favourite. It's so similar to the uh, Jackie Onassis one. Yeah, absolutely. Um, how many have you got, Ross? Have we? Okay, I don't feel so bad then. Don't feel so bad, because I definitely need to get one of these. <laughs> That's unbelievable. I mean, look at Jackie Onassis's uh, um, Kunzite. I wonder where, they, where it is now. I wonder who owns it now. Well, it's still maybe in her <gasps> family's estate. Probably in a museum. Right. Or whether oh. she might still own it, I don't know. Mm, she's not with us anymore. Or a family, mm, I mean, yeah, sorry. Yeah. Um, her family might still yeah. own it. She's beautiful. She is be very beautiful. Mm. But if you think about her and how feminine she was, you know, uh, this yeah. is the perfect gem choice, I think. The perfect, perfect gem choice. Um, again, it's about accessing and sourcing gemstones like this. You know, the actual piece, what you turn it into, 
can count, uh, can come at a um, at a later stage. That level of quality, that eye clean clarity, that depth of its saturation of colour, and the size that we are looking at right now is is just unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. I can't believe we're doing this, Ross. No. Take that along to a jeweler's if you wish. How many jewellers, you know, high street jewellers would have kunzite in their window? I don't think any would. Uh, no, that's true. I mean, I'm thinking of one. There's one in um, Ulster. Mm -hmm. So you drive past yeah, Ulster, yeah. where, where yeah. I used to live. And it's like a privately owned jeweller. Um, I know the owner. She's, a very, she's ever so sweet. And if you go to her and you, if I was to take her this stone and say, right, I want it in, I don't know, rose gold. I want it to have just maybe a couple of diamonds, put pen to paper. Um, all right, you would definitely pay more for the actual piece of jewellery to be constructed than you are right now for the stone. But the reality is, it should be the other way yeah, around. Completely, it absolutely. should be the other way around. This is absolutely incredible. We are opening this auction opportunity up. And we're, not, we're opening what? it at. Oh, my God. Opening it. <laughs> Seriously, look at the size of it. Natural kunzai. <laughs> Adam, you need to get... Uh, you're, I can tell you really like this. It's really yeah. good. Have, we're starting at 29.99. I'm just sorry, I could see Adam, who's on cameras right now before me, the reaction. You need to get some of these. Do you know what? Gosh. Pendants, at this price point, and we're going lower, earrings, pendant, ring. I just love the undertone of lavender about it. It's, it's just so delicate, isn't it? What? Oh, no. What's he going to... I don't know what's going on today, but there's a clock ticking. And I'm going to say it out loud. Would we all agree, jewellery maker, uh, crew, this has to be one of the best deals we've ever seen? <laughs> and also ridiculous. It is ridiculous, isn't it? I've no true. It wasn't until much later on in that parcel that we actually started even entertained bringing it to air in, sing, in silver. Um, prior to that, it was always in gold and it was always four figures. Always. It's one of, currently one of the, the, the stones that they have the least of. I'm not. Yeah, we didn't get it very often. Yeah. Didn't get it very often. Would we all agree one of the most beautiful, though? I adore Kunzite. I absolutely love it. It was always one of my favourites when I was actually presenting on um, rocks. And that's because I used to see it. You almost forget, don't you, when it's, uh, when yeah, it's we on our screens. We haven't got that screens. piece in the museum anymore, have we? The piece of Kunzite? The big one, yeah. Do we not? Did I we sell it? I don't think it's out there, is it? Or oh, maybe Steve's got it. No, right. it was his. Oh, no, it's still there. Is it still there? Oh, over the other side. Oh, right. Oh. Right. right. Stop. I mean, right. stop it. That's stop it. That's ridiculous, 1999. That is ridiculous, isn't it? That's crazy. That's, it, that's three tubes of seed beads. <laughs> Do you know? You're getting... a. a Probably not far off. <laughs> well, look at the graphics now, 3.61 carats. It's huge. So it's the highest... I we guarantee... That. Let me explain it. Mm. We guarantee 2.6. Oh, okay. Um, but you'll probably get more than get that. More, so yeah. we will always under under promise and over deliver, basically. The, uh, you know, I don't care if I get the 2.6. That's still a massive gunsight. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely massive. And I'm just thinking about probably going down the uh, uh, Jackie Onassis route and having a halo of diamonds all yeah. the way around. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Never been a better opportunity to get hold of Minas Jerus Kunzai than right here, right now. Would we all agree? Um, you know, I, I know there are jewellers. Um, look at this. Look, this is the Tiffany's & Co. anniversary pendant. They went for the oval. Yep. It does work with the Kunzai. And it talk, it's, I guess that's relating to the faceting. Remember that C axis. You need the longer C axis to intensify the colour itself. Um, they've haloed it with diamonds as well. Oh, look at how beautiful. Do you notice the unique faceting as well? That really seems to, uh, that, 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 that Lepidurus will actually adopt alongside uh, Kunzai. Can you see you've got much more delicate facets on the pavilion of the stone? You also see it in the uh, um, Tiffany's and Co. piece as well. I can't believe we're at 19.99. This is not a strand of nuggets. 
Do you know, if it was a strand of Kunzite nuggets, yeah. yeah. You'd let's be happy do with it. that, wouldn't you? Let's do it. Mm. I can't believe we're, we're doing it at £20, this quality, this quality of colour. We had a hundred of them, incredibly. Even if you have no idea what you're going to do with it as of yet, no, 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 it no. would be silly for us to pass up this opportunity. I've got quite a few loose stones and I just keep them in a tin. And then I just, in their packets. And then, yeah, yeah, and then I just take them out and look at them. and It's a really nice way of just relaxing for 10 minutes, just looking at all your gemstone collection. Willow calls them treasure. Oh, Looks at the loose stones, all yeah. treasure, mummy. And that's what they are. The last one. <sighs> Can't believe we just did that. No. I got mine. I've got a hundred of these. Oh, the colour of this is amazing. Look at the colour. Yeah, yeah. Before you even see Before it. Before we see it. This colour is incredible. Have you seen that? I do, yeah. I don't even know. I don't know how. I don't know how. I don't know how. The quality of colour on this one is unbelievable. Let me just pick it up in the tweezers. I think it'll be I don't better. I not understand this. Don't understand it. Ross, don't you do it. If you're thinking... I've just got in my head... Oh my word, look at that. The quality of the colour. Not nearly enough people on the phone lines. This is a shining example. This shouldn't happen. Shouldn't happen. And I get it, Minas Juris Kunzite is, or Kunzite, full stop, is not on our screens very well, uh, very often rather. Um, so we don't know the gemstone that well. Um, and I'm assuming lots of you with your gemstone knowledge do, and you're the ones that are dialing through. This is ridiculous. We don't do Minas Geris Kunzai of this gem quality that is totally worthy of being an 18 karat gold or platinum. Would we all agree? Would we all agree? We definitely don't do it under 20 pounds. We most certainly <laughs> should not. Do it under 15. I don't know. I don't know how this is even possible no, right now. No. Um, Good day to tune in. Uh, most definitely. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Adam's pulling the facial expression oh. that I've never seen him pull before. It's, a, it, it, it's bewilderment, confusion, all rolled into one. There are a hundred available. Half the stock has gone already. Can you believe? And, and listen, if you're thinking, I don't do gem setting, it doesn't matter. I uh, don't do gem setting. I've neither, got a massive collection I. of stones. I love them. Yeah, love neither them. do I. I'll walk into, mm. into a jeweller at some point. Or you know what? Even if I don't, I'll pass them on to my future generations, knowing full well that Tiggy and Willow will never, ever get a meanest Jerus Gunzite at fourteen ninety nine. No, no, it's not. Will they get happen. one at all by then? No, probably not. Probably not. they'll be able to get Kunzite, I should imagine, but yeah. not from this this historic discovery that happened at the beginning of what I think wow. it was two thousand and eleven. Hello, Jane. At that price, it'd be silly <laughs> not to buy one from my granddaughter's gem collection. Absolutely, Absolutely yeah, yeah, yeah. Jane. I'm Best thinking to in it. total agreement. Yeah. Even if you have not got a Scooby Doo clue mm. what you're going to do with your Kunzite as of yet, we would be silly not to. Um, because the quality is so amazing. Hello, Alison. Um, I think whichever precious metal you go for, um, the pinks and lavenders comes out, but rose accentuates yes. the pinks and silver. Yeah. Uh, the lavenders love mine. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I agree. It does. It's one of those that complements gold. It complements rose gold most definitely. Um, yeah, and if you want it to be cooler, then definitely go with the sort of silvery tones. Unbelievable. I can't believe that just happened. I literally no, can't believe that no. just happened. Um, now, oh my word, coming up, coming up, lovely jewelry makers, stay on the phone lines for that. We have got the last of stock, pristine, pure white jadeite rounds. Now there are less than 10, sorry, less than 20 of each of these strands. They are all coming up. 
in a few moments time. Um, I do have some lovely class. Will you do those? Let's do them. Oh, Rose and silver, which one do you want me to start with? You get three. Start with silver, lovely, few. Here they are. Hang on. Symbols. Would these work with your demonstration in the nine o'clock hour? Yeah. They are symbols, aren't That's they? That's the symbol range, yeah. Or very similar too. You get all three of them, Mark. Mm. All three of them. That That's beautiful. A brilliant idea, actually. Oh, and look at those. Did you hear what Ross said they were going under? No. Mm. I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you. There's a hundred of these. You get all three one. of them. You haven't got to choose. They're the snappy ones. What are the snappy ones? Can't see what they've got the specs on, honestly. No. They're just here. I'll wait till he sees them, get, gets the reaction as well, because oh, he hasn't looked up. Yet. Yeah, these would be amazing. I don't think Mark's looked at the screen in front of him. That's for one of them. Yeah, you That's get all three. One. Box class, that yeah. lovely nautical with multi-layers, and you get, like you said, the symbol ones. Yeah. So they so they fit in with your seed beading, don't they? They'd be amazing. <laughs> We're not stopping at 9 99 We've got 100 opportunities. We've also got this exact bundle in the rose gold as well. So if I hold these up, Mark, so these replicate the size of your seed beads, don't, don't they? They would be your eight. I'm just trying to let's have a look. So they fit. Work. They fit in your seed beading. But or it could be general beading. It doesn't have to be seed beads. No, no, as long as you've got a round. So um, those three millimetre rounds that we had earlier on? <gasps> The three millimetre round strands that we had earlier on. Perfect, they'll fit in there. Direct one, just trying to think how that would, would work with that. Yes. Let's have a look. Yeah, you, can, you almost got, sew it into the bracelet. Because you've got one, two, three, four, eight O's on the end. So those little prongs would be your eight O's. So you could, so you could start the demo that I showed you, but instead of in putting on your eight O's at the beginning, you slide the 11 O's through those little, yeah, that would work amazingly. Love, that's it's a nice gonna, idea. It's going to be a nice way nice to finish it off, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, for all of your three millimetre showcase that we've brought you for Mark's amazing demonstrations, and you do get all three of them as well, uh, three different designs. Each, that's a multi row as well, as you can see. I'm Lots trying to think of a way of attaching that to a loom. This one? And treat or this, those, one. The, this one here, and treat oh, yeah. the, little, the little circles, the little holes there, as your loom. It's a good idea. I'm trying to think how you would do it. Seven ninety nine for all three. Oh, I'm sure. Okay. Yeah, if anyone's going to figure it out, you would. All the loomers would know. All yeah. the loomers out there. Yeah. Seven ninety nine. Um, <laughs> all the loomers out there. <laughs> oh, I like that. <laughs> um, love it. Love it. Love it. Loads of you there. It's just super duper busy today. Nuala, Tina, Pauline, Lisa, Liana, Renfusha, East Sussex, Ali, nice. Beryl, Kerry, uh, Em and Sorry, Lynn, Silly Bryce. They are big. And do you know what? They're, 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 they're as much the design as they are the function, no, don't you think? Yeah. I'm just imagining a, a quadruple row pearl necklace. Oh, nice. That would be lovely. Oh, look at that. Can you see it goes on, the actual box glass goes into the side as opposed to. Oh, that's clever. Really clever. So you literally just slide it down the like multi -layer so. Multi-layer necklace or bracelet. Yeah, yeah, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. There are tons of you there um, getting involved. Make sure you do check them out, lovely jewelry makers, and I'll show you. Um, here we go. So literally just, I had to bring it up, I couldn't see it from miles distance. I don't know how you guys demo, you know, with it, I'm shocked. <laughs> um, there you are, click it into place, job done. So you've got a really lovely uh, intricate box That's class. Gorgeous. You've got that nautical vibe. You can shop ahead on the rose gold as well. Plus you've got that lovely, almost mermaidial kind of shape. Yeah, I love The that. rose gold's coming up next. Um, let's do it now, shall we? Graphics alive. There's that one. And there's that one. Lovely. Plus the extender on this. That's lovely. It's a nice soft colour, isn't it? Yeah, sometimes really it can be nice. too this pink, is quite blush. can't it? It's like blush. a blush. <laughs> yeah, it's the perfect colour, isn't it, of your rose gold. Mm. Um, so base metal, meaning we can bring you a great, great deal. Again, I, I agree with you, Mark. Even if you mm. just literally did strands and strands and strands, yeah. multi rows of 
sort of pearls or your favorite gemstone. Um, I'm not sure we should, but we will anyway. We're going to match the price tag of the previous opportunity. Um, let's take it. Under 10. <laughs> you can get both colors. Amazing. For, with change for under 20 pounds. 7.99, goodness me. Alison, Lisa, well done. Dumfries, Carol, wow. Nancy, Patricia, Renfusion, Nuala, Alice, Winifred, hello to you. Uh, I can't keep up every time. Every time I say someone's name, the call screen jumps <laughs> down. It's been busy from start to finish this morning, Amazing. Mark, hasn't oh, it? I love the name Winifred. Me too, me too. Is your, do, do you get it shortened to Winnie? Winnie, yeah, Win. Tiggy was almost Winnie. Really? Mm. Between the two. Oh. I'd love Winnie. Uh, Tiggy had been um, a ch is a childhood name for me. So yeah, Winifred, pretty. Um, yeah, lots of pretty names. So Prince Florence William, the Prince other William's day. godmother is Tiggy, isn't she? Yes, and she's from Krakow. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I knew oh. her as a child. Oh. Yeah. Oh. She's a right potty mouth. Was she? Yeah, swears. Right. Honestly, she swears like a trooper. <laughs> Honestly, uh, seven ninety nine only. Well done, well done. Let's continue with um, a sort of a base wow. metal theme. Now, one of the most uh, popular auctions of the year. Can't talk today. Um, I know what you're going to say, Ross. It's the bees, isn't oh, it? Yeah, bees. I thought so. Yeah. Um, these ridiculous. have been. Yeah, you get fifty of these little bumblebees. I would just put a row with a little spacey bit in between on a piece of elastic or memory wire bangle. Yeah, I think that'd be lovely. The yellow tourmaline that we had yes. earlier on. Oh, that's a nice idea. They are very limited, probably the last chance to actually buy. They are double-sided little bees. Um, and yeah, we were showing photographs, weren't we, of the little fuzzy, fuzzy oh, bumblebees. Yeah. Fuzzy bottoms. Fuzzy bottoms that are drunk on nectar. Mm -hmm. Their little feet just sticking out the top of the flowers. <laughs> it's just adorable. You get 50 oh, of them, ridiculous. yeah. Absolutely amazing. Um, I remember what these were going to. I remember, Ross. It was mad. Fifty p per bee. Bargain. I think all the designers that use bees now, um, Pandora, use them. Gucci, mm -hmm. use them. Uh, Monroe Chappy. Alex Monroe. Yeah. Lily Rose. Gems. I saw had bumblebees on the other day as well. Our sister channel. That's fifty p per bee, and it's nowhere near your closeout. Uh, your 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 final price. It is the last chance, though. I would imagine we will probably need to reorder these because they've been so popular. We've got 50 left, just under. We had a massive quantity at the beginning. It's the detail on these little bees. They're ever so sweet. You know the ones that are just not even the slightest bit aerodynamic bumble, uh, damp, uh, bumblebees? <laughs> you know the ones that literally do bumble around? <laughs> <laughs> That's what you can see here. I think they're just, they're just cute, aren't they? And of course, the most imperative integral species on our Completely. planet. Completely. Yep. Nine ninety nine only. For fifty. For fifty of them. What's that working out each? Forty p, thirty p, twenty p per bumblebee. So yeah, just literally put them on chain. Mm. Nice. Lovely idea. Lovely, like, lovely actually. Bottom of a head pin and earrings. They leave like like those, but just leave the leave the posts and just have them, because they'd move and flutter and I think it would look really cute. Love that, yeah. absolutely love that. Do you leave sugary water out in your garden? You well, we've, we've got enough flowers and plants in the That's garden true. to keep them That's true. more than occupied. So they're like, oh, it's like, it's like a, it's an all you can eat buffet <laughs> is, in your yeah. garden, isn't it? Yeah. Um, amazing, 9 99 only. Oh yeah, no, we definitely need to put the sugary water out because I'm terrible at gardening. <laughs> um, make sure you check out though, because there's less than 50 of these available at the beginning of the auction. You are getting all 50 within a pack. Yeah, they're just sweet, aren't they? There's so many ways that you can use them. Yeah, on the top of a bead. Just yeah. on top of yeah. a bead. Yeah. Maybe, Mark, maybe you've got, I don't know, amber, yeah, that's a great yeah, idea. Or maybe yeah. you've got like a, hot, um, a flower carved gemstone. That'd be lovely, wouldn't How it? nice would that yes. be to actually yeah. include them in that? Yeah. Um, amazing. Stay where you are on those phone lines. Let's do um, last a chance opportunities to get hold of this white jade. Now, lots of you did message in, so thank you for your patience. Um, now, there's less than 20 of each and every single one of these, so you will need to be quick. Uh, 
I've said it before so many times, we've shared the word of Richard Wise, who when I did my accreditation with the GIA, it was Richard Wise's book that Secrets of the Gem Trade that Steve actually gave to me to, to digest um, as best I possibly could. It's a big book. Um, and he said of all the colors of jade that's out there, white, with a, uh, um, what was it, a pure colour, mm. a fine texture and a moderate translucency should be considered the finest of its type. I can tell you, these, this is so pure, it's linen fresh white. Now we've got less than 20 of each and every single one of these. Right. They are limited. Um, I can't believe we're doing this size, frankly, no, white. No, I've not seen it in this size. No, they, sh they normally are much, mm. much, much smaller. So to actually get white jade eye of this size, I'm very surprised by. I can't hear Ross. So I'm just gonna follow your lead, Ross. I know there's less than 20 available opportunities. It's certified completely and utterly natural um and there have been people already messaging through um wanting to get involved i can again mark to see that size in in white it's incredible jade, isn't it as i said i've not seen it in this size before i'm lucky i've got a, a 12 mil round at home in green which i absolutely covet i cherish it but i've never seen 12 mil in white no, Beautiful. because this is one of the yeah. rarest of colours, yeah. of course. Absolutely, yeah. Size makes a, makes a difference. There are only, oh. thank you, Ross, um, only 14 available. This is... Oh. Uh, Last chance to get hold of these pure, beautiful white sizes. You, are, of course, have got those lovely areas of colour within. You've got some of the sort of reddish mm. tones running through, and you've got a couple of the... Um, I can't remember the terminology. It's not the moss and snow. What was the other one? Um, where you actually get those tiny, tiny little areas within your jadeite floating flower. Thank oh. you. Where you have, well remembered, Ross. <laughs> um, tiny, tiny little areas of green within a different colour. I mean, even here, uh, at £1,299, that's absolutely incredible. Look at the kind of price points that white jadeite, never mind the shape or the carving or the history of it. I'm not looking at any of that. But, you know, astonishingly expensive, astonishingly um, expensive. And the colour is not, is it, some of those are actually a little bit more green, aren't they, than they are actually white. Not the first, so lot 1001. That's pristine white like colour. But I'd say two and three. Here we go. Look at the one in the middle. I love that. Clinging on to the white there, really, aren't they, <laughs> I would say. A beautiful carving, nonetheless. Yeah, yeah. 37 and a half thousand US dollars. Goodness me. Pale greenish white. We are down to the final 11. For this carat weight and this size, you seldom ever, ever, ever see it. 525 carats. We 100% are being blasé sometimes, Ross, aren't we? You know, type A white jadeite. We shouldn't be just casually bringing this, oh, a closeout deal, we've only got 20 of these available. It's one of the world's rarest gemstones. And these are absolutely gigantic. At 499, that's epic. That's an unbelievable deal. You know, you could literally knot this, put it on a high-end clasp and, uh, and send it to Sotheby's. I didn't realise just how easy that was until recently mm, mm. Um, because I, uh, we're obviously in the process of sorting out my mum's house. I didn't realise how easy it is to sell things on Sotheby's. Mm. A big price crash. There are seven chances remaining. This is the biggest size I've ever seen in white jade. I don't think we've ever done any bigger than this. The last seven. Look how pure this is. Yeah, crazy. Wow. <laughs> That's what's going on today? Amazing. What is going on today? That Zircon 1299, yeah. the Tanzanite, all those three mil strands. We've just done... I mean, Kunzite at under 30 quid, which is just madness. And now we're bringing one of the biggest sizes of, of type A pure white jade 
over 500 carats for 149. Yeah, it's just mad. There was just a couple of these available though. You can get hold of this today on your split payments of 49 pounds and 19, uh, I think, well, 90, 66, wow. sorry. Um, well done. Suja, you've got yours. Lanarkshire, you've got yours. Tracy in London, I can see you there as well. We have got multi-buyers getting involved as well. Do you remember on our show, I think it was our last show, or the show before that, we had the ombre cord oh, on the yeah. reels, the oh, purple yes. one. So just take a long piece of that and just knot in between. So every single knot will be a slightly different shade of purple Beautiful. running through. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Beautiful. We've got wow. four chances remaining. But also, what about with the black bicones that mm, we had yes. in the oh, yes. in black jade black bicones? Okay. I think that would yes. look lovely. Ron, I can see you there. Tracy, I can wow. see you there. London, I can see you there. There are multi buyers, so that full quantity can literally disappear in a in a heartbeat. Um, uh, to, that I recall, we've never done this size no, I've never um, seen in, it white in white jade. No. I don't know when it no. was launched. I don't think it was with, with uh, um, Ross and I. I don't think so. Mm. So, um, with, so with mutton fat, you wouldn't get these sort of tones running through the strand, would you? That would be... Well, mutton fat's nephrite. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So this is rarer. So this is rarer, yeah. It's actually yeah. rarer than nephrite. Um, so uh, uh, nephrite is older. Um, oh, okay. Jadeite is younger, but actually far yeah. rarer, right. far rarer right. than nephrite. Well done, everybody. Let's now do the 10 millimeter size. Perfectly matched. Oh, <laughs> from that same parcel, it's got to be. It's gorgeous, isn't it? But the entire boulder would not have had this pure white no, color. No. It would have had areas of different color saturations. Yeah, look at those. Yeah, you have got some definite lavender colors coming through. I love your idea of using those ombre strands to knot it together. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Really yeah. pretty. Yeah. So, so, so pretty. So this, um, is, this is going to low, go lower, is it? Because it's... I assume so, because Ross yeah. is uh, producing, isn't right. he? So, I guess so, and that's just kind of how he rolls. Mm. Big carrot weight, look at it. Natural Burmese pure white jadeite. And to be starting at 499, absolutely amazing. There's a definite lavender color, almost like a, the aqua colors coming through um, on some of these <laughs> rounds. We're at 129, again, madness. We shouldn't be able to get jadeite, and this is very much a Davism, who I know is in Tucson as we speak. Uh, we shouldn't be able to get uh. jadeite for, for, for money that you get out of a cash, uh, cash machine. Hello, Susan saying, um, I think launched on the 3rd of September, 2022. Well, I bought the 10 millimeters um, and they're lovely, pleased oh, with them. Thank you, Susan. Goodness me. So um, what was the 10 mil were? Wow. 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 I don't know. I, I don't know. Like I say, I haven't bought these two air, so I'm not entirely sure. But they have to be some of the biggest, don't they? Those, yeah. those 12 yeah. mils that you saw a few moments ago. Oh, do it, Ross, if you can. Let's do it. <laughs> well, this is the one that we've got the biggest quantity of, of the entire selection. Oh, and in the notes it says no lower than 129. From Wayne. Is it Wayne that's or written Dave. that, though? Oh, Wayne's written this, right. Wayne's on a plane. Wayne is on a plane. <laughs> can you imagine that? Mm. <laughs> There's a movie right there waiting to happen. Yeah. Wayne on a plane. <laughs> Become like a series, couldn't it? Yeah. Wayne at work. <sighs> Ross, you're, brave. you're being brave then. If it literally says yeah. in the notes, never been anywhere near double figures, but we're going to do it today. OK. Um, if there's enough of you, though, if there is enough of you, seven more of you to add it to your baskets, and then we will take it to that double figure price tag. 10 millimetres in that size. Beautifully pure in their natural type A quality of colour. Let's clear the vault, shall we? Oh no. Oh no, really? Yeah, we'll do it. Wayne's on the plane. <laughs> well, he's not actually, is he? Uh, yeah. He's landed, I assume, by now. It's a huge caraway. Is there enough people, Ross? Oh, four more, he says. Straight away, well done, Jane. Three more of you. We will take it to a double figure price tag if there's enough of you there. It is an all time low. <laughs> it is an all time low. We sh and it does even say on our notes not to go any lower than 129. But hey ho, let's do it. Feeling brave today. <laughs> oh, oh, we can't regret it now. It's too late. Too late. Okay, well done. 
Take advantage. Look what the split payments are going to be as well. Ninety-nine, <laughs> ninety-nine. It doesn't have to, Ross. Ross has just said, well, the other two strands, then it has a knock-on effect with those, but it doesn't have to, but I guess you will. Um, 320 carats of this beautiful, beautiful grade. Double figure price tag. Jane's up to a quantity. Well done, lovely. Lorna's there. <coughs> Excuse me, Susan, Essex, London. I can see you there with multiples in your baskets. You will need to check them out. Whilst we had the biggest quantity of your 10 millimeter rounds, Half the stock has already gone. Um, just make sure you check out. We are down to the final 10 of these. £33 on your split crazy, payments. Isn't it? it is crazy. Absolutely crazy. I love this tone, actually. It's really nice. It's so pure, yeah. isn't it? It's so pure. We're over allocated. Yeah, Richard Wise, uh, the author of Secrets of a Gem, Tra uh, Gem Trade, he said, in modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade, he's talking about cabochons here, of a pure white hue with a fine texture and moderate translucency would be the finest of its type. Believe me, that's what you have here, that beautiful purity mm. of color, amazing fine texture. Otherwise, you would see it almost look, uh, um, you'd actually see the markings within the gemstone itself um, and you definitely see that lovely translucency check out your baskets or you are going to miss out on this opportunity the final five well done good luck west midlands good luck to you bristol good luck to you lorna good luck to you susan in essex good luck to you maker in essex who wants six you, uh, we don't have that quantity available um london good luck to you yeah oh you've just got yours well done checking out west midlands you've just got yours as well congratulations i've only got four remaining opportunities three hello caroline uh my four millimeter white jade lights arrived oh. today stunning i'm in love all the more yeah absolutely we've got four mils coming up as well caroline they are beautiful aren't mm. they i'm gonna do the six millimeters and then um, um, and then obviously we'll dive into the four, but they're all very, very, very limited opportunities. Colleen, you can do this. You can take that final one. I'll leave it with you. Congratulations. Right, let's do the six mils. So Mark. Oh, no. Absolutely. Eighth. Mm -hmm. Would this work? It would be perfect. Perfect. We're going to do it in yeah. one price crash because it is very naughty. Very, very, very naughty. It's got a glacial look to it, doesn't it? It's just... 12 in quantity. Totally and utterly natural. That pristine, pure colour. Doing it in one price crash. Let's take it under £100 for you today. Wow. What? Wow. That's that's <laughs> way lower than I was expecting it, Ross, to go. The four mils are coming up as well. It's the last nine chances that we have available. Thank you, Caroline, for messaging in. Um, talking about literally your type A white jade. They are pristine mm, as well, aren't they? Lovely. They? They're lovely. They're, as I said, they've got a glacial look about them, haven't they? They've got this... Yeah, you know when, yes, that's describe. a really good, that, yeah. well, that's perfect, I mm. think. You know when you look at freshly fallen snow and it actually yes. has that, it does. It that has glow slight, about yeah, it. Yeah. It has that amazing quality. The final five opportunities for £69. The four millimetres are coming up as well. Um, I don't know, can we shop ahead on the four mil or is that too risky? You can, you can. Um, your masterclass is coming up as well. You've got amazing kits coming up in your masterclass, lovely jewelry makers. Um, let's do the four mils. Let's dive into those four mils. There are 20 available. They Not absolutely fly out. Might go kiss yeah, cross. Yeah, yeah. That's lovely. <laughs> no. Ross says, do you know what we're going to do, Well, on the last ones? Shall we take it under £50? <laughs> it is a clearance deal. Doing it in one price crash, so first come, first serve. Can't say any fairer than that, lovely jewellery makers. Last in stock opportunities. We, we know it's irreplaceable, don't we? We know we cannot get hold of, of jade of any colour uh, uh, with the current status of this gemstone. Um, so do get it whilst you can. Even the likes of our supplier, Sally Hewer, is saying that they are dealing primarily, primarily in... Um, 
primarily in type B grade. 30, uh, in just under 30 seconds, we are going to do it under £50. Are you ready for this? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. There was just under 20 available opportunities. So, oh, oh, that's so much lower than I was expecting. 49.99 at a push. At a push. Look at how many of you are getting involved. And we have had the most amazing demonstrations. That would be perfect. Perfect, absolutely. So again, take out the bike, Karen, and pop in one of these instead. Amazing. Ah, beautiful. Be lovely. Absolutely yeah. beautiful. Kim, yeah. Caroline, Weldon Chew, London, Pauline, uh, Lorna, uh, June. You, uh, if you check out, it's yours. There was less than 20 available. And I wouldn't be surprised if there's lots of people multi buying, especially if you were tuning in for um, uh, Mark's amazing demonstration in the nine. Well, it wasn't the nine o'clock, it was more the 10 o'clock <laughs> hour, but still. Um, because you could definitely incorporate mm. these in that same technique as well. Less than 20 remaining. Make sure you do check out. We've still got so much more to bring you. A beautiful masterclass. Um, more incredible stones. Sterling silvers galore. We'll be back after this. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewelry Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email 
or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Welcome back, everybody. Are you ready for what will be? We're going to squeeze a lot, aren't we, between now and the, and the one o'clock hour? Masterclass. Oh, my goodness. <gasps> what is this? Isn't that amazing? This is one of the strands that we've got coming up in the 12 o'clock kit hour. It's green zebra jasper. I thought it was opal when I had this, when I looked. It looks this, like um, opal. It's incredible, isn't it? Yeah, so um, we've got that coming up. That's one of the kits. It's beautiful. beautiful. That's so cool. Yeah, it's got that coming up. There's almost a, a chatoyancy yeah. in that. And then you have, oh, yeah. Oh, that's the, the again garnet. the strand that's in. And then we've yeah. also got star garnet. Yes. <laughs> which I can't believe we even do that in a strand, to be honest. In a kit. In a kit. I know. And every single one. I put a picture on my Facebook page and every single one has got the star four and so six, rare. which is quite rare, apparently. Very rare. Which the six, six prong, yeah. And does it stretch mm -hmm. across, does it? Wow. Yeah. Um, yeah. Amazing. These are all coming up in your masterclass, but between now and then we are going to squeeze in some pretty exciting deals. So if you manage to get hold of those amazing strands, I've got two more pieces to bring you. Um, Wayne is uh, in Jaipur right now. Uh, did, he didn't say get these gone, did he? No, I didn't think so. I didn't think so. Oh. Um, but they are last to stock. Now, this is Chantilly lace, so intricately carved. I mean, it blows my mind to even imagine, to entertain actually taking a gemstone, which is physically as hard as steel, and in, mm. in an ancient technique in an abrasive manner creating the levels of intricacy that you are about to see um they're absolutely amazing so this is almost wafer thin carved on both front and reverse with the most impeccable translucency do you notice how it almost literally looks like uh, um almost looks like glass mm. i suppose doesn't it look at that's that incredible literally done by hand I feel like that's, I'm holding it the wrong way. Do you see that almost? Little dainty little flowers, little, little forget-me-nots. So pretty. I had three available opportunities, like Chantilly lace from the House of Suzhou, 
you have this amazing intricate, uh, intricate carving. There's a mixture of abrasive. There's some really lovely, um, uh, really lovely uh, piercing to this to actually go through and without fracturing something that is literally that thin. The final one, the final opportunity, both front and reverse. I've seen these used in so many of our lovely jewelry makers designs. They're lovely in earrings as well, if you can yes, afford, if you can yes, actually yeah. uh, um, stretch to the two. Um, there is only one remaining. So I've got, okay, last of stock, let's bring you the Marquise. Arguably one of the most popular uh, popular of shapes um, in your... I'm sure I saw lovely um, designer Susie wearing these as earrings I'm in a recent I'm show. I'm, I'm sure surprised. it was the Marquise. They're very elegant, yes, aren't yeah. they? And you've got that those natural anchor points. Mm, so yes, that's right. Yeah. Open and close your shepherd hook and away Job you done. go. Yep, yeah. There are 10 available. Again, hand carved, this beautiful natural translucency. Gosh, definite aqua. That's lovely, isn't it? Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. You can get it home for sixteen pounds and sixty-six. The final ten opportunities. It's just mind-blowing to carve a gemstone. Is one thing, and and even you know when we look at all the sculptures and the master carvings that we've brought to air, or, or even in places like uh, um, like Sotheby's or in Bonhams and places like that. I, that. I mean, that's fascinating. But something that is almost paper thin. Mm. It's so fine. I guess the loss of these would be quite significant because of how fine um, the actual gem carrot weight is. It's all totally natural, done by hand. The final few were in single figure quantities. Well done to each and every single one of you. Again, that translucency, that fine texture. But you wouldn't get this skill, I suppose, if the gemstone no, wasn't no. Uh, um, wasn't of that grave grade. Um, okay, yes, I do. These are amazing. Coming up. <laughs> In one auction's time, um, we've got just over 100 of these available opportunities. This is from, from the Cullinan uh, Topaz deposit that we launched some years ago, some years ago, and named literally after the Cullinan diamond because of their pristine, eye-clean clarity. Have you seen this parcel before? I think you and I had it on the show recently, oh. didn't we? Look at this. I love those um, baguettes. Yeah. Yeah, baguettes. Yeah. Some people call them baguettes, some people call them emerald. Emerald. That's emerald it, cuts. Yeah. yeah. Um, wow. <laughs> beautiful. What an amazing parcel. Not long to wait for those. They are coming up. Um, we have over 100 opportunities. Yeah, I agree. The price on these is crazy. It's literally like the beginning of a Bond film, isn't it? Yeah. Looking at that. <laughs> um, okay. Shall we do... Shall we do some Buddhas, a pair of Buddhas? I've seen a Buddha for ages. Ages and no, ages. No. He's the Buddha of happiness. He's a jolly old chap. <laughs> <laughs> and it's if you rub his belly you get happiness apparently so does he i think so does he look at him he's very happy very very happy nice little nice little curved belly look at that level of detail you don't just get the one and we've certainly showed you um and look he's got his little halo behind as well um i think it was in it was in Tucson literally a year ago wasn't it yes, where yes. um pillar and stone actually had one single buddha um, all right, it had a slightly more intense colour, uh, slightly more emerald green, um, imperial green colour than what I have right now. This is definitely white as opposed to green. Um, but his was thousands of pounds. Whereas you're getting not just one, but two beautiful Buddhas. And you're going to get it at a closeout deal. Individually... We have, put, us ourselves, have actually sold these oh. on air at what? We didn't. Forty nine ninety nine. I think they were 69 on launch, sixty nine ninety nine. These are drilled as well, very cleverly, can you see? Direct ang uh, at a 45 degree angle so that when you do wear it, if I turn it that way, oh. you can see, um, it disappears. At ninety nine ninety nine. yeah, that's awesome. You're getting two of these beautiful Buddhas. Hand carved. And we're going to do a closeout deal. A massive closeout deal, says Ross. Okay, I love them. I think they're really sweet. I think they're jovial, and I defy anybody not to smile when you're looking at these. 
The, the Buddha of happiness. In 54 seconds, we are going even lower. Even if you literally were just to put this directly onto a bale and feed it onto a chain straight away. Pillar and Stone had them uh, a year ago over in, um, in Tucson, had the, uh, a couple of the Buddhas. Um, the Buddha like this, I'm fairly sure it was four figures. Um, I remember it being quite an imperial light green, but it was four figures and then some. We're already at 99.99. You're not just getting the one. Here we go, let me move him back again. You do get two, you do get the two. Can you see that there? There we are. And in 20 seconds, we're going even lower. Even lower, massive closeout deal. For natural type A, Burmese jadeite. So commercial, you know, I, I was talking about this with my husband the other day. We were talking about Buddha or Buddhism. Whether you, whether you follow Buddhism um, as a religion or a prophecy or um, you're just like myself, just really interested. Mm. And there's nothing but positive no, thoughts no, associated to, yeah. uh, to Buddhism. But, oh, that's, got, that's silly, Ross. There are only 40, he says. That's... We could literally pass these to our sister channel, put them on a oh chain, gosh. job done. They most definitely would not be 15 pounds each. Ross. This is a proper when the cat's away, the mice will play, isn't it? Goodness me, 15 pounds for something that is literally hand carved by a master lapidarist. We launched them at 69.99. We have the final few. You get both and they are, they, they, they're both being slightly different. You'll probably see a few differences between these two. That's because they are carved literally by hand as opposed to uh, by machine. Here he is. Look, there's the Buddha over in uh, um, on Pillar of Stone. Yes, yeah. he's the same. It's the same sort of figurehead. I think ours is a little bit wider. No disrespect um, to this little Buddha. He's happy. He doesn't mind. And there is the piece of jewellery that was that Buddha sold, right. and it was then for sale um, in a jeweller's at Tucson. They told us uh, Pillar and Stone, Roland Strusel, told us where uh, where he bought it. And we found that piece of jewellery literally a couple of days later. Look at that wholesale price. And it is wholesale, $4,140, <laughs> wholesale price. Mm. So what do you think that's going to be when it actually reaches the jewellers? Exactly, they yeah. do say your gemstones pass through multiple hands before they actually reach uh, their owner. Um, £29.99, pence. goodness me. Roland Schluss will be rolling his eyes if he was to be watching us right now. And that is for the pair of them as well. Vera Jane, Alan, Moira, Mrs. Carol, Janice, new customer, Jacqueline, new customer, uh, Kirsty, Susan, Hertfordshire, Susan in Essex, Elaine in Merseyside. Well done, Tracy, another Elaine. Keep checking out. Well done to you all. Um, yes. I hear Ross say. Let's do... A cotan, yeah, mutton fat, <laughs> as you spoke about it, Mark. Oh my goodness, uh, that's so eye clean, lovely, the cotan. It? Mm. it almost blends into the paper. It's that clean. <gasps> that's, you don't see cotan with that level. Of... It almost blends into the paper. I'm going to have to move it, aren't I? Because <laughs> otherwise you won't see it. I mean, that's a real testament to the quality of the uh, mutton fat that that's you're actually cool. getting here. Beautiful translucency. Completely and utterly natural colour. An opportunity for everybody to own Coten mutton fat. Again, in this lovely, very elegant rice bead shape. 8 by 12 millimetres in their size. If I just flip it for a second, you can see you've got a nice, generous drill hole here. So it'll even go through some of your thicker cords or braids or mm, leathers or something like that. leather, I think. Oh, that'd be nice, yeah. wouldn't it? Literally on a piece of leather. £49.99. So the most expensive piece of jade, be that jadeite or nephrite, um, actually isn't jadeite. It's actually a nephrite. So um, 
what we're looking at right now is Cotan is, is an F, right? So it's actually the original jade. That's what they refer to it as. Um, and the most expensive piece that was ever sold at auction was um, actually Cotan Mutton Fat. And it was millions upon millions upon millions of pounds. If you've ever seen us that piece, which we have shown to you before, you'll notice it's a very off-white colour. It's lovely, yeah, don't yeah. get me wrong. And obviously you've got the history and everything attached to it and the fact that it is you know, beautifully hand carved and, uh, and incredibly intricate. Very small, actually. It's a really small stamp basically used to seal sort of letters with. But millions of pounds. Now, I'm not saying this will be worth millions of pounds. Obviously, I'm not even qualified to vary it, uh, to value it. However, what I am definitely um, happy to compare is how pristine that colour is. Pristine, eye clean, pure white. 39 pounds and 99 pence only. Um, as Ross said earlier on, it's an ideal opportunity for everybody to own some Kotan mutton fat. And yeah, it's the most awful. It's, the, it's an awful terminology, isn't it? Let's be honest. <laughs> but so is pigeon blood ruby. Well, they treat everything as, as nature, don't they? So yeah. that's why they have animal descriptions and chicken, chicken skin. skin. Yeah. It is delicious. Yeah. I agree. It is delicious. But but it's not when we, we tend to romanticize things, don't we, yeah. over here in yeah. the, uh, in the Western societies. But they're more, much more to the point. Uh, coat of mutton fat is this beautiful, pure white color. It's one single solitaire that I think is crying out to go on some leather cord. Um, amazing. Well done. Now we have the last remaining quantities of the Cotan strand. Oh, I picked this one up. I think this is the one. Yeah, I bought this strand. Now, the nephrite, you might struggle to differentiate between nephrite and jadeite. The luster is what gives them away. Nephrite is a little bit more oily looking, and it's not uh, physically, but it's a little bit more, uh, um, usually a bit wetter looking than that of your jadeite. This strand, I have to say, in the, the, the jade fever that we've that we've been enjoying over the past couple of years is probably one of the best, mm, best yeah, good stands. Do you agree? Yeah, Look completely. at that. It's lovely, isn't it? It's a beautiful, beautiful. I see what you mean. It's a, a completely different look, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It's the luster that, yeah. that really you can oh, see. Look. Oh, my goodness. That almost looks like chrysoprase. Look at the quality of the colour. This is the last of the strands that we were launched not that long ago, steeped in history. So when we talk about jade that has been literally my... Um, carved and mined for 8,000 years. It's not jadeite they're talking about. It's, it's, it's nephrite, the original jade. That's gorgeous. The uniformity of this strand as well is amazing. Mm. So again, in the, in the last two years where we've been really enjoying all, all of the opportunities that so many of us have made the most of with jade, an opportunity we've never had before. I, I truly believe this is one of the best strands we've had. There are 11 available. This is one of Dave's amazing strands. 11 is not a, a, a viable quantity for us to keep. I got hold of this as well on the back of that launch. It's like a spearmint green, but look yeah, how it glows. Gorgeous. Here, yeah, all day long, all day long for natural certified type A, light green, like an apple blossom green, Cotan, natural jadeite all day long i think that's a great deal in most places that would be a cheeky deal particularly in the far east four nine nine we're entering into the realms of ridiculous <laughs> knotting this with an 18 karat gold clasp beautiful that is Sotheby yeah. worthy because you have not only the quality of translucency, let's grade it, let's grade it together. We talk about color. Well, this is probably what as close to the imperial like color that, that, that we could possibly bring our viewers here on a, on a shopping TV channel. This is probably as close that we will ever get to those imperial green colors. Then we start talking about the texture and the translucency. Well, they kind of go hand in hand. You wouldn't have the translucency if the texture was coarse. So you can really see, if I was to put a torch, a light source, in fact, let's do it. A light source next to this strand, you will see that each and every single one of those stones literally glows. Here we go. 
Can you see it? <laughs> they literally glow. Natural translucency, natural colour and perfectly uniformed. As soon as I say the next <laughs> sentence, they're going to sell out. That's beautiful. This strand goes under £100, Mark. <laughs> that was very nonchalant. It's mad, isn't it? Yeah. I see what you mean about the, the it looks wetter yeah. than the other. And this is, this is the sort of look and texture of, of the statues you see in all the auction houses and on Antiques Roadshow. And yeah. It's that look. Isn't it's it? much oilier yes. in its like appearance. That. I like that a lot. You can see it once you know when you, if you were to hold the two. In fact, do it when you get this home. Hold the two together. Put your coat on next to your jade, and you will see the difference. I know. Why is there a clock though? Why is, is that what you were looking at yes, me for? Yes. Yes. Why is there really? How many did you say, Ross? Is oh, if there was more, I jo I join. Oh, okay. Um, I only got the one strand. And we're going to match that Dave's amazing deal. I can't believe we're doing, saying this, but it's going even lower. £24.75. I truly think that this is one of the best strands we've actually brought you over the past few years of Jade Fever. You know I agree completely. Amazing. It's like, it, it is like a Chrysopraise green, which Chrysopraise, mm. totally different gemstone. That's like a Chalcedony. But we don't normally use that as a description, do we, when we're talking about um, any of your jades. We are going low. It's the last time that you will ever see it. It's type A grade. That's a great idea, alongside mm. your star garnet. <laughs> that would be lovely with your star garnet. Mm. Perfect combination. Oh, yeah. beautiful. Talk about rarity. Mm -hmm. Rarity in one duo. Make sure you do check out. This is incredibly coming up as part of one's uh, one of Mark's amazing masterclass kits. Ruth and Jane both on the web. Are we having issues on the website? I'm not entirely sure. Um, Sharon, I can Some see you there. Companies. Helen, I can see you there. Susan, I can see you there. Uh, Fun Me, I can see you there. Julie, I can see you there. Chris, I can see you there as well on the web. Check out if you can. If not, speak to our call centre. This opportunity again. I, I, you know, I don't say that lightly. It's generally one of the best qualities um, that I've actually seen of all your jade yeah. strand. Sharon's just checked out on the app. Amazing. Uh, Helen has just checked. There we go. We can see you on there um, on the website as well. Multi buying. It's it's just an incredible, incredible quality of colour. Normally, you know, jade, and I love them all, but, you know, when we talk about green jade, we're talking about much more of a sage-like mm. green, aren't we? Mm. Whereas this is that um, almost spearmint-like shade. £19.75, pence. we have the final few opportunities. Sharon in Hertfordshire, you've got your, sorry, Susan in Hertfordshire. Uh, Julie in London's multi-bought, congratulations. I can see you there, Justin. I can see you there, Ricky. New customer, new customer, and Chris in Somerset. I don't have the quantity that you want, Chris, unfortunately, but if you are wanting to get multiples, I've got two left, so check it out soon rather than later. Amazing, look at that, it's beautiful. Have we if, done these in other sizes, this, this Have style? Have we? They've all we gone, did, but they? they'd all sold oh, out. Right. Oh, yeah. right, right, right. This was the big, why did you want, want mm. some? Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? What colour would you put you with yours? I don't know, a purple, I think. Amethyst, Zambian purple, nice. I think. Yeah, that would be, be lovely. lovely wouldn't it? Although I do like this mm. as a combination yeah. with yeah. your star garnet. Amazing. Now, we've got just oh. sold out. Well done. Well, well done. done this is coming up in a kit, I think probably for the first time ever. First time I've, I've seen it full stop. I've never, I've never seen it before. I've seen it, but yeah. not very often. Yeah. And I don't know about any kit. I'm not no. sure about that. Um, okay. Star by next on. Oh, yes. Here we go. So, uh, last week we did a mega auction mm. um, and we have the last remaining quantity of this. It's absolutely beautiful. Such an exciting acquisition for for anybody that owns it and ultimately for us um, here at, at, at Gemporia. Let me explain why it's described as colour and topaz, and I will do in a few moments' time. Don't miss out. It literally is like the beginning of a Bond film. <laughs> it's up next. <laughs> Seriously, look at this. 
You can you can literally imagine, yeah, can't you? you? Can. Who was it that who who was Bond in Diamonds Are? Was it Sean Connery? Oh, he's the best Bond. Look. Look at that. Yes. <laughs> Natural topaz and a full parcel of. That's amazing. You have your emerald oh, cuts. Look at that. You have your trillion cuts. You have your ovals, your pears. You've got them all in here. We guarantee that carrot weight and we guarantee the most amazing quality. So, why is this referred to as? Cullen Topaz, because you might be thinking Cullen, and I'm, I, that's, we should know that. I think if we're gemstone enthusiasts, we would recognize um, that description. Well, this parcel is named after the Cullen and Diamond. The Cullen and Diamond was discovered in Transvaal, South Africa in 1905, and presented as a birthday gift to Edward VII um, of England. By the Transvaal, uh, in between, sorry, 1901 to 1910, by the Transvaal government. It weighed well over 3,000 carats, making it the largest <laughs> quality rough diamond ever found. When discovered, it was valued at over $21 million in today's money. I almost don't believe that. So, uh, you know what? It's not so much about the pound signs, because ultimately mm. none of us own it, but... Um, I don't believe that. I feel like it should be more than 21 million. Mm. That was then though, wasn't it? No, it's a today's right. money. But if it was, if it was, um, I can't remember what it said now. Let's go, go back a minute, Ross. Yeah. So when it was discovered then in 1901, it, it was, was valued at 21 million in today's money then. I'm so confused by that. Mm. Does that it, make sense? No, <laughs> not to me anyway. <laughs> anyway, let's move on. Despite its tremendous value, the diamond was famously sent by registered post from South Africa to England. The rough stone was then cut into nine large gemstones, each given a name one to nine. And the 96 smaller diamonds, the largest diamond is a 530 carat colour and one, also known as the Star of Africa, which now sparkles in the royal scepter of the British Crown Jewels. It is the largest color, colorless cut diamond in the world. The second largest stone, Cullen and two, is 370 carats in the second star of Africa and was set into the imperial state crown. Let's show you those pieces. There's That's the Cullen the and diamond, there's wow. the rough. That's extraordinary. And here they are, Cullen and one and Cullen and two, in the scepter. Look at that. And in the imperial crown. Now, I have just over 100 available opportunities. And you might be thinking, well, El, you're not bringing me Cullen and Diamonds, are you? <laughs> if I were, which would be wonderful, we would need considerable amounts of money. And security. And security. Mm. We're not going to bring you diamonds we are bringing you though with a similar story a parcel that was acquired and immediately named cullen and topaz because in its rough form we recognized that it was the most pristine rough piece of topaz that we'd ever acquired faceted into a multitude of cuts shapes and sizes included within our gems uh, portfolio included in certain strands not very many though you're about to source the most eye clean topaz that we've offered and, and, and historically the most eye clean parcel that we've ever acquired this is topaz a naturally brilliant forming gemstone so it has more na naturally has more clarity than that of a diamond naturally does but this is perfection examples of I have less than a hundred available opportunities you're getting a multitude of shapes and sizes. And in 60 seconds, we're gonna bring the, uh, the graphics to your screen. Think about, I don't know, setting these into your pearls. Think about all your gemstone setting. Think about your wire work, your CB bezeling, your Incredible. milliput. 
Millipa would be amazing. What about and the, cast? And the cast? Yeah, cast, yeah. I love those guys. I thought they were amazing. <laughs> she, they, they were absolutely <laughs> amazing. And she was just incredible, wasn't she? Yeah, yeah. She was incredible, you know, the skill. And I know so many of you got involved in the kit. Can you imagine these going into your cast pieces of jewellery? Fantastic. How exciting. But also, our lovely Debbie with her sand yes. casting. Well, that would have been lovely as well, wouldn't it? Beautiful. Yeah. You're getting a full parcel of amazing topaz. A hundred available opportunities. Let's do it. Wow. Ten carrots. That's amazing. This is Cambodia, isn't it, you said? Brazil. Oh, Brazil. Oh, this one. Oh, okay. Is it Brazil or is it Nigerian? Oh, Nigerian. Wow. I beg your pardon. Wow. So when it was discovered, I, I, yeah, again, mm. I can't remember exactly what it was. I think it was before my time. But again, immediately, and even, even if it in, in its uh, rough state, like the Cullen and Diamond uh, uh, story, it was recognised straight away how pristine, even in its rough, mm. rough state. Um, you're not getting just one or two here. You're getting the full parcel. You're getting 10 carats off which is absolutely beautiful. So you will get perfect pairs. You will get you know, pairs of emerald cuts, pairs of trillion cuts, um, big statement uh, um, ovals that you could absolutely include into maybe solitaire rings. You've got, I've got looking just here, look, a princess. Can you see that? A princess cut, Cullen and Topaz. Again, normally Topaz is, it's, it, it's, it celebrates a, a far finer um, level of brilliance than that of diamonds ordinarily. So an example of that is when topaz is actually, uh, say, two millimetres in its size, and when diamond is two millimetres in its size, you can um, incorporate more facets into a topaz than you can of a diamond. So it loves to have clarity, loves to have brilliance. If you haven't seen this deal before, we melted the phone lines and the website, didn't we? <laughs> We're going to show you just how good this deal is, even on the first price, uh, price crash. We could stop at 129, you know, we could say, look, that's great, isn't it? You're getting 10 carats, 10 carats. I remember that we spent more time commenting <coughs> on the price that the box they came in could be. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yep. And they come like this? Yeah. Is that how they come? <laughs> huh. Get the box as well. Yep. That's pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. That's our first price I crash. I know, yeah. $19.99. <laughs> Again, much like we said with, the, um, with your deal of the day, with your Kunzai, even if you haven't got a clue what you're going to do with them as of yet, I'd be getting hold of yeah. these because they they are perfect accent stones. Topaz is always one of our um, a favoured gem to uh, accentuate maybe another alter, uh, another coloured stone. But this is Topaz. It's November's birthstone. This is pristine eye clean qual uh, quality. You know, ultimately, when you want, uh, when you look at buying a diamond, you are looking for usually, of course, um, a decolourless flawless diamond mm. that's what you have in the equivalent topaz right now it is pristine eye clean dazzling white we're not stopping at 1999 comes with the box and we're not do you remember when we closed this out? <laughs> I, can't, I can't remember as i said we, we, we mentioned the price of the box 14.99 I can't remember. We're asked, what do we take it to? Oh, no. He says next price, and this isn't the closing <laughs> price, even though he thinks that's where we're all expecting. Oh, he didn't tell me then. Hmm. I wouldn't, I would expect it to be four or five times. No, yeah. let's be honest, that's ridiculous, yeah. isn't it? Even to say that kind of price point, you've got 10 carats of beautiful Cullen and Topaz. Look at how many multipliers mm. are getting involved. So if you do Milliput, if you do Silver Clay, if you uh, set gemstones into oh. your pearls. Oh. Hello, Helen, saying hi, Ella Mark. Mine have just arrived, they're at, they are wow, aren't they? Oh, It's literally fantastic. like the beginning of a Bond film, isn't it? <laughs> it's literally like that. Wow. Uh, hello to Gloucester saying, hi, Elle, Mark and team. Got these when they were first aired. 
Uh, don't know what I will do with them, but they are beautiful. Ridiculous price point. Exactly. It doesn't matter at that price. No, it? it really doesn't. Because we're not even no. stopping at twelve ninety nine, Mark. No. Apparently we weren't even lower. I don't blame you, Linda, for getting five of these. I would do exactly the same. Nuala, well done to you, multi-buying. Claire, well, multi-buying. Pamela, Nicole, Christine, Donna, Alan, Annabelle. Because <laughs> we mentioned the box was three or four pound. Yes. Mm. And then you're getting <laughs> 10 carrots. I love that. I, you don't see the emerald cut very often, do you? No. I love that. You, well, for the emerald cut, let's just focus on this little guy here. I love that. He's not so little. Hang on, come here. Let me turn you around. Just because he's on the end, let's just put him. Just, just, just focus on him. Because he has less facets than mm. you would find in a round, brilliant cut. He has to be the most perfect yeah. example. So, because you have, if you think about it, you can ha you can actually mask flaws in a gemstone mm. behind facets. Um, but there's far less facets, so he has to be. You know, a very, very, very good example to be a, a baguette mm. or a step cut or an emerald um, or an emerald cut stone. We completely melted the phone lines when we first <laughs> launched the, uh, this. We are melting the phone lines right now. And that is because, says Ross, oh, you're a tinker, you are. You wouldn't tell me, would you, Ross, when I asked you the question directly? I don't, I don't, I knew you ignored me. It was it was one hundred percent. I've heard what you said, but I'm not going to acknowledge it. That's it, yeah. Because I asked Ross, I was like, "What did we close these at?" He says it wasn't. Well, now he's telling me. Well, it wasn't nine ninety nine. Do you remember the last time I saw emerald cut? When? It was featured in the wings of the butterfly in the chestnut close collection. Do you remember the first butterfly we launched? Yes, we I do. There with little emerald cuts in the wings. They're lovely. I've not seen, not seen that cut since. It's the, I love it. It's so beautiful, yeah. but you love do need that. to have a top quality stone to be an yes, emerald cut yeah. because, like I said, there's less facets in it. True. Um, we're not <laughs> stopping <laughs> at 9.99. We are going even lower. I generally can't remember. Can you remember? No, I no. can't remember. I thought 9.99 was, but obviously not. I thought, I didn't think that. Obviously, I so many products, that's the thing, isn't it? I don't think I am ready. Are you ready? Named literally after the uh, uh, the Cullinan diamond because of its pristine <laughs> eye clean clarity. Again, seriously, a five of the box. That means you're paying two ninety nine for ten carats of Cullinan topaz. Madness. What is going on? Madness. Uh, do you know? Was it Gloucestershire that said earlier on? Don't know what I'm going to do with them as of yet, but wow. Exactly. I don't know what I'm going to do with mine either, but wow, they are absolutely beautiful. You know, at some point you'll want those perfect eye clean, natural topaz and you want the best possible grade. Of course you do, that money can buy. Well, it's on your screens right now, yeah. isn't it? 7 wow. goodness <laughs> me. Do you know what? In some places that won't even buy you a coffee and a cake. No, certainly not. Went out for coffee and cake with my brother yesterday, paid more than that. <laughs> Definitely did actually. Definitely. Seven ninety nine. Goodness me! Give me ten carrots of beautiful colour and topaz anyway. Uh, any day. Well done. Keep darling through everybody. Still very much available. We only had a hundred wow. of them though, and there's a lot of multi buyers. Congratulations, Mark. We're going to dive straight into your Marvellous. amazing masterclass. I'll pass the kits um, we've been excited about these kits, haven't we? And and and, and forgive me if I'm wrong, but I don't think we've ever oh. done star garnet in a kit before have we i've well, i've definitely not seen it. i've never i've never seen it in the flat i've seen it on screen i think allison had a strand a couple of weeks ago but i've not seen it in the what, flesh in a kit? No, no no on its own oh um what, what are we oh. going to start with ross let's start with the start i was hoping you'd okay. say because firstly here in the studio it will just look like a really lovely strand of garnet and that's because above us we have countless floodlights Actually, f over a hundred different light sources. But if I just borrow, in fact, I'm going to do it, Mark, on your pieces of jewellery. Mm. If I just borrow your bracelet for a yeah, second. Yeah. Um, you will see there we are. an asterism. That's the word. I was trying to think of it. 
Here's that one there, yeah, very no, prominent. Yeah. It's because my torch is here. So, oh, okay. Yeah. So it's literally at that angle. So we've dimmed the lights so as not to confuse the garners. Now you imagine when you're in, you're in uh, your usual environment, mm. you've got sort of, you have one, um, oh, there's a six prong. There's a six, yeah. You can see it just there, can't you? Um, you have one single light source, or maybe the sun outside, one single light source, you will see this amazing, amazing phenomena occur naturally. But they are astonishingly, astonishingly rare, and usually very expensive. To even entertain getting star garnet in a strand, when ordinarily, if you're lucky, you'll get a cabochon maybe so that's what half one of these mm, rounds would yeah, you suggest yeah. look at how strong and pronounced particularly this that's one, another here. one there, yeah. that's purely because yeah. my torch is right there so right. you know it's it, it's literally on the surface um it, it stretches doesn't it right the way across the surface of your garnet um it's just a miracle of nature basically tiny 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 microscopic platelets within your garnet are perfectly arranged so, and they are arranged almost as neat and tidily as you can imagine. So they're all literally lined up beautifully. And because they are also perfectly lined up and tidy inside the crystal structure of this gemstone, that's where you get this mm. phenomenal effect. But it happens yeah, very, cool. very, very rarely. Um, then it's placed into the hands of the most amazing lapidaris. And you might be thinking, well, there's no cutting here. I look at it that there oh, is, okay. because if you cut too much away, you won't see the asterism. Mm -hmm. You cut too little, then again, you won't see the asterism. Um, and you've got that across the entire, entire strand. This is probably, in reality, actually, probably rarer than the likes mm. of many of the gemstones yeah, yes. that we bring. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's lovely. See all those asterisms there? See them all there? They're beautiful. There is a slight graduation, seven to eight millimeters in their size, completely and utterly natural. Please be careful, because I have even seen examples of star garnet where it's been painted on. No, have yeah, you? Yeah, terrible. Oh, no. This is totally natural. The price of this kit, and I haven't even got to the other components, it's far too low for just this strand. Get it for the strand if you're a collector and a connoisseur. There are how oh, many? No. 50. Yeah, it's not going to be any of the other components that make it that limited. It's going to be the star garnet. Oh. But I can't believe we're doing a full strand of this, to be fair. The star garnet measures, in terms of its length, I can't see it on our graphics, 38 centimetre strand. Look at that. It's, see how it follows? The asterism. Ten of these have gone straight away. I haven't even shown you the rest of the kit. They're literally getting involved on the basis of the strand and Mark's beautiful jewellery. I have 50 opportunities. You don't just get that one, though. You get all the other amazing components. You get some really lovely... Heart. Mine aren't. Uh, yeah, I think they've been mixed up. Oh, have they? Yeah. They're that one. No, okay, yeah, amazing. Yeah, yeah. So here we go. You get your yeah. beautiful heart toggles. Thank you, Mark. Um, plus then you also get your lovely rose quartz cabochons, which are in set sizes. So if you do things yeah. like your... Um, and you get the box and the stand. Commissions. Oh. You get the whole lot. Okay. Let me just... Yeah. Rearrange that because that. Yeah. Let me take them out of there. So it comes on the um, within the box yeah. as well. So beautiful rose quartz and of course that lovely a uh, lovely st uh, stand. Genuine rose quartz and Mark. We were only talking about this this morning, weren't we? Mm. Um. Point two five wire. I know. I can't remember the last time I saw it. No, it's incredible. So that's the the main necklace I made. Uh huh. So um, I'm going to show you wow. two variations of the herringbone. So this is the first one I'm going to show, you, which is, makes oh, sense. Oh, look, look at look at that with the wire. wire wrapped, and then I've got one of the little cabochons. So I only use one of the cabochons. It's very elegant, isn't it? Mark, that's yeah. absolutely yeah. beautiful. So this 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 look here has been done with the wire. Yes, this is with the 0.25. Amazing. I'm going to show you um, how to do it with 0.4 as well in the herringbone bangle. 
And here's the bangle there, yeah. just there. Amazing. We're at £70, 69 99 All day long for the garnet, I think that's an incredible price tag. For star garnet, with that level of rarity, like I said, it probably is up there, one of the rarest gemstones that we actually bring to uh, bring to screen. You can get star garnet, you can get star ruby, you can get star sapphire. Normally they're individual solitaires. Um, wow. Yeah, expensive. There's no, no two ways around it. It is expensive because of its rarity. And it is a miracle of nature. You get a full 38 centimetre strand. You get your beautiful rose quartz. You get your two 925 sterling silver gold plated uh, heart toggles. And you're getting 100 metres of your 0.25 wire. All of the above. Can't wait to be able to learn this. We're at 69.99, but. <gasps> wow. Oh, that's wrong on so many counts. So many levels. That's the that's the cabochons and the and the, the toggles. Yeah. yeah, that's these components yeah, maybe. Yeah. yeah, that's what. Yeah. Without a doubt. That there, cabochons of your rose quartz, hundred meters of your point five, uh, uh, yeah, two yeah. five, and then your heart. This strand on its own. I would have said even more mm. than that to be yeah. honest, Ross. Yeah. Ross is saying easily fifty quid. Do you reckon? I'd buy the kit just for the strand. Look at would that, you, you can see you, the stars. I'd say even more mm. for that. There's one other star gemstone that we bought to wear, and I can't for the life of me remember what star sapphire. sapphire. And that's, that's the only star I've seen I didn't need to We have done star existed. sapphire and star ruby, but they're so expensive as yeah, well. And yeah. garnet, they're so expensive. What an amazing deal. Rita, Cheshire, Noreen, London, Christine, Glynis, Julie, Paulie, Maker in County Durham. Mad deal. Even if you just literally say, "Okay, well, I want, I, I want the, I, I want the uh, the garnet." Sorry, um, that's a great deal just for that one strand on its own. Again, make sure you do check out. And any questions that you have for uh, Mark during his masterclass, I've still got two kits to bring you as well. So we've got that really beautiful jasper, um, and well, two different varieties yep. of jasper. Yep. So um, over to you, Mark, and then cue me when right. you want me to bring the other um, so, um, items. So I'm going to show you the. The, um, the single herringbone, first of all, and I'm going to be using rose gold wire. I didn't actually have very many beads left at all because I, I used them all in the jewellery. And what I'm going to use uh, a piece of... Oh, look, yeah. Let's just take a little look at these as well, Mark, because they're absolutely beautiful, oh, this, is, this, this is technique. The, so this is the jasper that we've got coming up a bit later. Right? This is the, um, the zebra jasper, and then we've got the, the, um, the Chinese jasper. But it's just a lovely little technique. And... Yes, yeah, so I'm going to show you how to do the actual herringbone and then quickly show you how to join them on to make a bracelet. Mm -hmm. So I just move that out of the way. Can I pop that this side? Oh, yeah. So I can see I'm not in. There we go, that's better. Okay, so you need all of your tools for this. You need your round nose, your flat nose, and you'll also need your... Sorry, Al, thank you. All right. Okay, so I've got a piece of wire long enough that will make a bracelet. So this is, this is what I'm going to show you. So each of these little components are made separately. This one had more likes than any other piece on my, when, yeah, that's I, cool. when I put this onto Facebook and it's, it's just absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to show you how to make these little components here. So you need a piece of wire, bracelet length and a little bit. Straighten it out. This is, this is one millimetre. We've got a kit coming up with one millimetre wire shortly. And then using pliers we're going to fold away about a centimeter and then we're going to curl it back to make a loop and obviously one millimeter wire is very very tough and even I can't rosary link or do a wrap loop with one millimeter wire and the just an ordinary eye pin is absolutely perfect so that loop on the end there is to take your clasp so there's the loop then we've got the jump ring and the part of our toggle so that's the little loop I'm making at the end there so then what I've done is I've just threaded on a gemstone, just popped it on to the end. And then I've popped on my second one, which I'm going to show you now. So I'm using one of the, the jaspers. As I said, I only had four of these left. I didn't have anything else left. So I'm going to slide my gemstone on. And it doesn't matter where you, you do your wrapping because all you, you, cause you're able to move it. You're able to slide it up and down afterwards. So you can leave that on your one millimetre and then you take a piece of your 0.25, you can use 0.4, you can do it with 0.6 as well, but, but because we had this in the kit, I'm going to use a piece of the 0.5. So this is about 30, 40 centimetres long. So holding our piece of one millimetre wire, we're going to place 
our thinner gauge wire over the top of the thicker gauge and leave about inch and a half overlapping. We're going to take the longer piece and we're going to wrap it underneath and over. And then we're just going to pull the two wires together so they're nice and close at the top. And then what we're going to do is we're going to hold it in our, in our hand with the loop we've just made underneath that gemstone. And then we're going to take our piece of 0.25 and we're going to wrap around the gemstone so it falls on top of, can you see, it's on top of the one millimeter. I'm going to take it behind to the front once, behind to the front twice. Okay, so we, can you see we've got that wire surrounding the gemstone. We're going to turn it 180 degrees and we're going to do the same. So you always, always, whichever, whenever you move your, your wire around the, the, uh, the thicker gauge, if you're doing it underneath and over twice, you do the next piece underneath and twice. So you're always going to follow in the same direction, otherwise you won't get in the herringbone. So we're going to take our, our wire around the gemstone. And can you see now that it sits on top of the two coils that we previously made? And then we're going to go round once, round twice. We're going to turn our wire around. And can you see now we've got the wire surrounding the gemstone both sides. So not only now do we have to make sure that when we do our wrap loop, we do it above the gemstone, we have to make sure that our next piece of wire sits behind the piece that's already there. Okay, so you're just going to place it behind the wire that's there, make sure it goes on top of your one millimetre, round the back to the front once, round the back to the front twice, turn it 180 degrees, round the back of the wire, once and twice, turn it round, next. And I did this 12 times, so I'll quickly go through this. If you follow it back on YouTube afterwards, and you can pause it. So that's, that's five, and then let's make sure that little tail gets out of the way. So again, you, it's always the wire falls behind the wires that are already there. And you can see now that the herringbone is starting to form because the wires are sitting above all of the coils you're making on the one mil wire. Once and twice. Spin it round. This is number seven. So once and twice. All the way around, 180 degrees, behind the wires. Then we're going to go over the top once and twice. Spin it round. You don't have to do it 12 times. I think you want, you want a minimum of 10. But I think because I'm using a, a finer gauge, I'm going to do the 12 moves. So this is, so I've got two left. So spin round. One, two. And then we're going to go round. So this is number 11. And then we'll do number 12, all the way around. Okay, so before I cut all the wires off, I'll show you how it looks. Okay, so you can see now we've got, so that's the top of the herringbone. So mm -hmm. you can see it sits nice and flush. And if I flip it over, it, it's hollow. Can you see? You can see yes. the, the little gaps around it. So all we're going to do now is we're just going to go in. You don't have to do anything with that shorter wire. It's going to go in with our flush cutters and cut it nice and close. And then, because we've wrapped it round twice on here, all I need to do is make sure that we bring it just half a turn so it sits underneath our one millimetre wire. Give it a trim and then just go with our pliers just to give it a little squidge. So that's your herringbone. And then all you're going to do is you're just going to slide it all the way along up to the edge. So you put your bead, oh. then you slide up your herringbone, then you take your next bead, then you do another herringbone. So it doesn't matter where it's positioned on your, on your one millimetre wire because you're able to slide. So if you look at this bracelet, can you see I've got, this is from the next kit, so we've got the little jasper, and then I did the herringbone I've just shown you, slid it up to the end, popped another bead on, then did the next herringbone. So I've done one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, of the herring bones and eight of the gemstones. And you can see they revolve as well. So they're very tactile. Really nice. I you know, love this really technique. Ne really Mark. neat. If we're using 0.4 wire, 
or yeah. 0.6. Don't go around twice, just go around once okay. and then bring it around to the other side once. Otherwise your herringbone will be about an inch long. Yeah. It, it, it won't um, it be as effective. Okay. So that's your first herringbone. And I guess that's why you've got 100 metres in, in, yes. in the 0.25 yeah, wire absolutely. so that you can yeah. really invest, uh, um, that's right. you know, Yep. Use as much as you wish. Um, shall we bring you another kit? Yep, and I'll set up for Shall the we? Yep. Um, do you want to do... It's, well, which one do you want to do? Well, let's leave the zebra to last because it's beautiful. It is beautiful. I agree. <laughs> I agree. Let's go with that. this one then. Yes, the one that got yeah. the most likes. One that got the most likes. So that's, Most likes on Facebook. Uh, shall I bring it across? Would you like to yes, see Yes, please do. There? So again, you're getting 100 metres of your 0.25 wire just here. This is a, a really pretty uh, variety. You've got frosted jasper here in your 8 millimetre round. So really lovely matte texture. I mean, the pieces of jewellery. Wow, Mark. Absolutely gorgeous. There we go. Just gorgeous. Amazing. So there's that bracelet. You've just literally learned the demonstration too. Um, so there's the rose gold wire. Plus then you're also getting some lovely cabochons um, of blue lace, which I assume you can incorporate in the same way. So what I've done, if you, I've made a pendant with all five. Oh yes. And, and the technique that I'm about to show you now, all I've done is I've done the, the macrame herringbone and I've actually glued. Yeah these little cabochons into position. So really nice, because I I'm, not, I don't, I'm not very good at wire wrapping and weaving and things like that. But, but you um, know what? But you can incorporate Professional it. Professional jewellers yeah. use glue, so. Yes. It's really, it's, I mean, it's, it's, I it's really wait. safe. I mean, none of them are gonna drop off or anything. Plus, you've got all your toggles. They're beautiful All toggles. your lovely toggles. Yeah. We're at 49 pounds and 99 pence. Again, you've got some really lovely frosted sage, sesame jasper, so really nice texture. It's quite, it, it's almost like, I don't know, like blueberry dustings, I think, across the oh. side of this gemstone. <laughs> um, at 49.99. Wow. Oh, my word. That's really? very good, isn't it? You've got three of your toggles, plus your sesame jasper, plus the 100 metres of your 0.25, and the queen of agates in your blue lace, which is completely and utterly natural. You've got eight, nine, and 10 millimetres in their size. I mean, I, again, wow. uh, uh, Facebook is a really good gauge, I guess. You know, if you yeah. were a retailer and you got lots of likes on that one piece of jewellery, you yeah. would assume that that was going to be yeah. probably one of the fastest sellers. Yeah. You know, you wouldn't celebrate it like this, would you, for 20 quid? No, 45, 50 pounds. Amazing. Like well. Yeah. And you could make multiples of those. Yeah, so so the you? necklace, it's exactly what I've just shown you, but all I've done is, is I've made a loop at one end, made my herringbone, cut a centimetre of wire, made a, an eye pin loop, and then just rosary linked in between in between the yeah. So I've got rosary linked, then a herringbone, and then a rosary So linked. cool. So lovely. And you could probably so make cool. each of those herringbones in about three or four minutes, so it's not a long Yeah. That's beautiful, Mark. I love that idea. I hadn't noticed it actually from the distance mm. of the uh, table. Yeah, no, it's lovely. Amazing. Again, proven to be very, very popular. I've got one more kit, possibly going to be the most popular kit of them all. That gemstone is extraordinary. It is beautiful. <laughs> it is beautiful. Yeah. How many do we have of these then, Mark? We had 50 of each of these kits, again, with this really lovely... I'm amazed at 19.99 that they haven't sold out already. You'd pay 19.99 for the blue lace yeah, agate. Would. Yeah, on its would. own because it is a considered gemstone especially given the fact that its availability has uh, dramatically diminished um well done and strands of jasper like so again a technique i remember the first time that you actually demonstrated this kind of herringbone look mark and it is just so yeah. elegant it does remind me of like the all-seeing eye it does yeah no it's very especially quite, quite an this egyptian next look doesn't it yeah, yeah. definitely yeah. got that vibe back to you mm. if you're ready okay so i'm going to show you and I was asked, I'm actually going to show, where is it, the little garnet, there we go. This one here, which is um, a take on the flat, on the square knot macrame technique. But again, this is, this is one of the bracelets that I was sort of became known for about 12 years yeah, ago. Yeah, I remember, <laughs> I remember you making me one. So this is, this is the herringbone brangle, we called it, because it's not a bracelet, it's not a bangle, it's sort of in between. In between. So we've called it the brangle. And as I said, it's a take on the square knot macrame, which is one of the one of the simple knots you can do. But it's just the way the number of threads and the positioning of the beads that gives you this amazing look. So I'm going to I'm going to show you that. So on my board, I've got the last three jasper that I had from the strand, and I've got a piece of my one millimeter wire. And yet, and again, once you've done your bracelet, you will cut 
maybe a centimeter from the end and just do a, an eye pin loop because as, as I said, I don't think even I can wrap loop one millimeter wide. No, really. it's, pretty, it's pretty, pretty strong. strong yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's going to be what we call your lazy strand. I've only got three beads on, but um, I think for the bracelet, I think I put 13, something like that. Okay. But, all, but put, put lots of beads on. And then if you think that it's getting long, just take beads off before you finish. So that's an easy way of doing it. 13? 13. 13. Yeah. Marvellous. Oh, okay. Well remembered. Then you need to cut three pieces of either 0.25 or 0.4. So I'm going to show 0.4 for demoing so you can see it. And you need, each piece you'll need to be about a metre long, so 100 centimetres. And we're going to attach all three wires under, oh sorry, on top of our one millimetre wire with a simple square knot. So the left of a knot and then the right of a lot. And we've shown square knots many times on the show. So, okay, so I'm going to do my left hand side, then my right. And there you have your square knot. Use the slots in your macrame board just to keep the wire separate. That's the first one. And then we do exactly the same with the second. And the knotting will go underneath the one that we've already placed. I'm being really distracted over here, Ross. <laughs> we've got the most amazing, no, 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 we've got the most amazing cross-stitch show coming up on The Hobby Ooh. Maker. And as you know, I am a massive, massive cross-stitch addict, so I'm, <laughs> I keep being distracted. Stay tuned then, yeah, watch us yeah. channel from one, one o'clock. Yeah. Okay, that's your second wire. Again, use the slot, and then we're going to do our third wire. You can do four, you can do five, but I think three is, is a really nice amount to use. You get that really nice herringbone pattern. Okay, so this is our third. Obviously, I'm using shorter lengths just for the demoing. Okay, so that's one, two, and three. So that's your three square knots attached. Now, I'm using wire today, but you can do this in cord as well. You can do it in leather, all sorts of materials. Okay, so that's your three knots attached at the top. So first of all, we're going, now this is, this is what it's known as. This is the naked herringbone. Okay. Because it, it doesn't include a gemstone. So you have your three sets of wires. Okay, just separate them so you can see. And what we're going to do is we're going to treat these three knots now as a bead. So I'm going to take my first set of wire, which is at the top, okay? And you always go to the top every single time. So we're going to take our top two wires. And this is why the slots in your macrame board are really invaluable. And we're going to jump over knot two and knot three mm -hmm. and tie a square knot. So in effect, those three knots you've just made become a bead and you're, you're caging the knots in. Okay, so that's one. Again, use your slots. Then again, we're going to always from the top over the next two sets. So that's your first knot and your second. So all of the knots that we're going to do are going to be in sets of three. And once you add the gemstones, which I'm going to do in a second, you'll be able to see that in action. And then our final and third set. Again, it's always the top over the next two sets. Okay, and then we're going to do our next set. Okay, so that's our herringbone. So we're going to bring you the next kit, and then I'm going to show you how we cage the beads and actually get the herringbone pattern to work. Okay, um, this is the strand. This is. It is. A, a, oh, that necklace, Mark, is absolutely. I would pay. Beautiful. I would pay couple of hundred pounds for that strand. You've never seen anything like it. It's just... It's absolutely beautiful. It's otherworldly, oh, isn't it? It's, like, it's got labradorescence in it. It's, so I can't explain it. It's the fact you almost look like you have a river of chatoyancy running Well, I thought it was opal. Yeah. When I, when I, I, had to, I had to phone Alice and find out what it was because I thought there'd been a spec error. Can you see that? But it's just amazing. But when you get... If I put it on the back yeah, of my hand, yes, you can see yeah. right now. When you get close, each and every single yeah. one. No, that's not, is it? Each and every single one, you've got this beautiful, 
beautiful chatoyancy oh, running yeah. through. This is a variety of jasper, much more limited quantity. And they yeah. do have a level of chatoyancy, they though, do. Mark, Every don't single they? one. So this is green zebra jasper, it's known as. Never seen it before. No. There it is. Look, it's labradorescence. See that there? Yeah. Watch, watch this one here. It's got labradorescence. Yeah, look, it's gorgeous. How amazing. <laughs> 10 millimetre yeah. rounds, plus then you're getting... Ha what? I know. I didn't even use any of mine from the kit. Look at the quality of the emeralds. Mm. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Genuinely, mm. I don't mind admitting this, I actually thought they're that good, I actually thought they were onyx. Ah. When I actually picked them up, I thought they were onyx. Which I can understand being in yeah, a kit. Yeah. But to actually have what five, a parcel of that size, that's unbelievable. Um, plus then you've got ten meters of your one millimeter wire. So this is perfect for your for your lazy and yeah. you're holding wire ready for your herring bones. Yep. Amazing. And you've got your toggles, which you know, you you get you always need toggles, don't you? You get five of those as well. We're at $39.99, but that strand is a definite headliner, isn't Gorgeous. it? Gorgeous. Yeah, absolutely. My favourite Jasper ever. Is it? And I like my Jasper. You love your Jaspers. <laughs> yeah. Is it? Is this like your new yeah, absolute yeah, favourite? Yeah. Look incredible. how cool it is. Yeah. No, it's amazing. Like you said, it's got these rivers running around the gemstones. Yeah. Look at that. It's fascinating, isn't it? It reminds me a little bit of, you know, Window Opal, where you have, because yes, I've always said yes. that looks like another planet. Mm. You've got these fascinating, oh, amazing, thirty nine ninety nine, wow, lovely jewellery makers. Plus, you're getting your um, your emeralds, a parcel of emeralds, and your wire, and also your lovely toggles. Back to you, Mark. Okay, so we've done our herringbone with the three square knots, and all we're going to do now is we're going to start doing our beaded herringbone. So we take our first gemstone, which yeah. we've already got on our lazy strand, going to push it so it sits underneath the knots we've just made. And again, we've got our three sets. And as I've just mentioned, you always take the top set first. Mm -hmm. So make sure we don't get any cross threads, any cross wires. So I'm going to put them in position. So all we're going to do is we're going to take the top set. Now we're going over the next two knot knots that we've made and the gemstone. We tie our square knot. Okay, so you can see we, we cage the bead. Like so. And then we take the next set. So once you've got the gemstone, there's a space in between the wires so you can see where you are. Again, it's always the top set. So we're going to bring the top set of wires down over the gemstone and the knot we've already made. Cage it nice and tight. And you can be quite strong with the 0.4. If you're using 0.25, um, just be a bit gentle with it. We'll take that underneath and cage that. And then we're going to take our third set, which is the only set that we've got left, so we know it's the right. And then we're going to cage, we're going to cage that nice and tight. So that's one, two, three. And then all we're going to do then is we're going to take up our next bead, top, middle, bottom. Next bead, top, middle, bottom. And then when we come to finish, if I bring the, the completed bracelet over, just take out the, so there we go. So do you remember at the beginning, we did three square knots, then we did a herringbone without a bead, then we're going to do our herringbones all the way down, so you can see holding the gemstones in position. We do our three that we had with that herringbone, with that, that bead, we do our three square knots, and then we do one set of herringbone. The two upper sets of wires, we flip the bracelet over and we cut and we squidge. The set of wires that we have nearest to the end of the wire, we wrap one all the way around in one direction, the other wire backwards in the other direction all the way around, flip it over, cut them off, and then just give them a nice squidge. And again, I've wrapped, I've just done a simple eye pin loop at the end and a jump ring and my clasp at the end. So both the herring bones, if you look back after, after the show on YouTube, this one probably is a lot more work because you've got three lots of wires to contend with. Um, but it's, it's simple square knot macrame, but you can see how effective it is. 
Once it's you get beautiful. once you get those beads, in, in, you get caged, and uh, I think well, you it's would a always think technique. that it had been uh, sort of set into yeah, precious no, metal, absolutely. wouldn't you? That yeah. gorgeous setting. So that's two variations of the herringbone: one with one wire and one with three. So beautiful. it just shows completely different. Amazing. Perfect. Thank you so much. Pleasure. And Pleasure. a brand new favourite strand. Yes. It is gorgeous. Yes. Um, again, make sure you send your photographs of your wonderful creations. Now, um, let's give you some wire deals just because Mark's been bringing ah. you this amazing, um, amazing masterclass. Now, we've got some of your essential gauges. We rarely ever amazing. get to bring you wire. We rarely ever do. Um, so make the most of these little bundles. Um, right now, starting with your the most popular colour, it is silver plated. Uh, copper, you get the pair for £4.99. Well, um, the, the reason that, that um, Ross and I have put these together is in the kits you had your one mil yeah. and you also had your 0.25. And as okay. I've mentioned, you can you can do your herringbone in your 0.25, your 0.4 and your 0.6. There you go. <laughs> so you, you you had a little word with Ross. Yeah, yeah. This has uh, all, all been organised pre-show. Amazing. Just so you could do the herringbone in all three sizes. Yeah, because I guess you wouldn't be able to do it with the 0.4, would you? No, and really. at £4.99. pence. For both. For that's both. That's ridiculous. Do you remember when spools of wire, just one of them was? more than that yeah yeah when yeah. i first started it was it when was, i started yeah, as well yeah. no you know amazing. now we're talking about 4.99 yeah. for two of our most popular yeah. gauges 0. 0.6 and 0. 0.4 so this also includes things like rosary linking so you can do your rosary linking in your 0. 0.6 which we know is the best gauge for rosary linking you can macrame in your 0. 0.4 and your 0. 0.6 all you need is a stronger gauge for your lazy wire so your one mil or your, yeah. you could even use 0. 0.8 for your lazy if you wanted to as well but yeah. these are your two Perfect gauges for, for, for wire macrame. Go yeah. to's. Yeah. Tons of you there. This is our number one most popular colour always. Let's bring you the gold colour. And again, I would be stocking up your stashes, even if you don't consider yourself to be a wire worker. You always need your wire, don't you? So, ah. that, so that's on memory wire using the, the star garnet again. So all I've done is I've um, used my gizmo coiler with the wire, with the 0.4 to make these long coils. They're inch and a half. And then I've just popped them on my memory wire with a gemstone in between. Awesome. How beautifully elegant that is. So lovely. Yeah. Again, 10 metres um, of your gold coloured silver plated, 4.99. Um, keep on dialing through. Let's now bring you the rose colour. So that, again, you're going to need these if you want yeah, to recreate right. Absolutely. Uh, Mark's amazing yeah. pieces. So 0.4 and also your 0.6. I mean, the necklace that is behind your wire there is in silver. Imagine what that would look like in gold. Ah, oh, beautiful. Oh, yeah, incredible, it'd be wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. Four ninety nine, amazing. Again, nice little additions to stock up your stash on. Um, rosary link. There's only twenty left of this one, though. Is that right? So you said. Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, there's a limited quantity. I have a hundred of each of these uh, little bundles, but check out the website or speak to our call centre. Um, it's always worthwhile getting getting it's wire. Hard, I'm it? rubbish at wire work. Absolutely yeah. rubbish, but. You can make eye pins out of it, can't you? Absolutely. Absolutely. And as I said, rosary linking, which we did last week on the show. And then we, we've got wire macrame with 0. 0.6 and 0. Yep. 0.4, best gauges. Yeah. They're amazing. Ooh. There's only a limited quantity of this. This chain's beautiful. <gasps> oh, look at this. This Can I borrow this a second? Yeah, yeah. Is that yeah. all right? Take that off. Yeah. Uh, I'd put it back, though, straight after. I don't want to... Oh, my goodness. We launched it not that long ago. Diamond cut and then some. Look at how beautiful the luster is on this one. Literally, oh, and you're not quite seeing it. Hang on a sec, let me just put... Just so beautifully reflective. Um, as as wow. described, diamond cut is exactly that. You've got mm. every single one of these beautiful 9 to 5 sterling silver facets. Um, oh, uh, creating this sunburst effect. This flew out the other day, wow. 9.99. <laughs> <laughs> for a beautiful 20 inch i don't want to call this a chain it's a necklace isn't it it's a lovely necklace you you wow. don't have to include anything no i wouldn't add this. anything to this no, at all me. no not at all nor me 9.99 the final 20 opportunities jewelry makers make sure you do check out beautiful absolutely beautiful you know when it, uh, when when you see um a chain stroke necklace and literally you can immediately see there's something a little bit more um, there, there's more to it there's more to it um, and that's down that wonderful kind of sunburst like effect uh, leaving those last few with you amazing 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 um okay yeah i've got one more strand that i can bring to you and that guess what <laughs> beautiful Ross, did I you not know it was on my tiva i love q oh and me <laughs> there are only 20 type a burmese oh, jadeite 
What is it about cubes that you love? I just love them. I mean, they're, they're great in masculine pieces. Yep. I love the fact that they're completely straight on either side. So again, from wire macrame, they're fantastic because oh, the gosh. wire hugs. And for even for herringbone, the, the first version I showed you nice. with the wrapping, amazing with a cube. Just one on a head pin, yeah, I yeah, think yeah. would look really cool. Yeah. Rosary linked again, perfect. 420 carats, oh my Oof. goodness me. Wow. This is just, <laughs> just, just too low, that is. Uh, just far, far, far too low. Again, certified completely natural. We've been completely transparent and said, you know, it's irreplaceable at the prices, even a sensible price. I say sensible because this isn't sensible. <laughs> it never was. Never, ever was. No. If I had the time, I would obviously sort of go into, you know, the fact that the mining is now closed, you know, the remaining uh, jadeite that's available within the market is sort of old jadeite. Even our own suppliers, the likes of Sally Hewer, is saying, look, we have to deal primarily in type B and C. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're going to upload as many options as we can, literally, of the wire, by the way, to our website so that you can get hold of those as well. Um, so do check out the website, all the W's at jewellerymaker.com. What an amazing morning show it has been, Mark. Thank you Thank so you. much. Thank you. It's flown by today, hasn't it's it? It's gone so quickly and I've loved every single <laughs> demo and piece exhausted. of jewellery that you've created. So I'm back on Friday. Yeah, unfortunately I can't yeah. be here Friday. So I've got lovely Vix from Sewing Street. She's going to be joining me on Friday, so that'll be nice. Not worked for her for ages. Yeah, lovely, That's going to be lovely. It's going to be good. So I'll have a good show on Friday. And I'll do your little orb justice, I promise. I've got that on a Malachite oh, show on Friday. Oh, lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Um, we'll see you soon. Take care, everyone. Have a lovely afternoon. Uh, make sure you check out the website. We'll see you after this.